So, hello everyone. Let me, let me unmute you, Dan. Hello everyone. <laughs> Good afternoon. It's evening, isn't hello. it? Hello. <laughs> uh, it's morning, if you ask me. It's morning? Okay, okay. It, it's, yeah. <laughs> I'm a very international man. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Paranormal Instigator. Okay, so... There are so many of you here. I'm not even sure if I could say hello to everyone right now. But a very special thanks to those who gave donations and give subs. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you, Killer Bear Squid, for following. <laughs> so I am here with Dan Video Games at the moment. Hello. <laughs> How are you doing today, Dan? I'm doing pretty good. I had one and a half energy drinks, which means I'm mostly awake. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is a mood. I'm sure there's a lot of people who could relate to that. <laughs> and I'm sipping, now that I'm past that, I'm just sipping on a diet, Arizona diet green tea. I, I like the diet green teas. The normal it's... ones are so sugary, but I don't know. Let me Let me boost the Discord a little. Okay, that no, should do actually, it. No, actually, you know, you don't, you don't need to boost that. I can just cup the microphone. We can do this, and then I, every time I talk, I can sound like that. Hello, everyone. Uh, actually, I, I boosted it. They can, they can hear you just fine now. <laughs> Video games. <laughs> Video games. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. So today is my birthday, and I can only thank all of you guys who are giving me gifts so much. Yeah, he's a PNG tuber right now. <laughs> Welcome to VTubing, Dan. Thank you, Immortal Hello. of Thunder, for following. <laughs> thank you, Gigaboots, for raiding with a party of two. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, wow, thanks, Gigaboots. Wow. <laughs> Is it, is it gonna double raid you one moment? What is going on? <laughs> double raid? Is that is that a thing? Yeah, Multi-track raiding? I clicked back to the window <laughs> where I was telling it to raid you, and it's like, okay, I'm gonna do it in seven seconds. I'm like, you just did it. What are you doing? Let me put on some backing music because this is this is straight to quiet. There we go. Yeah, that's a good song. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Thank you, Duane04, for following. Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> bow, bow, bow. See, I don't have an automaton, so I have to make sounds with my mouth. Yeah, I haven't learned how to use it yet. <laughs> Two Vikings walk into a bar. They are both raiding. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Jam Van, for following. So there's going to be a couple more guests to the stream. They aren't ready yet. Oh yeah, I guess the, the stream would have to wouldn't pick it up that easily, huh? Let me let me see if I can. Yeah, there's a zero percent chance that the stream wasn't picking that up now. Thank you, Yipsagoon, for following. Thank you, Robe Robe BLB for following. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't have an automaton emote yet. <laughs> There's so many out there, and I think I know who made some of them. So. <laughs> you just might be able to wrestle one up. You could say that. You could say that. Man, Dan. I haven't seen you on anyone's streams in, like, ever. It's an honor to have you here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I just... Well, that's very nice of you to say. <laughs> I, I just imagine... How do I put this? My mental self-image, uh, if I were in the Matrix, is I look like Keanu sitting on the park bench. So <laughs> I just imagine someone saying to him, it's an honor to have you here on the park bench, sir. <laughs> but yeah, I think the last time I guessed it on someone's stream, 
I think I invaded a Vox stream very late and uh, Dot was there too. And I convinced Vox to play Kid Clown and Crazy Chase. <laughs> Kid Clown uh, and Crazy Chase. <laughs> yeah, because Vox was like, what's a what's a short game that I won't be, you know, stuck in wanting to play for a while? And I'm like, oh, I know one. Everyone hates it but me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dot says she remembers that. The one slur. <laughs> yeah, the <laughs> one slur was there. <laughs> I remember that. I remember it was that. Really good. But yeah, aside from that, um, I think the last time I co-hosted a stream was with uh, Giluria, who uh, was playing through Mi Michigan Report from Hell, uh, <laughs> which was a delightfully strange game. Oh, I believe it. So I was l lucky enough for you to put this lady enough in the day where I'm actually awake for this stream because that stream I felt like I was dying. Oh no! Well, He's you you were dying. You see, that was that was actually um, <laughs> that was the part where you see your life before your eyes. Uh huh. And my, then my life was so PS2. Exactly. You you you're you're uh, <laughs> you ended up in PS2, but then. Somebody resuscitated you, so you're back here, unfortunately, in the current gen. I, 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 I want to go back to fix shader functions. I don't like all this ray tracing. <laughs> all this DLSS. <laughs> okay, this is, uh, is going to be my nerdy bit. Hey, Sara. Yeah? Did you know that the devs at Insomniac, creators of Ratchet & Clank, were so incredibly optimistic about how strong the PS3 would be? that several programmers, graphics programmers around the office were like, we'll never de need to normal map anything again. We'll just do it all in geometry. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> oh, good Lord. <laughs> they have so many quotes like that from the first year of making PS3 games. They're like, well, every computer in the office needs eight gigs of RAM because obviously the PS3 is going to have a lot. <laughs> oh no, eight gigs of RAM? That's... <laughs> Did the PS3 have that's... that much? No, the <laughs> had five twelve split in half. Anyways, I'm done nerding up the stream. Sorry, ever. <laughs> I enjoy it. I enjoy it. <laughs> also, I just, I just want to know. I appreciate all of you in chat. It is great to see all of you. I know I haven't been saying individual highs. I've just been a headless chicken today. So I appreciate you being patient with me like this. <laughs> so. I think I should oh. really, huh? Oh, I was just gonna say hi, Shibuyagato. I saw Shibuya in chat. Yeah, hello, Shibuyagato. Uh, oh yeah. If, if, I, if my life was trapped in seventh gen, that'd be terrible. I'd have input lag on all my limbs, and everything would run at like twenty-five frames per second. <laughs> thank you for the follow, Prestophobia. And thank you all so much for. <laughs> thank you all so so much for all the birthday wishes. Thank you, Solaris Knight Seven, for following. And you know, I'm getting close to the big 1.5, I think. Thank you for following, Doll Clock Heart. Oh, I was gonna pull something up, and then I got completely distracted by all of the. Bollocks. You know what they say: the more, the merrier. Let me copy this <laughs> the scene. And <sighs> so. I promised all of you guys a top 100 game list. And I did make one. I'm not sure how you guys will think, uh, feel about it. Maybe I'm a little bit too normy on something. But I think I have some interesting days regardless. <laughs> Chat starts booing somehow. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like they find the soundboard that nobody knew about. Thank you, Nobutron, for the follow. Let me bring up this list. My number one is Live Alive, because of course it Die, is. You should monster. all play Live you Alive. Don't in this world. Is, is that the original or the remake or both? Both. Definitely oh, the wow. original, but like the, the remake is pretty much the same game. Like There isn't that much intrinsically different about it or anything for me to rate it differently, honestly. That's awesome. I, yeah, uh, it's so good. That 
that is actually coming out on PC and uh, PS5 next month? Actually? So that's... Yeah. Actually, it's coming out Thursday. Oh, it's Thursday? Maybe my dates are based on when certain application windows end and not when things come out because I'm already overburdened. Thank you, Skyfire Hero, for the follow, and thank you. <laughs> just just thank you all. Thank you. Thank you, Mass TSS, for the gift sub earlier as well. I'm I have lost track of things. I am so sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, April twenty-seventh. But yeah, I decided that I would allow Steinsgate to be on this list, even though it's a visual novel. And I think it deserves a very high place. It's an extremely well-written game, even if it is a novel. But beyond that, I didn't really make many allowances, especially like that. I just went with my gut. <laughs> the dating sim is good, CJ. It's good. <laughs> and yeah, like, Dan, you have anything to say about all this? <laughs> I was, I, okay, a friend let me uh, Steins Gate uh, years ago, and I haven't watched it yet, and I'm like, I, I need to, I need to know, like, if the game and stuff, if I jive with that. It is really good. It is one of my favorites. Do you like time travel stuff? I used to, but then I watched me? every Terminator film. <laughs> you watched every Terminator. Oh no! <laughs> well, the thing is that I'm just kidding. Um, I do like I do like time travel stuff. Well, good. Myself, I'm a huge fan of time travel, and I think you can kind of see that in my list because Chrono Trigger is right up there, and so is Steins Gate. And like, yeah, I just I am a huge time travel fan, and. Steins Gate is one of the best time travel pieces of fiction I have ever experienced. I did, I've been thinking about it somewhat recently, and I do think it's weird that we haven't had many time travel RPGs, I feel like, come out anytime recently. Maybe yeah. I missed out, but I no. think that's really strange because one of the like maybe i'm just dumb but it feels like modern tools could be really good at taking <laughs> like an environment and doing two different eras of it i mean i'm basically with you look at this this is funny i didn't mean to do this <laughs> i was like i was like okay sitting here there are two stars on stream this could be worse <laughs> yeah exactly there could, two, there could be two me's on stream that would be terrible <laughs> I noticed Mega Man 5 is there. That is a good Mega Man. Yeah, it it actually is. Like, I've got both Mega Man 5s there, which I think is kind of a controversial thing with some people, but obviously the NES one is way higher. My favorite Mega Man game is Mega Man ZX, but I am not a huge fan of anything else Indie Creates made. Oh, wow, really? I, I'm surprised because I haven't heard somebody who likes ZX that much, but then didn't like the others. I normally listen to or hear about like people who like Zero like ZX as well. So what what is um what is the thing about ZX that differentiates it for you? Well, it's got a memorable set of characters, and they don't constantly turn into idiots during scenes. It's got. That sounds like it would be helpful. It's got a really well made world compared to a lot of Anti Creates other Metroidvania efforts. Like, they've done a bunch of attempts at stuff like this, but pretty much all of them have fallen flat except ZX, in my opinion. Like, you've got Zero One, which pretends it's a Metroidvania, but then it's also completely mission based. And, yeah. you know, and then you've got ZX Advent, and, like, ZX Advent tries to be a good sequel to ZX, but basically forgets everything about good level design. My favorite model from ZX is definitely Model HX. I really enjoy using it. Okay, so I have a question. Yeah? Uh, can you say the full title of 22? Full title or of that... 22. 
Esprayed. Okay. I guess I don't know this game. Let me go look this up. Can you tell me about it? It is a cave shoot 'em up starring a bunch of psychic kids. And, you know, they fly around and destroy tanks and planes and also other psychic people. And, you know, it's, it's cave. It's a bullet hell. It's very hard. It has excellent music. The bullet patterns are really enjoyable. And the scoring system is so strange that people didn't understand it for a while, even though it's a really good scoring system. You have to like paint the um you have to like paint the enemy with your special attack, then kill them to keep your multiplier up. So somebody was asking me why I put Silver Star Story over the Silver Star. First of all, I prefer the music of Silver Star Story, and I think Iwadade probably did as well, because like, you know, he redid the entire soundtrack compared to the Silver Star, even though he didn't technically need to. Um it's. <laughs> I personally think that the changes to the story and the music alike both just made for a better experience. But I know that many people prefer the original, both in terms of music and story, and I respect that completely. I feel there is no wrong or right answer on that. They're just very different games. I actually have no experience with the original. I just played the PS1 one. Well, you know that part where you're leaving on the boat and your love interest jumps on the boat with you? Or like at the mm -hmm. last minute? Yeah. In the original Sega CD version, she stays behind and the plot is different as a result. That's interesting. And all of the music is different. It's an entirely unrelated soundtrack by the same artist. I'm sorry that Super Robot Wars J is not on this list, Critic. But I will tell you that I loved that game. I, uh... <laughs> I'm just I... losing it over all of the stuff in chat of this game, is it on there? It's like, it's a hundred games to crop from like all of gaming history. This is I such know, a right? hard thing to do. <laughs> my, my list would look so much dumber because it would be like, it would include the original and a remake of multiple games, and that's disgusting in a sense. I totally like, get it. Resident uh, Evil 2. Resident Evil 2 remake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Indeed, indeed. You know what? Let me make another scene for this so I can just, like, put us somewhere. <laughs> I'm just losing it. I, I keep thinking about for the rest of the stream, I'm like, Mega Man 5 is pretty great. I don't know about... I don't know about it being one slot below Sonic CD. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hiding behind Sara. I'm shy. Please don't judge me. <laughs> uh, uh, also, I want to say the the thing that pops out as the most interesting to me about this list yeah? is that um, Luffy in the Fortress of Doom is 31 and Luffy 2 is 33. Uh, yeah. The Fortress of Doom, of course, is the original, right? Yes, that's right. Thank you, okay. Critic, for the gift subs. Okay, so I will explain. I don't think that Lufia and the Fortress of Doom is a better game than Lufia 2. But I grew up playing Lufia 1 a lot, and I think that the dialogue and the story writing is just very, very good. Like, it's extremely on point. The gameplay is rough. It is rough, but it's rough in that kind of way where once you're used to it, it's not a problem, as opposed to games where when you keep playing it, the gameplay continues to be a problem no matter how well you've learned it. Thank you. Thank you for the happy birthday. Um, that is how I would describe Astral Chain for me, huh. uh, where like I had such huge buy-in on aesthetics and mechanics and sort of the story at the beginning but the gameplay because it's not rock solid as it goes it kind of just it doesn't you can't get over the hurdle of being like well sometimes this chain is gonna clip through enemies uh so hello. yeah i hello hello hi i actually grew up with both lufias so i totally hear you on that the the musical stylings of both games are so different too yeah, Wait, they I'm are. I'm looking for the Lufias on this list now. Uh, 31 and 33. 
<laughs> oh, this is a cute outfit. I've never seen this before. <laughs> Dot, when you pop that up on your stream, I was screaming. <laughs> Wow, that is that can is you, so can good. You scale it up a little bit, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, gamers. You mean you're not no, one of the fairies? Dot. This is this is DDR tournament dot. <laughs> DDR tournament dot. Nice. That's the fit, yeah. Hey, Andy, how are you? I'm doing great. And Damien made this. <laughs> oh, that is so record. good. That oh, is so great. good. And Damien has that's made a awesome. lot of a lot of art for me. And it's always so good. Hell yeah. <laughs> always. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just We just got off of three 30 or 20 to 30 hour streams every Friday of 3D Zeldas in a row. And when we finish that, I go to Dot Stream and she pulled <laughs> up this art and I died because we're all wearing that outfit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Dot, I'm trying to figure out how to scale you. Because, <laughs> like, so like here's what you do you, you hold the shift key and then you grab the right edge of the image. <laughs> oh, okay. So, like, like, like that. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, you're so funny. You're so funny. <laughs> I, I feel like that's Dot if Dot was a slime and she got hit in an RPG. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Like the sort of hit stun <laughs> animation. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. One of the weird things about that Battle Network Legacy Collection is it does uh, effects like the classic SNES era point to lies. You know, right? when sprites get a fourth resolution and fluctuate, like hit stuns and Zelda and stuff. Yeah. Uh, it does that at the full resolution of like 1440p or 4K, so it looks really weird. <laughs> oh my gosh. So is it, is it like running a game at a higher res than it's supposed to be running at, like on, on an emulator? Yes, kind of. Um, also, I forgot to thank Hickther for the follow, and thank you, Verdito, for the bits. Thank you. There's like modern resolution text and a bunch of weird stuff going it's it's a weird package i'm loving it but it occasionally does a thing i look at it and go what <laughs> thank you so much anonymous gifter for the six gift subs yeah the way it is like i'm planning on playing battle network 3 probably on stream soon and i look at that collection and i'm like wow the text is so hard to get used to yeah, I think people have um, are <laughs> either have or are fixing it on PC. Um, but the second thing I was going to mention about your list is that I really deeply love the fact that Azure Dreams is on there. Yeah, Azure Dreams is one of my favorite games ever, easily, and it's it's such a great roguelike sort of experience, mystery dungeon, obviously, you know. Yeah, so few people Isn't know like a about it. Game or something. Hmm. Is that like a GBC game? What am I thinking? Uh, of? It's both PS1 and Game Boy Color. Let oh, me explain. They're both um, really similar. They're similar, but the thing is, the PS1 version has a town building system and a dating system, while the GBC version doesn't. But it makes up for this by having a ton more enemies and floors to the dungeon. So basically, you can keep playing it longer in different ways. Mm -hmm. uh, did I ever play Energy Breaker or Lufia 3? I have played Lufia 3. I have not played Energy Breaker. I have not played Panzer Dragoon Saga. Lufia 3 is okay. It would be better if it wasn't a GBC game. Yeah, that would have been neat. And yeah. I mentioned it, but it's funny. We have a lot of crossover with our lists. Yeah. But everything everything that we have in common is like close to the bottom of your list and close to the top of mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, you know, everything on this list is awesome. Everything. Uh-huh. I actually, <laughs> yeah, I think that that would be the case for me, too. Uh, Castlevania The Adventure Rebirth, I assume, is what 68 is? Um, yes. Oh, that's the X68000 one, right? The Castlevania Chronicles? Uh, The Adventure Rebirth is um the WiiWare game. Oh, my God. So, allow me to explain. I thought, because I couldn't find it. I thought that she had something labeled Castlevania 68 in her list. Her Castlevania 68. But you're 68. saying the game 68 is a Castlevania game. I'm on oh, the same okay, page yeah. now. 
Yeah, yeah I... chat. We can't look at the list anymore right now. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> Sorry. Um. No, it's fine. Dot. I've been I'm. Dot. I'm gonna drop a parsec link in the chat. So. Oh, oh right. God. Do I even have parsec? I may not. <laughs> really? Yeah. I. Sh <laughs> it always messes up for me. Hmm. But yeah, this is a really good list. I, I always appreciate it when people appreciate Mega Man 8. Yeah, it is so hated on. And I think it's because, you know, a lot of us played it as kids. And kids are impatient. And <laughs> so 8 is, like, definitely not what I wanted out of Mega Man at that point in my life, honestly. Yeah, I, as, as I've gotten older, so, I think I appreciate it more. Yeah. Something, um... I didn't realize until I was much older is like, hey, you need to get that upgrade that lets you slide faster because it's not about it's not about the movement speed across the screen when you slide. It's about how long you stay in a slide. And for the jump, jump, slide, slide on Wily 1, that is so important to get out of the slide faster. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't I didn't even go to the uh, the upgrade shop the whole time I, I played. You don't yeah, absolutely that's... need it, but the thing is, like, there's multiple ways to deal with the jump, jump, slide, slide, and a lot of it involves just jumping at the very last moment or sliding a little early. As a kid with a Game Shark for the uh, PS1, let me tell you, that didn't help me there. There's no Game Shark code that will save you from jump, <laughs> jump, slide, slide. So, Dot, what do you usually use for general collaborations, if not Parsec? Um. I don't know. <laughs> it usually doesn't usually doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, well. It's okay. I can just hang out. It's a big maze. I mean, I appreciate that, but it'd be cool to game with you. <laughs> what do you want to do? What do you want to play? Um, I Think honestly okay. would like to play like a board game or something because you know it's laid back and easy to chill with. Yeah, I should be able to install Parsec then, hang on. I'm interested I'll in I'll get this. on that. I hope my I voice redeems aren't too uh, loud or anything. When nah, you get good. Parsec, you it will just see that scares dot. <laughs> it scares you? Oh god, then it's really gonna scare Dot. I'm so sorry <laughs> in advance, Dot. No, I just don't expect- You know what they say! The more the merrier! A... I'm interested in this. <laughs> hey, that wasn't that. Must be. Can you do that again? I'm interested in this. Wow, that's actually really this is good. Like taking candy from a baby, <laughs> which is fine by me. Which is fine by me. Um. Oh no, my model. I I still haven't played Spark the Electric Jester two, and I really need to. Yeah, it is better in my opinion than three. Mm, well done. And it's like definitely this. better than one. Have you played one? Um, no, but I watched footage of one. Yeah, that's I was right. like, that's cool. I'm glad people who... Wait, one was two. Yes. Um, yeah. He was a good I man. I wasn't as interested. What a rotten way to die. It's a big maze. That worked. Yeah, that worked. Okay, Dot, you should be able to see now. And... Uh... Trauma Team, is that the Wii one? Yeah. Wow. One of the Wii ones. Because there's wow. three. The reason I'm saying that is uh, I have no uh, opinions because I played it so long ago, I'm not even sure it would like at all land the same for me, but I know that Bob really didn't like that one when he played it back... God, that was 15 years ago. Basically, the thing about Trauma Team is it gives you a bunch of different things to do besides just the normal surgery, and the normal surgery isn't as hard. Like, it's not as much of a pro, a pro game in that way. I'm but, <laughs> welcome back, Todd. I was, like, echoing, <laughs> like, all of the music you were listening to back at you. I don't know if you heard it, but it was there. Nope. <laughs> That's pretty funny, though. I'm sorry about the volume. You've probably fixed it by now. Hey, this song is from game 45 on your list. I know That's this true. one. <laughs> That's I was correct. looking at game 45 and I was like, Metal Gear Solid? No, no, that, that word isn't there. <laughs> Yo, Metal Gear 2 rules. I played it for the first time recently. 
Metal Gear 2 I, is so good. I was so blown away with it when uh, they packed it with Metal Gear Solid 3 Subsistence, and I had not seen it before that. I was I was like, this is this is nuts. That's what they were playing when we had the NES. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then and then we got it sort of because they gave us Metal Gear Solid, and it's basically a remake. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Which my bottle is... keeps breaking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sara's sleep medication it got mixed in with the rest of her pills and she's still nodding off a little Happy bit. Birthday. I'm just gonna stare in the corner. <laughs> I wonder who that could be. Well, it's me. <laughs> yeah, Sara actually got it at a Tavatone. Roto got yes. me one for my birthday. Oh, no kidding. Yep. So now I'm part of the Adamatone gang. Hang on, I gotta get mine. Dad, <laughs> <laughs> when I Welcome realized how the... high it can go, it's... Yeah, it's terrible, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I've learned that cats really hate that sound. So I assume Discord think it's... won't let me play the automaton, right? <laughs> you know what's hilarious? Right? You didn't hear that? No, we I didn't. heard it. Oh, okay, good. What's hilarious you, you is... Don't have to, you I don't have to that... flatter me. I know it sucked. <laughs> I played that horribly high noise, and Fry walked into my room, <laughs> looked at no. me, then walked out. <laughs> <laughs> He was like, what are you doing? Oh, hey, I, uh, I can't see number 99 and 100. Can you hold shift and grab the top of Dot's head and resize her downward? Oh, yeah, thank you. Do it that way. <laughs> yes, of course. God damn it. Yeah, Fry almost attacked the Atomatone when I was playing it for the first time. That's <laughs> right. Mega Man 2 on mine. I feel like I put that one really high. I, I think I've just played Mega Man levels. 2 too much. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm like classically overexposed with Mega Man 2, honestly. Uh, I can't hear that Wily song anymore. Yeah, yeah. No, that's called being alive when we were and into retro games because that's just all of OC Remix for a decade. Yeah, yeah. Looks like it was ninth place on mine. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Hang on, where's Magical Drop 3 on yours? 26? Yeah. That's probably the, the closest we came on any of these. Mine is, it's 38 on mine. And now I'm noticing that for some reason there's two spaces between Attorney and Three, right below Magical Drop Three. Oops. That's okay. Castlevania at number 68 is also misspelled. Castlevania. <laughs> that double L is like an aspirated L, right? It's like a he song, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I, I seriously like the, the name Floyd, I think is like, Floyd, like that. Yes, thank you, Retro. I got it. Thank you very much for the gift. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm just having so much fun just talking to you guys, admittedly. I wonder when Vox will get here. See, yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> I've, I've had it happen multiple times where, like, you plan a collab. You're like, we're going to do all this fun stuff, and you just end up talking the whole time anyway. Which Guilty <laughs> yeah. here? Like, XX? Specifically, or just the whole series? Original. Like Especially that. Sharp Nothing Reload, else. frankly. Yeah, Reload oh, okay. is the number 34 on my list. <laughs> Plus, you you know, I, uh... I yeah. ran the, the lobby for the net play that people oh. were using. <laughs> Thank you, Gaishin, for resubscribing nine months. <laughs> but yeah, this, yeah, this the is... the birth of a subscription. Yeah, it's well, the who's that? Wait, who was that? <laughs> <laughs> who was that? Hello, Vox. Let me get you oh, off. Oh yeah, am I like super quiet? By the way, my mic Thank is sometimes you. really quiet. 
You've been fine. Let me see. You seem fine to me. You might be, you might be able to go up a little bit, but it's not like a problem. Yeah, I can't touch it actually. Here, I'll just I'll just put you up here. <laughs> Let me get you a parsec invite. <laughs> <laughs> I have a vox on my head. <laughs> it happens. <laughs> it's a thing that's known to happen See? to people. <laughs> this this is how you get voxes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want voxes? Because this is how you get them. This is what it looks like when you have Toho thoughts. <laughs> what happened with the What happened with the font? Oh, it's the alpha in Super Robot Wars Alpha. Yeah, I yeah. I somehow actually I think it's that I was rearranging the list and I added more stuff to it. And uh -huh. I didn't correct the font because I had manually changed like the font weights or something. Oh yeah. <laughs> That seems like something I would do. <laughs> Einhunter is such a good game. It really is. It's underappreciated. What the heck, Windows? Why are you bringing up folders all of a sudden? I, I bet people would have appreciated Einhunter more if the title screen said the name in a really funny, overly produced sound. Einhunter. Einhunter. Yeah, it just goes. <laughs> <laughs> it has to say it. It has to say it incorrectly. Oh, yeah. too. Yes. Yeah. He has see? to go in Honder. In Honder. Honder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, now that I'm like in Hander, I'm like that should just be said like the bouncer, the Kingston, the Kingston. <laughs> that gets played so many freaking times. It's great. I okay. I lurk in most people's chats. Like I don't chat a lot of the time when I'm watching, so I crack up anytime I hear the Kingston. Thank you, Anonymous Gifter, for gifting this sub to RPG fan. Iron Hunter is so good. You found out about it because of the music, but it's so good. Yeah, the music is amazing in that game. It is. It is. It is. It is like sit down if you've never heard it before. <laughs> levels of whoa, this PS1 <laughs> game's going hard. Yeah. Oh my God, this, I won't explain how I got here, but this reminds me, speaking okay. of square, square soft, like music with vocal samples. Did you, did you hear they tracked down the like vocal sample in the Xenogears battle theme? Oh, wow. That, like, for years and years, they couldn't figure out. Oh wait, I remember this. It was from somewhere really weird, like a court trial. Yes, uh, it's like a famous person's, it, like does Marlon Brando have a son? I almost want to say it was like, Marlon Brando's son getting sentenced for something. It's something seriously like that. Like that. What? Yeah, it's true. Like, look it up. <laughs> That's crazy. I remember hearing about this like, like a year ago or something. It was so weird. Who are the guests today? This is Dan Video Games. This is oh, wow. um, this I'm is from Giga Booths. This is a uh, Link from Zelda. <laughs> and um, yeah, some... I thought her name was Zelda. And, yeah, that's right. And this is somebody's um, Saga Frontier OC, I think. Yeah, that sounds accurate. <laughs> <laughs> it, I was right. It was uh, the the trial of Christian Brando for murder. Apparently, I I didn't oh. catch that <laughs> detail. Yeah, that's that's wild, right? They just put that in the Xeno Gears battle song. <laughs> hey, I love stuff like that. I listen to the uh, Dragon Seeds talking about PS1 games nobody appreciates. Uh, I listened to the Dragon Seeds music for years and cut it into all of my videos that need background music. And it took me until, I don't know, two years ago to just type the, the lyrics from one of the songs into uh, Google. And it's like, yeah, that's from a 1950s sci-fi film about an alien invasion. And I'm like, what? <laughs> uh, Vox, is there any way you can bring yourself up a bit? Uh, I mean, I have a standing desk. I could, I could turn that on. <laughs> You're so funny. You're so funny. Uh, I, I can. Give me one moment, sure. and I will handle this. You will not need to do a single thing, except wait, wait, wait for me a minute. <laughs> What's this song from? It's from East. Okay. Um, somebody's saying Vox like Dot needs uppies. 
Yo, we got nothing oh, but Ian. So, so today. fucking hilarious. So fucking <laughs> yeah, see now, now you get it, Vox. Now you understand. <laughs> we get, we get this is every day of my life. <laughs> I'm blessed. No one, no one in chat has ever offered me up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was taking a drink of something and almost got all over my mic. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> that was almost dangerous. 15 hours into a death stream. Dan, you're looking pretty down. Do you want uppies? <laughs> you want uppies, Dan? You mean me? So somebody in chat is asking what Arcturus is. Arcturus, the curse and loss of divinity, is the game that Gravity made before Ragnarok Online. And in many ways, it is the predecessor to Ragnarok Online. It uses the same engine, even though it's a single-player game. There are characters that were carried over to Ragnarok Online and a bunch of spells and skills and such. Like, it's not a direct sequel, but it is absolutely the fact that Ragnarok Online was the successor to that more than it was the Ragnarok Manhwa. Why don't they yeah. predicate some bitches? What is <laughs> How do I sound, by the way? You're, You're sounding sound better. Now. Fantastic. Um, I, too, am curious what this song is from. Wait a second. Is this Ancient Ease? Oh, okay. It's from Dragon no. Saber. Oh, do dragons? It's, it's not quite. Like <laughs> Is this from right 1991? <laughs> <laughs> I get why you said that, Dan, because I can kind of hear it, but doesn't hear. It's not exactly it. So yeah, I was, I was like, like Ooh, not quite. The before quite. and after 1991. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a specific time. So, Vox, what it's do like, you think uh, about my list? <laughs> Uh, so what's very interesting about your list is that it's a shitload of crossover with mine, but in completely different places. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's exactly like mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like... Oh, where did, where did I put Umihara anyway? There's a huge amount of stuff that is on mine and Vox's. Oh man, Vox, you really gotta play Toho Alive sometime. I do. It is so good. This is true. People say that, and I believe them. I'm going to say that at least 30 of these games would end up on mine if I were ever to make one and then have the boldness to ever show it. You got to make one of these. Oh. We all we all did. So yeah. You don't have an excuse it's anymore. It's your turn now. Ugh. Like hidden behind all of us is me thanking Vox for pushing me to make this list. <laughs> you wouldn't have to thank me. I mean, I, I took the idea from Dot, took the idea from, from someone NBC else. Chris, yeah. So someone is asking me if East 1 and 2 on my list means the PC Engine version. No, it does not. But I consider East 1 and 2 to be one game because they were always meant to be. And they've basically always been sold as a bundle. It's the you, one you the... case where I'll allow, like, a collection. Okay, really dumb story time. So, okay. uh, the retro video game scene, when it comes to hardware, has an interesting track record. They made, uh, I think this was Terra Onion, they made a mod for the Turbo Graphics that would do RGB video out mm -hmm. and also allow for, uh, PC Engine CD. Like, it was like a flash drive, basically, but for super graphics and turbo cd games but okay. the problem was the original engineering sample amps the audio too hard and it over amplifies to actually make it like hot as a signal oh. and me and bob ever since the first review came out showing that could not stop cracking up because their sample footage was ease and it's the guy narrating the intro ah. it's just it's like it's like totally mm. blown out. It ain't an ideal utopia. <laughs> and we just laughed so hard. <laughs> the ideal utopia. Oh my god. Oh my god, That is so anyway. funny. <laughs> oh man. Do you have one of those? I do, I, do, I do, and I got it fixed with the mod from Firebrand X. I legitimately don't know if mine has the problem where it blows out the audio. So here's the saddest part, and Vox knows this story firsthand. Uh, we went through all that work. That that mod, not cheap. Uh, getting a PC engine or a Turbo Graphics that late, mm. not the cheapest thing in the world. Vox flies down and uh, guest stars on our e-stream 
and we try to save and it crashes. This is real hardware. <laughs> oh my God. And that's what it does. And we were like, that's just a one time fluke, right? And then we tried again and it crashed again. And I'm like, okay, I don't even know why I have this if it can't please. <laughs> oh man. I remember so, you trying to set up the laptop so that you could play the Chronicles version. Yeah. Anyways, I'm really great. happy the Mister is a thing now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. The, the N64 have... core is looking amazing, and I'm so shocked, because how? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's I basically, be when it first was announced, I treated it in the same way I did when they, when someone first announced they were working on a Saturn corner. I'm like, okay, good luck. I'll, yeah. I'll care oh. closer to it coming out. And then I saw who was making it. I'm like, oh, now I actually have a lot of confidence, because I'm a patron <laughs> of that, dudes. And, yeah. Uh, his work on the PS1 core has been nothing short of miraculous, basically. Yeah, I don't think he even would have undertaken the project if he didn't know he could do it. Yeah. Yeah, it... I'm... Man, like... <laughs> the Mr. is already, like, such a godsend to people who want to stream retro, because before that, like, like... I always invested all of the money we made early on because I worked a job on the side of Gigaboots mm -hmm. um, into hardware and stuff. And if the Mister existed when we first started, we could have saved so much money, like thousands. Thank yeah. you, Chili like Green. That, like, I think that, that Turbo Graphics situation I just described cost me nothing short of like 700 by the time I'm done shipping it across the country and buying this thing and et cetera. Et cetera. How much was the Super SD System oh, 3 Lord. when you got it? Um, I could look it up in my email, but I know it's a 250 ish or yeah, it costs there? way less now. I want to say it was like over $300 when I bought it or something. Yeah, yeah, they have the um, the version with an HDMI out now that has its own, you know, monkey paw issues, right? Yeah, like I that sounded cool until more details came out, and it's like I, I can't spend that kind of money on it, yeah. Understandable. You know, it's not this. No disrespect to them or anything. It's no. just at that price point, it has to basically be perfect. You know. Right, and that's the thing. Like, at no point do I want to imply to any of these retro products that their job is easy, but yeah. so many of them are so expensive. I do. And <laughs> get it right. Get it. Get it right. Bring that price down. Get it right. Come on. Vox is like, Thank oh, you, get it right. you just engineer it correctly. It's 2023. You. Come on. How many years? This is retro. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, it's it's true though. Like at the end of the day, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You need at referee the end of the, for the day, follow. like it's not reasonable for someone to spend two hundred and sixty dollars on a device that does one thing, and then and it turns out that there I'm are better. a billion asterisks. Like you, Sandy. It's like you know the one that everyone's okay with me uh, publicly talking about and no fandom is ever going to get upset is the PSIO, where when it oh first came out, God. they're like, it has 100% compatibility. And then uh. YouTube repeated that tagline, and then I get it. And I'm like, guys, it didn't run Final Fantasy VII right. What? <laughs> it didn't run Final <laughs> Fantasy VII right for over half a year. That's yeah. horrible. That was It was a firmware issue, which gets into the other huge problem with that device, of course. Oh, man. Is that your firmware is like locked to your serial number for your yes you have to sign up through their website you yeah. have to submit your serial number on your device and then they spend you send you a custom compiled version of the firmware for your device and Man, a lot of people got just firmware painful. issues you know you, you, you gotta you gotta look past that <laughs> So, what the so everyone's got, everyone's got their moments, the retro scene you know? sometimes be shipping flaccid where you're totally right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just really yeah, like, I'm, sorry. I'm just really glad the Mr. is affordable for yes. Yeah, by comparison to all this other stuff. It's expensive, but I mean it's expensive, yeah. but it's not as expensive as buying a bunch of retro consoles and modding them and all that stuff. Right. Exactly. Like, and that's what I try to stress to people too. It's like the Mister is expensive, yes, but by the end of, like, let me put it this way: an RGB cable for even the PS2 costs fifty dollars. Oof, that's just yeah, the cable. If you, if you like want to play the NES, for example, and you want right. RGB out, which you know, you know, maybe you don't, right? But let's say you do, an NES plus an RGB mod plus 
even a basic line doubler is more than the mister so it's one console and that's yeah. not even getting into like you know do you have cartridges or are you going to need a flash card mm -hmm. and that's that's it's, exactly it much. yeah because like a flash card for the let's say super nintendo because i don't memorize the nes flash card um the super nintendo flash cards are well above 100 they're like 170 maybe i don't know i haven't looked in a while yeah but they're awesome so there's that oh they oh <laughs> no doubt they I are i own one um mm -hmm. i in fact <laughs> you know as i as i described i geared up all of these consoles yeah. and then the mister came out oh that's perfect uh, just leave that right there <laughs> yeah triple a but oh, lower case go. gaming not it's, Dan. It's, um, it's, it's, it's too much that. to like, URL. expect people. Fox.dan. Fox.dan. Perfect. Fox.dan. It's dot com. Dot com. But yeah, yeah okay. The there we go. The bio was like, like FF7 was working. Uh, Resident Evil 2 was working. And then a firmware update came out <laughs> right after all that glowing YouTube coverage. So like uh -huh. right when a ton of people bought in that broke both of those games, which I think they might literally be the two top selling games for the system or something. Yeah. If not that, they're really close. And then I think it was maybe a literal year before there was another firmware update uh, push that finally fixed FF7 and Resident Evil 2. Yeah, and then um, <laughs> it broke Tony Hawk games. Yeah, great. So, so <laughs> at the end of the day, I ended mm. up getting one of those because of glowing YouTube praise that was pretty not critical. Um, and uh, yeah, it just doesn't work right. Uh, by the way, I looked it up. A current uh, flash cart, like the one you would want the FX Pack Pro for the Super Nintendo is $265. Yeah. I was going to say 170 sounds low, but I didn't want to talk out of my ass. No, fair. no, you're uh, totally right. I just totally don't want to oversell the problem. Like, I want to undersell. Yeah. I don't want to be on here and be like, these flashcards for the system cost like $400. Um, shoot, yeah. what was I going to say? Uh, Some words. You were talking about the PSIO, Final Fantasy VII, yeah. Resident Evil 2. Yeah, I don't know. Ori gone. Original hardware is really helpful, though, from a certain perspective. I'm trying to remember what game it was on the Mister. It might have been a Mega Man, but I I did a thing, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's not normal. And someone's like, Yeah, it does that on Vox's streams too. Oof. And I was like, Really? Huh? huh. Well, it's not supposed to say Prass Sparp, so <laughs> it's not. <laughs> oh what? man, Prass no, Sparp. No, actually, you know what? Second. I can I can prove that's wrong. It says Prass Sparp on my on my cartridge. <laughs> Dan, can can you? Paste like Prass Sparp yeah. into the voice text. I want to yeah, show this to chat. Go, let me go find my Prass Sparp. <laughs> um, for anyone who wants context before I get this up, assuming I can. Oh, wait, I know how to find it. Okay. Um, but I have had since my youth, because I'm super lucky and uh, Bob hates me for this, my, my co host Bob uh, over at Gigaboots. Uh, I've had the cartridges for the original Mega Man games forever. Um, so I have original Mega Man 1, and I got the Analog NT Mini, which was an FPGA console. Okay, I found it. Here you go. Um, and just... Analog didn't used to do the best job of machining their consoles to hold cartridges firmly and not scrape them. So I was playing Mega Man 1 on Bob's at Bob's house on the, the Analog NT Mini, this $450 FPGA console. The AC kicks on and the cartridge <laughs> moves it, 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 it like an unobservable amount of space. And this is what the title <laughs> screen became. Capcom <laughs> 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 USA is exactly. an interesting experiment. I was about to say that. I was about to say that. <laughs> Can't sub be. <laughs> What's the prognosis, Doctor? Can't oh, be. <laughs> Damn. Oh, I love Prass Sparp. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> so, guys. <laughs> 
Would you, would you all be willing to play a board game with me? <laughs> What's the board oh, game? Oh, son of a... <laughs> I, it's, I'm not gonna play... Okay, I'm not gonna say game. Sonic Shuffle, no. I, I would, okay. like, no. just... <laughs> it just, is Sonic Shuffle, I'm just not gonna say it. Ha! But... <laughs> no, no, no. I, I was wondering if we could all play Top Shop. It's really simple, so... Oh, I've never played it, sure. You've never played Top Shop, neat. It's basically like a Fortune Street or Monopoly Everything kind of thing. Must Ow. Do I need a controller for this? Uh, it'd help. Uh, yeah, when you plug in a controller. Right, I gotta, it's I gotta go. I can't just back. play with my mind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm cranking my opinions up to eleven, and it's still not receiving it. Oh no. <laughs> I've got to I've got to start copying you all to the uh, PlayStation scene just a sec. Please don't copy me. Death streams are not healthy. I you wouldn't it. download I again video games. <laughs> Would you? I don't know. I'm looking at my PNG tuber. I wouldn't recommend downloading that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I take your point. I might start talking about how Ocarina of Time's actually a bad game. <laughs> you know, it's okay well, I'm not to disagree with you there. It's okay to say that on this oh. stream because I'm not actually a big fan of Ocarina what, of what Time. Happened? Oh, that's amazing! I lost uh, sound for people. You really? lost sound? Oh, oh no! If only we could reach her still, but she's on the other side. Bye, um. Dot. I miss you. <laughs> I think I was talking to Dot yesterday. <laughs> it was just yesterday. It was just um, yesterday that I heard Dot's voice. But yeah, Ocarina of Time. Oh, is is wait? Yeah, or I'm sure I'm PS5 talking over controller. everybody. I can't hear that. I don't know that for a fact. It's the PS5 because controls. I plugged in a controller. This is why I'm using Who the decided Xbox that one? every controller needed an onboard speaker. Like uh, a headphone uh, amp. This is where I would explain to What's Dot that point? it's actually the haptic <laughs> feedback that is registering as a speaker. <laughs> as a gaming intellectual, <laughs> I am fully aware of exactly what's going on. Unfortunately, I cannot edify Dot right now. What in the... Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah. We can hear you the whole you. time. I can't hear you. I don't even oh, okay. know why I well. asked. <laughs> this is a good bit. I like this. <laughs> like Understandable. Like Have this. a good day. <laughs> I miss her. <laughs> All we have is this dying AI that pretends it's not. Just says, can you hear me? I can't hear you. <laughs> the problem with the dual sense. Yeah, that's that's the pose I'm my PNG tubers in. Hello. Can oh you my hear God. me? Can Welcome you back. Hear me? So, so you guys all got controllers, right? <laughs> okay, so... Uh, yeah, I'm, I might need to yeah. restart Parsec, we'll see. You shouldn't need to, you should just select the Parsec window and press any button, and it should plug it in. I don't have an any I have no button. idea if it did that. <laughs> you don't have... What, what's that box? Uh, any button? Oh. <laughs> womp womp. Like Let's see, whose controller is this? Uh, that is me. Hello. Okay. This should be Dot then. Is it? Try. I push am, I, am I doing stuff? I'm, I'm hitting. We mine. got three controllers. I plugged my. Oh, in. yeah, that's me. That's me. Okay. And okay. uh, this should be Vox, I think. Did you see that me do it? me. In there? Okay, okay. Yeah, we saw your thing. Okay, yeah. that's all good. We saw your thing. Oh, no. Cool. Don't say that. On Twitch? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the 420 bits, Dan Bob. <laughs> Danny, thank you. Okay, so. I... Oh, I'm sitting so there good. on Twitch tracker and I'm like, I wonder what the most popular clip on Twitch is. And I'm like, yeah, of course. Okay. Okay, right. so let me move everything. Oh, look at the shout out. That's right. I did play through Advance Wars 1 plus 2 reboot camp. I only played the one part, though, because, oh my God. Okay, I think I look less crusty now. Yeah, you do. You look way better. Yeah, you improved up. that dramatically, actually. Did you did you steam your shirt? <laughs> did you iron that? That's... 
No, I, no changed, wrinkles. I changed Crocs. That fixed it. You didn't show them the Crocs. You got to pull the avatar up so they can see it. You got one of those fur-lined Crocs. Wait a moment. I Wait had a, a friend moment. who worked. Oops, oh, no. God, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hello, girl. I had a friend who worked. <laughs> oh my lord! Hell those yeah. are Crocs. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness! Those are actually Crocs. Crocs. Yeah, I had a friend who worked uh, like at our our touristy, bougie, super outdoor mall sort of shopping area at the Croc store, and so I got a discount, and I was like, okay, I'll buy some Crocs, and I was like, ah. Oh, Damn, these are comfy. <laughs> Damn. No. Because I was also poor. You got to keep in mind. So uh -huh. like, I'm like, okay, well, I'll just buy these and then buy some normal shoes. And the normal shoes can... kept wearing out and the Crocs lasted forever, I sadly. This is a better so. size. You could resize you can add. <laughs> you could add more bear, uh, border to it. It's like people when they frame a picture inside of a bl matte black like oh no what the backdrop oh windows why why would you do this to me as it's windows abby why from, am i asking uh, as avi from mighty number no. nine mighty number no. nine would say uh technical difficulties well speaking of which where was mighty number no. nine on your top 100 games i missed it uh it was obviously the number nine that you couldn't see yeah ninth place oh, oh. that makes sense yeah it makes sense also, I wish I could do the Street Fighter 3. Yeah, that makes sense. Soundbite. That's a good soundbite. Well, why don't you try saying it? No, that's, that's, <laughs> as, that's as close as it gets. Yeah, this is also as close as it gets, I think. I hope you can see that. I can. So this is one of those really budget PS1 games that somehow actually got an English release officially. Is it a simple series or something? It's similar to that. I don't think it's the simple series. It's a similar series. Right on. It was called Tenant Wars in Japan. So, I'm going to pick a character. Hmm. She's fine. So, I can't give the other gamepads control in the character select, which is really dumb. Sarp. <laughs> There's a what slight type of sarp. What you want for dinner, sweetie? Sarp. <laughs> sarp. Oh no. You hit default. I did. I did. Because somehow. <laughs> It didn't expect me to press the same button that I had pressed on all the other options. Now I just want, like, a, a, a Sarah Lene emote that's her in a giant fish outfit. Like a mascot, <laughs> and that would be Sarp. 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 Okay, so, so, Dan, tell me what character you like. I will be the frog with the crown, because they are adorable. Okay. I'm so sorry. You can actually share characters. There is no limitation. There's palette swaps. <laughs> Giga bits for plane. Giga carp. <laughs> okay. Dot. That Actually, one. I guess it does this one? No. This one? Yes. I guess it doesn't let you use the same character, but that's weird because there are palette swaps. There, There is a way to use the same character. I know it. <laughs> DOS. DOS. <laughs> Get on my DOS level, bro. <laughs> DOS level. <laughs> uh, box. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh... <laughs> The robot's pretty cool. It's called Santa. And it is actually Santa. Uh, who, who else we got here? Uh, oh, that computer's kind of cool, actually. The television. Um. Oh, the snot in the nose. You know, I want to I wanna be the little TV. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I want to call him Scrunt. You got it. <laughs> I, did you notice his default name Oops. was chat? 
Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I hadn't even thought of that. <laughs> scrunt. Okay, I'm scrunt. Fucking scrunt. <laughs> I'm scrunt. Okay, so... <laughs> We choose a slightly bigger map because there's four of us. Um, <laughs> I could hear Roto laughing in the background. <laughs> <laughs> this game is a uh, monopoly until proven otherwise. Basically, except we're in a mini mall. Well, not a mini mall. It's just a mall. Uh, you could sell items at your stores. And people, when they land on the space, are forced to buy the items. And you have to restock, like, the most expensive items you can so that you have to buy the expensive stuff. It just changed my color. Yeah, it changed Dot's color, too. Yeah, I think it's bad. We are colored. That's... Um, anyway. Smash Bros? <laughs> <laughs> so, on all of your turns, I'm gonna have to assign it to your controller. Okay. Two. Also, if you land on the elevator, you can turn around or you can take the elevator. Well, the elevator will take you somewhere, but it might take you to the same floor. I'm taking the elevator. It's now, like, I'm, I'm taking it with me <laughs> as a personal possession. There's all these cute stores that you buy. Like, okay, so... Let me... Your chosen first cannot be... What? Huh? I'm trying to change the character's control, but it's not... Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so... Whoever that is, that's Dot, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah that's Dot. Dot, you have control you now. So, so press oh, up. I All right, done it. Yeah. So what am I doing? <laughs> You're unpausing. Yeah, go to... Go I to, don't know about that. Go to exit. <laughs> And now you can play. The pencil is your dice, by the way. Okay. You know what they say! The more Damn, the merrier! you guys are trying to roll pencils like me. <laughs> I don't know if I have background input enabled, so I'm going to try moving myself. It might take your control away. Oh, you still have it. Good. God, are you sad someone took the candy star before you? Fuck yeah, I am. <laughs> I'm out for one now. Uh, so, okay, for my so turn, it's back to sorrow, right? Yeah, until I until I there set it go. to you. Okay, so. Yep. A start. Boom. Boom. Work. Work. Hmm. Damn you. You one are in moment. the parsec window, right? Yes. Totally. It absolutely. Was. There you go. There you go. <laughs> that's what I. That's where I was. Okay. Absolutely. Okay, absolutely. Thing. Work. Damn you. <laughs> Somebody what asked, is what is Kiss in boxes of band? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh really? I'm just gonna write up these and... <laughs> sure... Uh, okay. Um... <laughs> Look at the names of these stores. Short video is my YouTube I have name. to open George. <laughs> George video. <laughs> video! No returns! No returns! Scrunt's turn. What's up, okay. YouTube? It's George video! I'm a big fan of my, um... Okay. Bitty, bitty bag of donuts. Okay, Kitty Vox. The Activate the parsec George. window yeah. and press the button. I'm pressing start. Uh, are you in the parsec oh, window? I, you know. <laughs> I was too busy Who typing a band mistake. in your chat. That's I was too ridiculous. busy typing in your chat. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, so I select me, right? Right here? You, you, you're good. You have control you're, you're of your character now. The menu now. Yeah, just back out. Yeah. I think it's circle. So I, I hit the pencil, right? And then I yeah. Yeah. pencil it up. And then it's like, yo, you got and a two. It two. And now you get to choose which way to go. I'm going this <laughs> way. I'm going to yeah, chop that's very <laughs> All right, do I want burger shops and Johnson <laughs> books? Cooking fun. Flower heart. Do not open. Do not download. <laughs> this, this shop is for me and my friends only. If you don't like glitchy stores that don't sell right, do not open. Oh, uh, Vox. I'm so glad you're here. That, that's a reference for like 5% of your chat, your viewers watching. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, it's my turn again. Cooking books? Yeah, we're cooking books. We're 
cook, cook, cook in the books. Cook, cook in the books with the Oh kids. no! So see, now I have to buy from George Video. You have to buy a video game from George Video. <laughs> so I can buy oh, old I'm... movie. The I can buy time video you're in my shop. I'm just like acting like a YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> or I can buy popcorn. It's not popcorn. I, I love it's popcorn. Pop corn. <laughs> now, yeah, like the big emphasis after the pop. There Maybe is a it's short for popful corn. Maybe there's a sequel we didn't know yeah. about. I'm selling it for way too much money. Popful mail into popful corn. So. <laughs> The thing is, if you buy the more expensive items, it'll give you points that you can use, but the thing is, it'll give your opponent that money, right? So, yeah. you usually want to... You don't really need the points that heavily until later in the I game. Do. I want them. But <laughs> either way, you either buy yes. the expensive stuff and you get the points, or you buy the cheap stuff and you save money. Fox is always and you can buy Twitter multiple things, points. because, you see... If you run the opponent's store out of items, you can buy the store. What? Damn, does that that way in real life, too? <laughs> exactly! <laughs> that is exactly how that mean. works. Is it okay? <laughs> yeah, you choose is a card safe? because you rolled an E, so you get a card. Shop buy. It, that makes, that makes an event happen. Do not. Okay. This is my command. The level can purchase an empty store. Stores within an area within a player's store cannot be purchased. <laughs> Other stores can be chosen using left and right directional. Oh, goodbye candy store. <laughs> <laughs> you can no. press left or right to select different ones. <laughs> Colonel yeah. Sanders over here with the Kid? low tier god eyes. <laughs> Is this a store called Kid? Sell yeah. your shop now. She got oh, arcade games arcade? and fun toys. So <laughs> I don't know which one. You what have you to choose pick? between arcade games or fun toys. You can't have both. Oh, there's that's, Star Coffee really also. There is, yeah, coffee's a thought. Yeah. How will you make this decision? <laughs> uh, can't you just Google random number to get a random... Two, all right. <laughs> you just Google the word <laughs> random number and it's like, hey, it's 40. It gives you a number between one and 10. I Thank actually you, do a random Cap number Man. generator sometimes when it comes to rating people because I can't choose between my that's, friends. That's understandable. That is completely understandable. <laughs> Dan. One moment I'm having a heart attack thinking about choosing between my friends. <laughs> oh no! Me. The answer is me. Oh, okay. So, when you already own the store, oh, yeah. you can open another of the store in <laughs> the same like section. A like a plague. Let's go. <laughs> And this is a George video right next to a George video in the mall. This is the Lewis George Black videos. bit. I saw a George <laughs> video across the street from a George video. Exactly. George video is my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> so oh so here's the thing. Stores have a level between one and four. And if you if you manage to get like the whole row, then like Monopoly, you know, the stores level up. They grow as you connect them. Oh my them. god. That's so like. Hinged. Yeah, so like you get the shop next to an existing shop and you will expand the existing shop. Open a drugstore. <gasps> Open a drugstore. Wait, aesthetics, <laughs> Julia? Yes. <laughs> That's also a YouTuber name. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's just a like, but that's kind of cool, actually. Yeah, when okay, you're George. Like aesthetics, Julia, here. I need to go get the ASMR mic. <laughs> oh no. Do you have one of those? Oh, this is... Okay. I don't have one of those. Okay, oh, great. Oh, no. I have the best one of those. Ah! <laughs> we hit an insane stream goal once, and I'm like, guys, I'm going to feel guilty if I don't invest in something insane, so... so I'm going to do that. Um, I still can't believe you got that thing. I'm a, is it one of the ones that look like ears? Yes. Fuck yes. Yeah, it's it's actually kind of scary. Um, if you're interested in how that sounds, uh, go watch our Hellblade uh, stream because we used it in that. Because in that game, your inner demons are just people recorded on ASMR mics. Oh, Lord. So when uh we set that up for the room, too, and Tosh sneaks up behind the mic and just starts whispering into chat, chat starts screaming. <laughs> They're like, no! So... Um, what was I gonna say? 
word. You're going to say the, the Tokyo restaurant is couple beds to George video very well. Yes. The, micro the microphone with the ears on it, that's the same microphone that was used to record for the Corpse Party games. Oh. <laughs> I'll be damned. That makes sense. Yeah. Oh, the Corpse next Party to me? in your ear. <laughs> Who, whose store is next to me? Um... There you go, second. Star Coffee. You now smell like fish. fish. <laughs> <laughs> oh my monster. god, do you think that's a real product? Hang on. Fish flavored coffee. <laughs> <laughs> There's gotta be, right? Starbucks well, after they get tired I've of putting a, a recipe for coffee rubs grilled fish. <laughs> People Elevator. do it all the time. Okay, yeah, I get do I I just use it? If you use it, you might go down to the bottom floor or you might stay in place. But either way, you'll be able to go left or right at after your next on your next turn. Words are hard, you know that. Do yes. I want to go to the bottom floor? That's up to you. I mean, you Yeah. Although I will note, every time you pass by the teller's desk at the bottom of the mall, you get some money. Like it's the <gasps> same money. as Monopoly in that way. Money. I need money so I can open more George videos. <laughs> <laughs> Starbucks is going to get tired of putting olive oil in the coffee and just start sticking cod oil in the coffee. They do oh, not put olive oil in the coffee. They do. They really do they that? They do. Yeah. What they would just you do that for? Uh, to give people diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. Well, it's very successful at that. How does that benefit them? <laughs> That's the end goal. <laughs> I want to say... truly a diuretic. <laughs> Why does it want me to open auto parts on the fourth floor? People want to go all the way up there up to buy there. like a engine block and carry it back what? down. I'm going to open a music store. Parts. It's, it's parts that are automatic. Oh, okay. Like, um... I didn't think that far. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't think very far, I just kind of... Bye -bye night here. Hey, welcome to the fish market. Yeah, thank you. Would you like some fish to go with your coffee? <laughs> of course. <laughs> but yeah, there's no need to buy a second thing unless Please you want have points. A good day. Here's or your cold you're trying to buy just a fucking salmon in a sack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I wanted to buy out the fish market, it would make sense, bag. right? Yeah, exactly. It's, it's people sitting on the outdoor patio of Starbucks with a fish wrapped in paper. <laughs> Just casually sitting there sipping their coffee. Tour um, tours. None we of got these are tours on video. tour. What? what is... Fresh estate. That's that's I... literally what's already here. A fresh estate. You're I not like wrong. Fresh. What the? What is that? I don't know. It's my turn. Scrunt's turn. Fuck it's it's scrunt. several boxes of wipes. <laughs> So hey, day. Hey. And here's where you can exchange uh -oh. your points if you have them. Funny enough, if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, the last option at 99 points is win the game. Yes. <laughs> also, this is a lot start, of options. Yeah, start playing the Final Fantasy VI intro music. <laughs> <laughs> Da, 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 da. I can't seem to skip down the list. Da, 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 da. Lame victory. I can't press oh, down to scroll up either. Oh no. my god. Okay, well. <laughs> what if you that's... exited the menu okay. and went back in like a sane person? Also, one of the options is oh. equip oh, trip trip point shoes. For zero points. There's an option that says equip trip trip shoes, and that is actually a typo of chirp chirp shoes. They make you oh. make a chicken sound like every time you walk, like chirp, 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 chirp. That seems like a really good option. Pancake How many game land? I think it's like 12 oh. points. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Game land? <laughs> <gasps> I have game land. I've been betrayed. I thought Can I had Oh, dang. Like fish. Check this out. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's fancy. Damn. If only we could make the fish market bigger. <laughs> yeah, I'm just thinking that. I'm like, oh man, I can't wait. Put, put, put a fish, fish market next to the, the other side of Star Coffee. <laughs> oh. Well, obviously you got to put Noodle House here. <laughs> Coffee and noodles. You got a food court. Roll a one. Roll a one. Roll a one. Dang it. 
yeah. Can, can I go in the elevator now? <laughs> no. No. Oh. I just have to buy a $10 billion guitar. <laughs> Why is a triangle so expensive? <laughs> it's made out of clarinet or... Yeah. So yeah, you can see you get points for buying stuff that's not the cheapest item, and you can buy up to two in one turn if you're trying to buy a store out. See, but... I didn't realize the cheapest item literally gets you no points. Yep. Rip. And may oh, God have mercy on your soul. Run. Kid. Auto parts? Kid. Animal world. <laughs> what the fuck is kid? Alright, let's go. They have Game Boys! Okay. We got Game yeah. Boys there, I'm, I'm, that's pretty pug. I'll, 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 I'll sell Game Boys, let's go. Looks like cell phones. You yeah. might be right. Hmm, the money's <laughs> getting a little dire. Uh, but what if you have a <laughs> pancake house? Voxer is... <laughs> <laughs> perfect, perfect. <laughs> oh my gosh. Man, yeah, like originally I thought you guys were probably gonna come with your avatars, but <laughs> then we wouldn't be having this moment. I could I could actually do that. Oh no, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, You're fine as you are. We, we could. Yeah, it's fine. Is funny. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> What's up? Perfect. There we go. What's a... That's actually a really good one, considering. <laughs> it's really good. I, I love it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> That's really fucking good. Oh man. My transition to a uh, PNG tuber has gone well. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank God, it's enough steps to get past this. What is the smelliest store I can open? Animal World. <laughs> Funny thing is, these would both kind of smell, because Auto Parts probably smells like oil and metal. Yeah, yeah exactly. Scrunch I can, turn. I can stand the smell of an auto store a lot more than, like, a pet store. Yeah, so can I. Like, as a kid, I occasionally helped out at a garage, so... Oh, hey, cool oh. elevator. My grandfather worked at a I'm gonna go get a payday. Years, That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, you see, we had, uh, there was, our neighbors had this really big garage, and they had, like, a small business with <laughs> that. <laughs> Ow hoon Oh. Ow hoon Ow hoon Yes. It's like one of those, like, how do I pronounce this word sort of sites. Yes. Ow hoon Ow hoon Ow <laughs> Ooh. I landed directly on the bank, so I got more money. That's I love that. true in real life, too. <laughs> money. Somebody in the chat said, Uwoon. Uwoon. Son of a... <laughs> so fresh. Oh, no. Would you like to... <laughs> you just buy a whole house. It's, it's oh, cheaper that, than a guitar. That's a fresh estate. It's cheaper than the guitar mood. <laughs> Watch out, your money. I know, but I'm saving up for the shoes. <laughs> yeah, but you, you just need the points. Yeah, that's true. Right, that's the thing. I need the points. Yeah, exactly. It's okay. Someone's eventually going to buy something at Fun Toys, and then my ship will come in. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Good morning, good board. morning, gamers. San Sanic Dante. <laughs> I think I can afford that. We gotta make it back down to the bottom floor, though. Why? Why do I keep turning into Good Morning Gamers? I don't. <laughs> I haven't got an answer for you. You know, hey, I never asked goodness. anybody. What do you hey, think hey. of the new outfit? It's cute. It's good. Yep. It's a double ball. <laughs> yeah, JD made this. JD Mew. Very nice. <laughs> There's no way this is gonna look good, but what? Arcade games? One moment. <laughs> when you land Do on your own deliver. shop, when you land on your own shop, you get the option to restock any of your existing shops. 
which are all full. <laughs> shit. Okay, well. The capacity goes up when you upgrade the store. Nobody's buying your shit, Vox. This is yeah, not Fortune Street. It's board yeah, game Top Shop. games and other shit. No one's buying it. The hell's <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if uh, I got in the elevator, landed on the same floor, and went back, back to the bank? Aww. Sanic Dante, this is Top Shop. I wanted to go back to the bank. Do I win when I run out of money first? Is that how it okay. works? Oh, no, no. no. It's going to be legible on stream, but let's see. Oh, what the? <laughs> what is what on earth? Oh, right, because you flipped it. I can, I can flip you back if you want. <laughs> sure, yeah. <let's... laughs> Oops, I flipped myself. <laughs> I don't think you're normally supposed to flip yourself. Um... There you go, Dan. You've been flipped. Okay, there we go. <laughs> what, what does that say? Uh, we were talking about how much fiction growing up uh, <laughs> just has that whole like, and then the hero earned a woman. And I'm like, guys, oh, can no. we get woman earned woman in the dark? Earned. Woman <laughs> earned. Dan, let me just put you in front oh, so, so we can see that. There we oh, go. Oh, God. <laughs> Woman Earth! You can even see how, how that was 24 and a half hours into the Twilight Princess stream. <laughs> oh lord. Go forward eight steps. Please, God, just put me on that bank. Thank you, Matcha said, okay, for the I'll follow. Points exchange. Stop rival What is What is Stop Rival New Store? Okay, so do? let me explain. Stop Rival Delivery uh -huh. means that your rivals cannot restock their stores for two turns. And Stop Rival New Stores means they can't buy new stores for two turns. Oh, <laughs> also, that's mm. a pretty appropriate one, huh, Vox? That terrible party yeah, hat because you were really on the. <laughs> I hate this thing so much. <laughs> <laughs> I still have it, though, and I hate it. It's so funny. No. This is Top Shop. You know what? I should add that to the stream name. Where's the dashboard? There's the dashboard. I can't afford to buy more candy. It's party time! This is like taking candy Friends from a turn. baby, which is fine Okay, by I updated me. the stream title. Which is fine by me. Of course, we know people won't necessarily read it. Some oh, people don't read those. Will you open arcade games here? Yeah! <laughs> oh Where man, is that, that is such a- fourth chaos That symbol. is such a pog part of the mall. Yeah. <laughs> you got an arcade oh, next to fun toys, and on the other side of fun toys is another arcade. Like, every kid wants that. So I'm going to restock Yamato music, and I'm just going to put a bunch of drum Yippee. sets. Oh, I don't have enough money. Oh. This is a risk. Yippee. Sometimes you just got to take a risk. Yippee. <laughs> Yippee. 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 I can't. Even if I could, I don't have the money. <laughs> hey, Lamasar. Thank you for resubscribing, Lamasar. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate your support so much. Yes, this is my Blinks the Cats or Blinks the Time Sweeper Sona. So Fernay yeah. is asking if I can sing oh, no. for How their amusement. I oh, I'm good. <laughs> you like the new cat? Mm. I see. <laughs> Sk 
Grunt's turn. Yep. Fucking Scrunt. <laughs> Simon says, oh man, George Video, I went to school with him. <laughs> Oh, hey, look you what's here! You cannot stop landing on the elevator. <laughs> I, I, I love her in the elevator! It's fun! I would love to make my way back to the bank at some point. <laughs> in the game. <laughs> we thought you were leaving the stream to go to yeah. a bank first. <laughs> oh, it's my turn. So, I'm just gonna I leave that giant Dot text and there. I have something to talk about today. Don't, don't we, Dot? Hmm? Oh? We have something to discuss. What? Especially with, with fast food connoisseur Dan Video Games here. Oh boy, what happened? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So, I had, for the first time in 15 years... I'm gonna buy a fighting Arby's. game. And I had Arby's today. How do you feel about Arby's? It's one of the foods I can eat, so... I don't really have much choice in liking it or not. <laughs> ah, right, true, right. I mostly find that from funny from the angle of it, it, it's framed almost like, well, I'm 30 years into this marriage, so I guess I love her. <laughs> 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 uh, that's, that's... Here's my take on Arby's. You ready? Huh? Yes. Ain't no good. Should have made it good. <laughs> Why didn't they make it good? Yeah. Hit, hit the good button. <gasps> I forgot I had a transparent version of this. Okay, sorry, I was distracted. <laughs> I've, I've been just browsing images I could change myself to, and I didn't realize I had a transparent version. <gasps> hey there, Esper White. I'm safe! I got a chicken sandwich, and it was good, but the curly fries were... They're, they're, just, they're too overcooked. I don't want to eat a rock of fries. Like, yeah, fries it was gotta curious be a little soft. rocks. So, you know, the thing is, you should get their crinkle fries instead, honestly. That's that, that's that's what I should have done, to be honest. But I didn't. I did the bad thing instead of the good thing. You should have done the good thing, Box. Why didn't you do the good thing? Yeah. I I think about this in life, and <laughs> and then I buy a book from Johnson. Books, There's a hydration which reminder. Is, which which I own it. <laughs> so now I'll now I'll restock arcade games. Streamers hydrate. I did. I did. I did. I promise. I ran out of juice. Oh no. <laughs> Well, do I want to restock a crane game, a puzzle game, or fighting game? Well, no one you fucks. It's gonna be a puzzle game. Panel de pawn. I want to open a DK Oldies in this mall. <laughs> DK Oldies? Do you not know about DK Oldies? I don't think I know about DK or like Donkey Kong Oldies. Yes. Yeah, I mean it's as close as they can come to infringing on. Nintendo's trademark without getting sued, yeah. Interesting. So I was right. Can't afford this anything. Isn't, this isn't actually transparent. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. Hey, what are you gonna do, right? No, I'm trying. Oh my god. There. <laughs> you might I be able to. I know you can't go into the negative. I, I did it wrong. Dan, you might be able to uh, Dan, just cut off the background and like Photoshop and it'll be decent. Oh, yeah. Magic wand it. I have a lot of my plate right now. I have to wear this frog outfit and walk around this mall and get sippies. <laughs> sippies? Sippies at the mall. Good point, good point. Oh no. Yeah. yeah. Oh no. I feel it. Oh no. Money, Money went to minus. minus. Who's minus? <laughs> Please minus sell a store. The flag. Excuse me? Is that the cousin of uh, Linus? Minus tech tips. Minus tech tips. Oh, oh no. And let me get you behind the game here. I'm gonna swap out this image for something in a second. You can't... You can't get rid of George video. I know, I can't do that, and I'm starting <laughs> like this fresh state empire. What do, what do you drink in Vox? Uh, a Ch Cherry 7-Up Zero Sugar. 
Oh, that sounds great. All of mine are at the house. The hole in the wall I live in. All I have at Bob's are Dye Mountain Dews. Bye, Animal World. Goodbye. You're all homeless parrots now. <laughs> no. Eh, Grilson, that was a, it. Grilson, that was a really good comic. I remember that. <laughs> that was Thank on the, you. like, Kiwis by Beat site or whatever, right? Thank you, Neo Zero, for the 69 bits. I really do just keep landing on my own spaces, huh? <laughs> At least you're not losing money. Yeah, you're right. Ready. I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess I'm playing it right. Yeah. You've been to the bank like 19 times too. I'm about <laughs> to get there the first time. Let me see if I can. Whatever. Seven. Hey, day. I have five points. How much mm. are those shoes? I just want to make sure. I'm not buying them, I just want to... It's nine points. Trip, trip. I yeah. didn't realize. I thought it was like tea, trip. Thank you, Resident what Kohai, the for the follow. What is that? The trip, trip? Hey, Resident Kohai, yeah. how are you? Uh, it makes it makes chirping sounds. You know, like those little, oh. uh, like, Easter... Yeah. I want them! Fox was going Super Saiyan for a second there. <laughs> Did you just close the store? Whose store was that? Was that mine? That was yours. It was. You had the most <laughs> money, so... <laughs> and now I'm gonna buy an apple pie. Hello, Resident Kohai. <laughs> now that I've just... economically ruined you, I'm gonna treat myself because I deserve it. <laughs> exactly. Just because I had the most money, you gotta close down my stores and take yes. money. Well, that's, that's it. I'm, I, I'm a libertarian yeah. now. Bonus. I'm a libertarian. <laughs> this is how it happens. This is the villain that's origin it. story. <laughs> one, one, one minor. Minor inconvenience in Please my life. Please don't say minor and libertarian in the same sentence. Thank <laughs> you. Oh no! <laughs> you know, I just remembered. I wanted to show the chat something. It's minor. I just oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm libertarian jokes. I'm, I'm trying this to make is a the new out. emote. You guys, oh, oh, you guys got us. Really good. Oh, bro, this, this is the really new good. emote. Oh, this is great. Good. Mav Cal made this. It. It's great. I can play through this one moment. No, I'll leave it up there. <laughs> I got this. Thank you, Anonymous Gifter, for gifting a sub to Sepisai. That's how you say that, right, Dot? I I always said Sepisai, but I never asked. Sepisai. Yeah, that's, that's what I was thinking, too. Sepisai. Um, I, was, I was trying to imitate what I thought Dot said it. I was wrong. We gotta do cooking fun so we can be like, what was he cooking? You know? Okay, you're right. And then I can go, fun. Yeah. And then, and then everyone could be like, ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I, I, Let me guess. This is any, <laughs> this is any anti creates except the one that made Mega Man ZX because that's the one I like. No, this, it, this 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 gift is from a very this is a years old gift when I had like a bunch of a bunch of <laughs> gifts all at once on the screen. Wow, that Comics is wild. April. Oh, this this explains it. This this one explains it. Yeah. <laughs> six X6, oh no. That does explain it. <laughs> the, conspiracy, the conspiracy theory we had that X6 was made by Inti <laughs> That would explain go. a lot. I am now cute. Are you a Tycho drum? Uh, no, this is Point B from the Netflix blockbuster mobile game, Point B. I oh, did a yes. really bad job editing out Point B. <laughs> It looks like you he's know, holding a taiko drum. He is. He slams like a hammer down. Imagine it's a bullet, basically. Ha! Huh. Why did that happen? Pretty, it's a pretty fun game. Hmm? Why did that happen? It said received cash back, and then I ended up you have, up buying it. You and have I told a my small fucking chance. Employees that there are no returns, so I don't know. You have a small <laughs> chance of getting money back on a purchase for some reason. I have no idea why. Huh. Even if I were to buy all this out, I wouldn't be able to buy the store, right? Because the store itself costs money. Yeah, that's true. Okay. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fox, you're so beautiful. <laughs> I'm in hell. <laughs> no, not yet. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, that. Okay, all of you need to think up doing Phantom of the Opera. <laughs> Uh, it just sounds like I died in a CGA video game. <laughs> <laughs> the PC speaker's going wild. Uh, I will go ahead and take one of my points away for $200 so I don't end up on the street. <gasps> Do I get to open something here? Oh my god. The Kingston. <laughs> the Kingston. <laughs> Drugs. Drugs. Anytime I see a picture of Kingston, I become happy. That Drugs. is good. That that makes sense. Fills me with joy when I when I when I see my boy. He's so handsome. Isn't he? I I finally did not land on the elevator. Oh, movie theater. You're the lucky. I would have sold you a condominium. Yeah, that that makes me want to see Fry I now. Can... So, princess, <laughs> I can look at this. That... What? <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> Don't you love that pose? Look at the it's text. It's really good. It's really good. <laughs> mm, yeah. Uh, wow, they're airing Sonic the Hedgehog 4's movie. It's the same. Thing. So, Which is shopping is obviously a reference to Kiki's delivery service. What Which genre? In Japanese, Majo no <laughs> Taku so, yeah. yeah. What genre do you think that deep sleep is? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sweet release. Like that could go anyway, right? That's a uh, that's that premium theater seat where they have like the lethal injection built in. Hey, look! <laughs> it is the three items you know from Tokyo restaurants: teriyaki beef, teriyaki chicken, and green tea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's definitely what those were in the Japanese version mm -hmm. too. Yeah, because that's <laughs> all J Japanese food is. Yeah. The funny thing is, oh, no. Dot, um, half the stores are completely different in the Japanese version. Like they, they redrew sense. them and everything. Have you ever played Sim Tower? Yes, I love uh, it. I played so much Sim Tower. Dude, I, okay, I love Sim Tower. There Man. was in middle school. There was a computer club that um we went to in school, and like all it was was us just playing Sim Tower. That was Man. the computer club was us playing Sim Tower. Wasn't Sim Tower I, in I, my I, top one hundred? Like... If it wasn't, it was a candidate. Yeah, I thought about putting it in mine, but I haven't played it in so long. Oh, thank God. I'm safe you guys here played at the Tower? Video. I'm safe here at George Video. <laughs> <laughs> this is, that's like a Chuck Testa style, like, irony commercial. Yes. <laughs> I was like, there's Ute Tower, which is the updated version by the original Japanese creator. Right, yeah, it's, it's like a sequel, basically. Yeah, it's basically a sequel slash expansion pack. It is really good. Yeah, I want to try that. I think I, like, bought it on GOG and then I never played it. Yeah, I never did check that out. Or or I pirated it. I know. I just Probably know pirated it because it's pretty old. Somehow, so. I mean, I, I play it within an install of Windows 3.1 installed in a DOS box. E! <laughs> okay. Uh, all right, I'm not going to look. This one. Oh. Oh, traffic. Like, oh. <laughs> this is actually a really appropriate... Uh, oh. Go for it. So my favorite Walking. one of the e cards is one that starts out with a text box that oh. says, "Here's a present Watch for," yeah. and then the next box of dialogue has nothing to do with that. <laughs> like it's just an, so it just says broke. It's not I, continuous I with the sentence. Being like that's a box coming, raise the prices. <laughs> what, do, what, do, what, do, what do I what do I do? I'm broke. You are forced to you buy at least something. To buy something. To buy the cheapest thing you can you and should, sell off the store. You should go more in debt and get a point. I want the video. You know how much you care about points. That's what I did. Money went to Money minus. Went to minus. <laughs> minus has the lead. I want to 
a so kid. <laughs> I think that's so illegal. Cash trusty. Let's sell this arcade. <laughs> I mean, there's another arcade right there. There's more arcade. So the game ends when either one of us has accumulated enough money to meet the goal, or, like, one of us goes bankrupt. Oh, only one person has to go bankrupt? It depends on the map, and you can oh, like you can turn it up, but I left it on default settings, I think it's set to one. Everyone stops playing when they get sad because one person ran out of money. It's very different to modern capitalism. <laughs> <laughs> Board games aren't supposed to end in a reasonable amount of time. You're supposed to play them for six hours because of all the house rules that perpetuate it forever. Yeah, that'd be fun. You talked long enough yeah. that I got to see that whole sprite. That looks, that's really good. That's invented. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I used to use it a while ago for the MMX, MMM. MMM, MMM. Images or whatnot. Mm -hmm. I love it. It's great. Oh, no. <laughs> Mmm, mmm. I wanna buy coffee. Never mind, I want hot chocolate. What do you mean you don't want to play an hour plus long game of Richie Mahjong with me? <laughs> Says Cockavent. <laughs> I'd rather play a few rounds of a game than just one uh -huh. super long board game. That's just me. I don't know. Yeah, that's, do you that's the big reason right that. Oh, whatever. I'm gonna go eat so I feel better about this. Give me, give me the. I want, I want the experience. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's that's why I put us on a relatively small map with a relatively short like goal. So I didn't, I didn't think about what I was doing. <laughs> so goodbye, Gameland. Goodbye, Gameland. <laughs> I miss you. <laughs> just, just imagine you're an employee there. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy's been drinking. I may have spent too much. Goodbye, employees. And then you close the yeah. shutter on them. <laughs> uh, uh, That's exactly what just happened. There. That's like, great. You just sealed into the back He's of a gone. dead ball. Okay, I was that. I was gonna say, I can't wait for Dan Bell to do his video about our mall here. <laughs> it's not hard to see why this went out of business. <laughs> <laughs> Five George video locations on the second floor alone. <laughs> One of the top floors trying to get you to buy a condo. Yeah. <laughs> and then this other shop was selling children. Well, Star Sweep <laughs> looks really good. You should buy it. I don't think I got a point for that. Huh. Uh, well, you should, you should buy Star Sweep so you get a point. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, it didn't give a point. What? Thank you. Give a point what that is either. going on? I just lost a ton of money for no no game. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's door strikes again. <laughs> Can we stop at the fresh stop? Oh, yes. I love how slow the elevator is for no reason. I know, right? Well, it is somewhat Run. realistic. True, but why should it be? It shouldn't be realistic. It should be like jet engines in there. <laughs> Crazy Twitter Sony fanboys are like, if this had an SSD, it could load the elevator faster. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Um, oh, I got a point for that. <laughs> okay. Maybe the points are random. <laughs> hey, I'll, take, I'll take it. Let's the go. This is like I want orange candy. The game's like you have good taste. Have a point. Unlike Dot, who has bad taste. No point. <laughs> oh, thank goodness <laughs> I landed on my own store. I'm so yeah. low on money. <laughs> I'm not even going to restock. I don't have money. <laughs> We're just a bunch of that, broke kids who run stores in the mall. No. This is this is like. Don't do it. You don't have enough money. Yeah, I super don't. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank God. Yeah, Why? but if somebody had landed on it, if somebody had landed on it, <laughs> it's a big if, though. Yeah, it is. Hey, I'm cooking fun. 
<laughs> so sorry, I have to ask, how is Ragnarok Online number 56 on your list? Well, I quite enjoy- surprising one for me. I quite enjoy Ragnarok Online, but the thing is, like, there's a bunch of history I have with it that drags it down a little. Thank you, Digital Basic, for following. And yet, at the same time, like, at the same time, like, I just love the game so much, and it meant so much to me. Like, I ran a private server for several years, so that can tell you how much Ragnarok Online means to me. It's just, there's some history there. <laughs> so it's mixed My feelings. My Bitstop only has one thing in it, it's shrimp. Thank you, Neo Zero, for gifting a sub to Digital Basic. I have a history, and it's all funny to me. <laughs> that's fair. Hey, land in a bit. Woo! Oh, dang, back. that's a lot of money. Oh my goodness. I got eight points. Okay, I think... receive 200 money is one point. Receive 400 money is three points. Yeah, uh, but you don't land on the bank very yeah. often to exchange them. Exactly. That's but the thing. Still... Oh, yeah, okay. No, 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 it makes sense. It's like it when does. you overnight a package. Yeah. The cost goes up inordinately, you know? Okay. <laughs> or... <laughs> if you can receive 700 work. for six. All right, Thank I you, need to Pumpkin get 50 Girl, for gifting a subject referee. Yeah. Like a mess here. Open a store for free? Yep, in a random location. So it could be a really cheap store, or it could be a really expensive store. Mm. And the rival the pencil capture thing. Capture rival <laughs> Yeah, if it has no has items, no then items. you get the store for free. But oh. it has to it has to be out of stock. That's terrifying. Why yep. you just own someone like just be like, oh nice money. Yep. <laughs> There's a lot of really cruel Jeez. stuff in this. That's cruel. The players reverse. Money yeah, it needs to be all turn around. <laughs> yep. So I'm pretty so sure money doubled just doubles oh, how much. the shoes! There's I so yep. many. There's I so think many... I might have enough points for those shoes now. If not, I'm one away. <laughs> you know, I, I I forgot about the shoes for a second, so I think I just need to get myself yeah. another point here. And... <laughs> you almost lost sight of the goal. The I goal know. is the shoes. I know. Oh god, please don't land me on somewhere dangerous. <laughs> it's sufficient money. Damn. Oh, never mind. We're good. <laughs> Would you like to watch Princess Amy? Well, is it like the sequel to Princess Bride, or is it more like Princess Diaries? It's basically Princess Bride, but retold with Sonic characters. Okay, I would kill that to watch sick. that. Where's that damn fourth <laughs> Chaos Emerald? Seriously, that would be amazing. <laughs> Sega, take note. That is what yeah, you should do for the next Sonic you. game. <laughs> really good, okay. actually. Aesthetics, Julia. <laughs> yeah. Or home needs. What's more important to you? Probably not going bankrupt. But, 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 but aesthetics Julia. Yeah, some YouTuber. Bomb. Scrunt. Okay, I'm Fucking gonna go hydrate scrunt. finally. Cooking fun. No, I'm going the elevator. Bye. I don't know if that was a good, good play. I just wanted to ride the elevator again. It looks like people are speculating <laughs> the casting for Princess oh, Amy in the chat. <laughs> oh, oh, does your chat know I can kind of do a Big the Cat voice, actually? Go for it. It's not as good as my... You've heard my Big the Cat, right? Yeah, I have. It's not as good as my Lick a Tongue. But <clears throat> I, need a, I need a second to warm up. <laughs> I'm going to do Lick a Tongue first, okay? Okay. <laughs> That's really good. Yeah, it's it's perfect. I, I don't know why. I feel like, you know, as superpowers go, I would have preferred to be able to, like, fly under my own power or something, but I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> Noodle House is mine, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I come back. We're talking about superpowers. What? Yeah, yeah. Little. That's, that's my lick-a-tongue voice. That's pretty those. good. Uh, up until 
not last Friday, but the Friday before that, Bob had never played the Lickitung uh, Sushi mini game in Pokemon Stadium. Luckily, <laughs> it's a really good mini game. Uh, I remember that. They said it was crystal clear at the time. Okay. Oh, oh no. Space shot. Yay, I got a point because when I bought it, it was cool. Yeah. <laughs> my name is Shadow the Hedgehog. Kid. You killed my Maria. Prepare to die. <laughs> Foggy. <laughs> Foggy. Foggy. Oh, that's great. What the? That was scary. <laughs> that was scary. I'm not looking. Oh, I, I don't that? know what it I is, a... but it's adorable. Here's a I present a for. Oh, is this the like mistranslated one? Here's, Here's a, present a present for. for. For, for who? I'll give 700 to Scrunch. I'll give, I'll give 700 to <laughs> Scrunch. Maybe that's minus. See, it just... <laughs> that's minus. That's... See, it doesn't naturally it's follow. It's... This is an unrelated sentence fragment. It's like the line was translated twice. Yeah. <laughs> oh god, my candy shop's almost out of items. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. It's now full of snacks. Ha ha ha! Rich heavens left. Oh no! You can do it. I wish. Hello, hello. Hello. I swear I was in the window. Ooh, event. What's this? Oh. Uh oh. I that think you could sell good. it for more than its normal to price, me. though. I like two <laughs> Oh. Oh. Well, 2.5x. <laughs> that's not too bad. That's not too bad, actually. I mean, hey. Yeah, yeah look at the you. assets in some of those. You'd make a ton of money off think some of these. Think about the fucking yeah, employees. I, I do, uh, the movie theaters. <laughs> Fuck them. Gotta go. Time to liquidate your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy standing on the street corner with the sign. <laughs> I heard Shut that your in shoulders, like a, capitalism. I heard that in like a Mega Man robot, Mega Man Eight robot master voice. Oh I'm man! To liquidate you, Rock or Mega Man. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I did what Wiley or what what uh, Doctor Light did. I started to say Rock Man and stuttered. <laughs> Mega Dr. Man. Wally. That's definitely what's going on with that one line. Like someone well, pointed it out to me and you cannot unhear yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. Once. I know it too. This like, is a message from the information desk. All stores are closed. Two turns. Oh. oh yes. Shut it down, gamers. <laughs> Shut it down. What? The mall is closed. Fuck, oh, I wanted to go play some arcade games. <laughs> It's no use! Okay, but you could call me handsome. I get to open a... Oh, I could... A movie theater, huh? This seems like a good place for a movie theater. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's open. It's not closed. Hey, how about that? <laughs> hey, the mall's closed, but we just opened a new store you can go to. In the mall. <laughs> doesn't this See kind you of in my the mall dreams. Closing, like the entirety of December? That doesn't seem like a sound business plan. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so can we can we talk about Mega Man 8's voice lines? Yes. Um, we already are. So, Shh. Clown Man. <laughs> Clown Man is like the most bizarrely voiced character because he has lines that are like, "This isn't a laughing matter." But, like, he says it really quickly, and then there's... He's just a dude. He looks kind of like a clown, I guess. Sort of. <laughs> and, but he doesn't He doesn't do any, like, funny things. Yeah. It's... Like, he just... he All he does is say ironic clown things. Like, this isn't a laughing matter. And he swings Very around, I guess. And it's like, that's it. And then you're just like, what? <laughs> I, I kind of get what they're going for. Like, oh, it's a clown. This isn't laughing matter. That's funny. But like, no, it's just like some random dude shows up. This isn't laughing matter. And you're like, I, oh, right. I forgot that you're fucking clown man. And then it's <laughs> a toy thing. Like, I literally forgot. Oh, we lost Dan. Bye, Dan. Y yeah, my, uh, my thing was having a problem one moment. I miss you already. You too? Oh, I can't buy any fish.
Okay, I sent- I put another invite link. I have no idea why it's having problems. Okay, there we go. My goodness. I'm good yeah, now? Yeah, it was really bad for like a minute or two straight. Aww. I was just playing through it. I was like, please don't accidentally spend $1,700 opening the <laughs> shop. <laughs> yeah, it's all good now. Yeah, remember to press a button in the parsec window. Thank you, Professor Rad. Oh no, it was it was the um the video literally was just playing like a frame uh, every other second or Ooh. something in the audio. Ooh, I see. Yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty. Hey, Jade Farrell. Hi, Jade Farrell. So Thank you. Yeah, you see, only recently did I have enough bandwidth that I could actually host all of you guys like this because. We had a really crappy connection that couldn't even really handle me and drop, like having Parsec open and me streaming at the same time. Mm -hmm. But, you know, that was a real problem because we have like three streamers in the house. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's a nightmare. So we finally I got a connection upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, what should I get? <laughs> I think you should, should I, get, I, a I get a snack. I snack? I could get a snack. I have a snack. <laughs> uh. I think you're it right. This is really I think what getting get food with boxes like, by the way. That's yeah. great. Hey. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold hey, on. Box, what do you want to eat? Oh, what a burger again. Okay, let's go. Okay, first of all, that's because I'm no, I still do not live anywhere near a Whataburger, so I can't get it. So when I visited <laughs> you, and you're the one who suggested it like half the time too. <laughs> okay. Second of all, what Dot is referring to is like, remember when we went to the grocery store and then we're like, oh, let's get some candy. And I just stood there in front of it and I was like, Dan, I don't know. Thank you so much, JC. <gasps> dude, dude, dude. <gasps> alert. Alert. Uh, let's go, 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 let's go. There. Yes. Yes, Bob. The <laughs> 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 game rules. <laughs> <laughs> now, now you can go buy your stuffed animal with your squeaky toys. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's my store, technically. Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm very indecisive. When it comes to, like, food and whatnot and snacks. Oh, thank God I'm safe yet again in the George video. Hey, Go Tetsu, how are you? I completely forgot about the donation bar. It's at 6,000%. <laughs> wow. Because oh, yeah. I said it is $1, because it's all Vox do that, and I thought it was hilarious. Yeah, it's funny. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of empty space. Why am I putting this here? I put it up so, here. <laughs> so, is there anything else like the Chirp Chirp shoes in here? Not that I'm aware of, no. No, there isn't. Trip with me, please. Okay, well, all of, like, I could play, I have a lot of points, so there's a bunch of things I could do that. Yeah, there's actually win, good stuff. Help me win the game. <laughs> there's a lot of... Uh, <laughs> but, but what if... Flower Heart Johnson Bugs. Thank you for that birthday wishes, I'm gonna Katsu. win up Flower Heart. Can't you trip like I do? My dude's got purple hair. A tree just dunking the cat, whose name is Meower, by the way, in that bowl. Meower? <laughs> yeah, Meower. This game has an entire story mode, actually. What? <laughs> you play as Meower, and it has an entire Iris. story mode. <laughs> Iris. Iris. Oh! Ah! <laughs> uh, oh, look at me go. Who's winning? Uh, well, Gotets, uh, Dot Level and I both have Chirp Chirp shoes, so I'm pretty yeah, sure we are currently yeah. tied for winning. <laughs> you can kind of tell who's winning by the total assets, but it's hard to read the assets on the yellow player because it's still yellow. Uh-huh. <laughs> Did you just... Yep. What? <laughs> what? I left that Is store that out of stock. Oh, because I, I had to buy something, but I couldn't afford to buy the store, so it was just left there, vulnerable. This is why you restock. Oh. 
I was in Tempai. Fucked up. <laughs> Thank you, Captain Two Face, for the ten bits. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Chirp, 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 chirp. I'm glad it sounds exactly like those little chicks for Easter. Oh, you stick game them in lands your hand. back on the menu. <laughs> you know what? I should I should color our labels based on which player we are, so people know easier. Oh, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> what the? Why? <laughs> Look at the price. I can get a glass a or a bowl, bowl that costs more, <laughs> or a spoon. That's that spoon. That's that spoon from the spoonful meme. <laughs> I'm right next I to the bank, so this is okay. So much. You can have a spoonful. <laughs> it yeah. pulls out the biggest spoon ever. <laughs> I love it. It's so good. Okay, let me let me correct these colors. Hey! Hey! What, what movie are you buying? Are you ready for Winter Princess stopping. Amy? Oh, damn it. Come on, buy Princess Amy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you can't own princesses, man. I don't know what I thought of video games. <laughs> One moment, let me go back to the woman earned. Yeah, oh, no. yeah. I'm never gonna be able to afford trip trips. Well, that's why you gotta <laughs> save up. You can get another point right now. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Okay, they are, the names are all player Horror. colored now. Cool. It's actually helping remind me which one I am. That's good. That is actually a few helpful. times someone has like landed on one of my stores and I don't react because I completely forgot it was me. Yeah, I'm like, that's where did money come from? <laughs> <laughs> so what you're saying is you're a Florida business owner? Oh no! Yeah. <laughs> Developing. Oh, I got a point. You can't just you know buy developing. Florida? You did? Developers, developers, oh, I worked developers, many, many developers. years in my life developing people's film. The things Me I've too, seen. actually. Scrum. Let's see. Can I see the objective here? Did you ever have Arcan that moment where you call over a manager and you go, should we call the cops? <laughs> um, not call the cops, but like, uh, I'm not going to print this. Yeah, I had those. But yeah, we can see the target okay, assets right uh, here. I just realized that's good. 12,000. Uh, if somebody has 12,000 to their name, then they they win. Or at least oh, the game you is. saving in case it crashes? Yeah. Sar just, you know, it's been a while. Save it's not a bad idea. <laughs> payday. It is payday. I like payday. It's a decent candy. Thank you, yeah, Crystal. Look who's, look who's not saving up. <laughs> My brain is deeply fried right now. Payday is peanuts, nougat, caramel, question mark? It's I used to like those quite a lot. Yeah, yeah. Basically that, Dan. It's like covered okay. in peanuts. Yeah. I just made a face. It sounds gross. <laughs> I like them. <laughs> I would eat one right now. It's, uh, it's basically what, just what peanuts sort of... and caramel. There's no nougat. Yeah, what kind of... What kind of uh, candy bar do you like, Dot? Crunch bars. Yeah. Yeah. So, my favorite right. is probably Reese's Cups. That's not a bar, but I will say, if you want bar form, I really like Reese's Sticks. Yeah. Never had them. They're, um... I need it. No. Kind of like wafers, but... No. My store. Speaking of candy... <laughs> <laughs> like yeah, a plague. <laughs> yeah, Reese's sticks are something you might not see very uh -oh. often, but they're oh, wait, they're interesting. Me. We're good. Um, my favorite candy bar hasn't been made in 17 years. Oh no, what was it? What is it? Snickers Cruncher, and it was the best ever. <sighs> it was so good. It was incomparable. My favorite candy, I think, has been discontinued for like 10 or 15 years too. Do you remember the waterfalls? That no. the, it was like a Wonka thing. I'm gonna have well, to look this up after my turn. You oh. know, Dot. I know they're gone, but you really shouldn't shouldn't be chasing. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. 
As a kid, what I liked the most was this gummy bear snack called Amazing Fruit, and it's gone. It was way better fruit flavor than normal gummy bears. It was just super fruit flavor. Oh, fun toys. Oh, yeah. Nice shoes. <laughs> I want the plastic model. I understand. Good point. So, so you were saying it's called Waterfalls, and it's yeah. um, Willy Wonka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. It's some kind of candy brand, anyway. Uh, huh? Oh, okay. No idea. That <laughs> cat on Rush Happy Toaster. That's Kingston. That's not just that cat. Our Lenny store can be sold for Kingston. two point five. I Optional posted though. A picture. Oh lord. Is that a... Yeah. <laughs> That's a no-brainer. I'm rich. <laughs> Damn. My god. My god. <laughs> I went from being in last to being in first really fast. E. What? No. This is my command. Dot level can purchase an empty store. You can press left or right to change stores, maybe. I, oh, no, this is the only, only one? Only oh, no. One. Yeah. I guess there aren't many empty oh, stores. Up tour tours. <laughs> I was just thinking, I hope I spend hundreds of dollars. <laughs> <laughs> many are saying this. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> no. I do uh, like that it shows the value of, like, the cheapest thing in the store so that you know what you're landing on. <laughs> so you know what you're getting Dragon into. Yeah. Door. I wish real stores did that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, chirping. So, Da, I, I posted the chocolate bar in the uh, private voice text. That's it, right? Let me see. Right, do I want to buy a condo apartment? I'll, I'll buy an apartment for 224 What the hell? Yeah, although you didn't have to get it in bar form. You could also buy, like, bags of... Ah. Bags of apartments? So, yes, bags yes. of apartments. I've had two pieces of art appear during the stream, and I haven't shown either of them, so let me grab this new one from Dragon Cat Man. You gotta do it. Nice. Chocolate waterfall. I need that. Let me take my turn before I show them so that... Oh, I'm on one of my squares. Let's see, are any of these I'm impersonating Kingston. I'm being represented by Kingston. Or yeah. King. Kingston is your, like, spirit animal in this case. Yeah. Did you know that this candy store sells yo-yos? <laughs> That's not surprising, actually. Uh, yeah, actually, you know, you how, know, how it's, toys it's like store? those, uh, what are they called? Wagashiya-san or whatever, do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> I mean, I guess it makes sense, actually. It's just kind of inexplicable, right? Oh, hey, they sell yo-yos here. <laughs> so, all right, bye. So first of all, I got this art, which is just great. Bug. I think that Dot can tell who drew this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Endemion. And let's get the dragon cat man. Oh, Maple McKenzie, thank you for raiding. Maple McKenzie, thank you so I much for raiding. <laughs> Dan, what? What's up? You have to move <laughs> on, Dot. You That's can't just be <laughs> thinking about me all the time. <laughs> oh no! This is like in uh, in FF4. <laughs> Hello, Algula. Hello, Stevens. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for the birthday wishes. So this is the other piece of art I've received from Dragon Cat Man. Thank you so much, Dragon Cat Man. <laughs> it's lovely. Very nice. Thank you. <laughs> it's adorable. Oh, Dan, I just oh, noticed. <laughs> what? It's Don's yeah. having a vision. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's perfect. That's perfect. It's like in a cartoon. Or like in, in Big Top Pee Wee, when the <laughs> the tiger escapes from the zoo and it looks at Pee Wee 
and it just sees Pee Wee as a giant steak. I remember, remember that. that. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they did that in cartoons all the time, didn't they? Like Looney Tunes? Yeah. Yes. My favorite one of those is um, instead of it being someone else's perception of another character, it's the one where they look at the perspective and they turn into a sucker. <laughs> yeah. I've been there. I haven't watched a Looney Tune in many no, years. No, what is missing? Thank you all so much for the birthday wishes. Miss. Maybe. Miss. <laughs> all right, okay, cool. <laughs> she said miss a bunch of times, like, all right, see ya. So, Maple, what were you up to? Um, it doesn't look like anybody gave a shout out or anything. Uh, One. I would, but I'm not a mod. Yeah. Want to give I'm a big not shout out I'm not to Maple thing. McKenzie? <laughs> She's really cool. I mean, that's plays correct. Plays games that I like and uh, builds dams, I think. Dark Souls so 2. Big, big shout outs to Maple McKenzie. There, I did it. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, VIPs shout have out, access to that? Huh. George Video? Yeah. I'd like one video game, Would you game, like to please? buy video game? Oh, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> Follow Maple, she's great. <laughs> I bought two video games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord, Dan. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Look, sometimes people bring me images. I don't ask for them, but... <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> By the way, I just bought Vox's Arcade. There's an Aesthetics Julia there now. Hey, what the fuck? <laughs> Dan has a 4090. He's a right opinion haver. Yes, that's correct. <gasps> yeah, it, I Except have with an AI. I have a lot of correct opinions, but I have a 3090 tie. So unfortunately, I'm always right. <laughs> <laughs> I have a 3060 Ti. Oh, that's still Pog. It is Pog, but it's actually not good for like VR chat because it wants oh. more like VRAM or whatever. Really? Yeah. It, well, it's good. It, it's you do need a lot of VRAM for VR. I didn't realize. It's not optimal for that. So, but I'm. It's still fine, and I'm not fucking buying a new video card. For <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, Nvidia needs some pressure to lower the price on these things. I actually did a calculation uh, yesterday of how bad of deals they're doing as of late, and it's uh -huh. over time. Graphics are supposed to become cheaper, but it's literally Why half. Why is it spending my money here? I thought this would be screwing you over. Oh. It's messed up. Man. <laughs> Sorry for having great ray tracing and correct opinions. Like it's my fault. <laughs> as if it's my fault. Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, look, everything I say is right, not identically phrased to a thing I'm referencing. <laughs> but not. Because I'm really bad about that. I'm really glad the elevator didn't take me down to some sort of bank to give me more money. Yeah, that, that's great. <laughs> it would be awful. It's great Stop that it didn't do that. No. <laughs> What? <laughs> you can also what? walk backwards by pressing the cancel button. Ooh. Oh, that's Ooh. good. Why can't I stop here? <laughs> oh, no. I'm learning a lot. Okay, I have some noodles. Please shop for an item. Uh, Might I recommend no. a pork noodle? <laughs> no. I'm imagining Dot with like a sushi chef hat now. I mean, not imagining imagining because I can't. It would look so good. Still has this cool. Zelda shirt. Scrunt's turn. I'm Scrunt. Fucking Scrunt. <laughs> <laughs> Zelda shirt and khaki shorts, but a sushi chef. Ooh, hey. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's um, popcorn time. Hmm. Rick will never find Scrunt at this rate. I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna save my points. 
I'm gonna earn a point. That's what I'm gonna do. Cooking fun! I love a bowl! Wait, if I just buy this item now, do I get to buy the shop? <laughs> yes, if you have enough money, oh, yeah. you can buy the shop immediately. <laughs> I'm sorry, I heard the Guts fan sound. So I yep. That's great, right? Every every time I just hear the most outrageous one where he yells, that's my ass. It's a Johnson <laughs> books now. Ah. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. I've always oh. loved that. Oh no. This is my command. All stores are closed one turn. Good. <laughs> Deserved, honestly. Capitalism is dead. Temporary closed. Temporary it doesn't, closed. Yeah, it doesn't say temporarily. <laughs> Temporary clothes is what I wear to the gas station when I throw on a Vegeta shirt. <laughs> I looked down just to make Punch sure I turn. wasn't wearing my Vegeta shirt today. No, huh. I am not. That is. I'm not what are you wearing? Shirt today, unfortunately. Oh, I'm wearing shop. a Sonic and Knuckles shirt. Oh, pod. I got it at the Walmart. <laughs> I like how the November sign isn't anything seasonal. It's just them pointing at a painting that says November. Yes. <laughs> I'm actually not wearing a game ring shirt today. <gasps> I'm not. You're not usually, a gamer today. No. Dot actually saw what I was wearing. That's true. Was it a Vegeta shirt? No. <laughs> <laughs> and if anybody wants some very gamer shirts, we have merch here. <laughs> well, I, you know, my merch. <laughs> Wait, you have merch? I sure do. Wow. And I get a share Why of buy it. buy jeans and, and wax and when you could buy a shirt from sarlanetv slash merch. Yeah. And, um... The store I'm using has a feature that lets people gift merch the way you would gift a sub. Like, it's it's wild. Oh, cool. Thank you for the follow, Eternal Warrior JD. Um, so we do not have any flipped currently, which means my next image will be a okay. You can this flip is, it yourself. What I'm doing for the entire yeah, that's what I'm doing. I want to make sure I face the correct way from stream. <laughs> you know, I don't want to... I don't want to be in the corner of Sara's birthday party. <laughs> they don't know I'm right about everything. <laughs> Game land, done. All right, open it up, baby. Game <laughs> land, woo! We got a big old game land over here. Oh man, that is a What's big up, land. Gamers. Game uh, land, game oh, land, no. Game land. Yeah, oh no! Game land. Yeah, buy game land, yo. Get some go karts. Haunted house. <laughs> Ride the carousel? Yep. Uh, have you seen a carousel in a mall? I have. Huh. Yeah. I haven't. That's crazy. I like the idea that like you're buying the go-karts, not like riding them once. Yeah. yeah. But it could be riding once. Like you ride the go-kart once and it's like, alright, do you want to buy a store? So, so something <laughs> funny. <laughs> Tour Tours. Nobody's landed on Tour Tours, I don't think, but it just has locations. Hey, hey. You great if you buy it, you just leave the game for a couple turns. <laughs> it's, like <laughs> that, right. it's like that scam Wait. thing where you can buy a star. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> yeah. Is it is it ten dollars or it's nine? <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, Dan. Let's yes. go. Chirp, 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 chirp. I have ascended. Dan, I think Tosh is calling you out. What? Look up a chat. What? What, what am I? in the dead store. This what is you I have, Dan. You lie. I don't. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Wait. Did you get carousels and Ferris wheels mixed up? I have to go. <laughs> <laughs> My lawyer has informed me I cannot answer this question. <laughs> you know, I could, Dan. I think I was thinking of like a full size carousel rather than like one that just but fits little kids. <gasps> bar from Espetra? Each player took a hundred from Scrunt. Oh. What? Good. That? That's not very, yeah, that's not very good God. at all. What the hell? 
since Dan was wrong, he had to change his image from holding the book that said everything I say is right. <laughs> yes. I don't want to lie on Star Stream. That might get her in trouble with the FTC. <laughs> oh no! Ooh, bonus. That is a lot of money. Oh man, I I am getting so much money. I think I might actually win the game at this rate. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna win the game instead of getting chirp chirp shoes. Not one k. What do you mean right? money double? Oh hell yeah. I'm pretty sure that money double is only for money you make that next turn. Oh no, uh, that's not the. Mm. Can you imagine? Which Just could get 6, be a thousand money deal. double. I win. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm playing through Mega Man Battle Network, uh, one and two, and now I'm on three. And they didn't retranslate them for the Legacy Collection. So sometimes you'll look at a card and it'll say attack three square, and I'm like, which three? <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Because they have like maybe eight words, because yeah. the character limit is so small. You I pick up a card and it's just like, do a thing. Yeah, sometimes it really is just like, okay, I'm going to have to like use it to have any remote idea what what it, what it means. Yeah, sometimes it'll say something like, trigger with bomb. Yes. <laughs> uh, oh, game land. Yeah, home needs. I need a home. Damn, I heard that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. Crunch <laughs> turn. So I'm. My taxes are complicated this year. So for the first time ever, I listened to advice I got from two different people, and I went to a tax professional. And this person, not to be mean, very very bad at their job. Oh no. <laughs> uh, and I will not go into detail on that. But after they see the catastrophic number at the end of all of this, and I'm like, I literally came to you to make that number go down. Which did not happen. Uh, they then go, Hey, have you considered buying a house? <laughs> <laughs> no, please tell me more. <laughs> have you considered buying a I'm house? Like, I'm like, you're looking at the numbers here and how much money they just took and how, like, no! <laughs> Wow, oh, you Lord. owe a lot of taxes. Have you considered buying a house? Yeah, that's... I don't know, have yeah. you considered going and fucking yourself? Yeah, Ooh. no, it was... Oh. <laughs> I saw this is like taking candy from a baby, I didn't which is fine right? by me. Card. Yeah. E. I, I like that it's after Ooh. them being very, very bad at their job. Yes, because really? I gave Vox details on that. Here's she a present for her. Very nice right now. Oh, wow. Dan just got a thousand. I'm so rich. <laughs> I should buy a house. <laughs> yeah, Adam, it's true. You do get tax breaks for owning a house, oh, but hell also... Hell yeah! Like, Elevator, if you can, my old friend. You can afford <laughs> to own a house, you probably can pay your taxes. Elevator, yeah, you betrayed I... me! Yeah, yeah, occasionally no, he just... He to me last time, too. Occasionally he just sends you to the same floor, which is great if you're on the bottom and you just went to the bank and landed on the elevator. Oh my goodness. Well, hey, Vox, were you on the bottom? Hey, Tiff. I hear it's really great for bottoms. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> uh, should, hey, I think I'll buy a condo. <laughs> getting a condo. Yeah, just buy the <laughs> fucking house. Let's go. <laughs> my taxes are better. <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Golden jewelry. Bought all the houses. Now here's all jewelry. He was a good man. Nice. What a rotten way to die. <laughs> I can't uh -oh. imagine going to like I don't know what's what's a tax place. H uh, and R H and R block. block. Going like H and R block and like asking them to help me with my taxes and they like know less than I do. Yeah, and was... then be like, hey, why don't you just go buy a sports car? Then we would write that off. And I'd <laughs> just be like, what? what are you, what are you doing? Uh, can I walk so, on toy? So my story <gasps> is, look... last time I went to an H&R Block, after they did my taxes, they asked me if I would like to take a class to learn how to do taxes. And I took it, and I immediately knew more than they did. <laughs> yeah, no, it is that bad. 
Uh, I'm imagining like you look. He like turns. You, like you have forced him to look at like look at his monitor. You're like, what the hell are you doing over here? You turn it over and they're playing that Steam game with the anime girl about like asking for tax information. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Somebody needs to draw that. They like it's a comic. I'm going, going to Evo. Mama, and it's like, what are you doing? <laughs> I bought going to Evo. Don't you love the store yeah, variety like in this game, though? Like, kid. there's so many. Yeah. Like, kid. Where you oh, can lord, look at my puzzle boy. Puzzle boy. Yeah, these are definitely video games, but what the heck at these prices? Like, ooh. Uh, well, yeah, actually, actually puzzle, puzzle Boy is quite expensive on the second-hand market these days. Oh, Not I as see. Not Amazing Tater, though. Oh, and it's, Hello, an, and it's an incredible game, but worth games. the experience, actually. So <laughs> I think you need to stop criticizing my prices. I'm not those damn video here. games, and today I'm here to talk about the classic that is Star Sweep. I bought Puzzle Boy from Box, and it was supposed to be refurbished. It didn't work, and I opened it up, and it was just full of dust. Oh, are you criticizing someone in my clique in the retro community? I would not recommend that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, oh, I no. love how I know this information. <laughs> I know exactly what's being talked about, too, I think. <laughs> Not recommended. Look, all I'm saying is, are you gonna complain about those prices, knowing that that's what helps Kingston have food on his plate? Speaking exactly. of which, I'm gonna go buy him some fish now. Nice, right, Kingston. You want some shrimp? Do you think cats like shrimp? I don't know. They do. Um, they probably they do. do. Yeah. It's got protein, right? So. Yeah. yeah. I've seen fry. I've seen fry I mean, steel something like that from Roto before. Like, Roto ordered sushi <laughs> once, and yeah. <laughs> yeah, I actually looked into it once. Um, you gotta... You gotta get shrimp that doesn't have certain stuff in it. Like, yeah, that makes sense. Like, you... Oh. The, the easiest way to do it is just go organic, <laughs> which sounds really expensive, so have fun reading the labels. And so, yeah. <laughs> so I like that screwdriver is two words here. It's screwdriver. Yeah. Screwdriver as two words sounds like it would be a fighting game move. <laughs> <laughs> or, it, like, you need a screw delivered from Amazon. It's the screwdriver. <laughs> and then it's the boy from Initial D. Jumping <laughs> his way into your heart with the screwdriver. Screwdriver so is a special move in a golf game. Shop for an item. I'll rent a room, whatever. Yes. This is how I win. I'm really thinking about it. Yeah, I Forget see it. I'm not gonna go. Oh. Uh, wait. You guys gotten sick of this music yet? No. I'll live. <laughs> I, I miss my empire. <laughs> Why do you need Damn. to move it? I, now I need to buy a house. I don't know. <laughs> I was just pondering. <laughs> Man, Tor Tours is probably the most powerful store in the game, and when you get it to max level, the stuff in it is extremely overpriced. Like, there's something that costs like 20 48 or something. 18 karat gold, it's, it's cheap. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Scrunt. Sandy says, This music takes me back to the time I rode the carousel at the mall. <laughs> <laughs> George Video Poppin' Corn. George Video Games. <laughs> George, George Video Games. <laughs> I don't know why none of us made that joke yet. I think someone in chat did, and I was like, oh, that's cool. Oh. I wish I thought of that. <laughs> oh, that's my uncle. I do like fries. No, really, you like fries? Shocking, I, I wouldn't know. have guessed. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah, Vox, I think I you may coffee. have actually witnessed me eating fries before. <laughs> Star coffee! Oh, all we got is lemonade! <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> night nightmare. <laughs> uh, all we got is lemonade. Fine, I'll take the lemonade. Okay, do you want it with olive oil or not? <laughs> 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 oh no! Uh, I guess I'll have coffee. it with 
Yeah, I don't know. Everyone who's tried it is like, it doesn't really do anything to the taste and it gave me the shits. <laughs> oh. Yeah, because I mean, I, that that makes sense. Sense. I haven't had it, but that's funny what it would do to me because that much straight fat. Ugh. Now, if the fat was gay. That's what I was what about to say. Subject? What if they were trans fats? Uh, oh! I am not using this. That elevator. would be very bad for no. you. <laughs> <laughs> mm, this tastes like cancer. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> I remember when I first became aware of what trans fats were, and I was working at Walmart, and it was like, yeah, trans fats are super terrible for you, and they'll kill you. And I'm like, yeah, but the popcorn shrimp's really good, so. You just I don't take know. my store? No. No, I'm going I'm to. The... I'm going to fill your store with cheap crap. Oh, what the hell? I'm the poorest freaking fucker over here. There, now Game like, Land is yeah, full of go-karts. Get her ass. What the hell? I mean, I paid for them. <laughs> <laughs> Praying on the weak. Whatever, boss. <laughs> if you really wanted to get ahead, you would have a second job. <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm making sure there's more legs than Aesthetic Julia. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want legs, arms, or massage? Um. No. Miss. Oh, that's rough. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it just I wastes your turn. I got abducted by aliens. Do you yeah, I think that's you what. what <laughs> Mire says she wants frog legs. Oh, Milton Ho. Oh, Milton Ho. Oh, thank God, drugs. <laughs> is that how this dream is making you feel? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm getting stressed out by all this capitalism going on. Yeah. I wasn't sure you guys would enjoy this game, but this has been a great oh, stream. Oh, wow. no, I'm really enjoying this. <laughs> yes? Yes. The problem is it makes me want candy and coffee. Like, really <laughs> well, I, I guess I know what I'm doing after uh, after we're done here. After we're done, <laughs> in the middle of the stream. You know, I was <laughs> I was trying to scare you away from the coffee with the olive oil talk. I guess it didn't work. Hey, oh girls! Oh girls! Hey, oh girls! Thank you for the oh birthday wishes. Boys, it's good to see you, oh girls! Oh girls! Mods, would you mind giving uh, me a flash out shout of out stock to Ogre's? Four stores. Four stores. <laughs> That's fucked up. Um, Thank you, Receive Simon. money. That has to be illegal with how it's phrased. <laughs> There's some... How many points do people get in the game? It's like, what the hell? I think there are, like, more complicated maps. That yeah, there sense. are. There are a bunch more maps. And there are some stores you will never see unless you're on a bigger map because they're in the late, you know, the, the additional store slots. So this makes a rival out of stock of four of their stores. Just all their stuff's gone. I believe so, Seemingly. yes. Cool. And oh, it hit all three of us. Oh, it's all yeah. of us. Yeah, it's just random, it seems. Oh, That's still pretty powerful. Cause like if you if you wanted to take those stores, you could now. Right. I know that's wild. <laughs> Just delete the product from the shelves. Done. This is like the uh, hydration reminder. The curb your enthusiasm like coffee shop. Uh, <laughs> uh, what tiff? What's the term for it? Spat? There's a term for this. <laughs> when people are having a petty argument with each other. A spat? Yeah, that's the one. I think I said that even. Yeah. Yeah. It's like Latte Larry's and Mocha Mike's or something. Mocha Joe's. I forget. It's been a while since I've watched. Thank you, hey, Bummer, Bummer, for the Bummer. <laughs> Thank you, Bummer, Bummer. For, for the $5. Oh my gosh. Bummer with three M's. <laughs> Man, you don't get to see my donation animations very often, but there's like a bunch of random ones. They're all cards like that. Thank you, Panis. I'm gonna change my image. We've got 9,000%. Oh, that's a cute image. 
Tiff, Tiff made this. Yeah, it's very Watch cute. I want, I wanted to show it. <laughs> it's very nice art. I love it. This is fan art of me as Mega Man. You can't tell though because we're both white guys with brown hair. <laughs> it looks mostly like Mega Man has vision problems now and needed glasses. the money to buy out the pancake house to make a three long game land a three long that sounds wrong somehow yeah <laughs> make a man Mega Man Trigger needs glasses because he spent too much time at the moon, says Dual Edge. That's tragic. Not as tragic as what just happened to me. Ooh. <laughs> oh no. I think I just died and avoid the Noid. <laughs> wait, wait. What's the like Commander Keen death sound? It's like <laughs> like that, right? Oh, something like that. I didn't realize that like the real Commander Keen death sound was different. When you kill Commander Keen in uh, Doom Two, he makes a noise like a groan tube. You know groan tubes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I actually was. I, I played a grown tube on stream the other day because the noise reminded me of it. Yeah. Dude, my nails. I used to be able to do a perfect oh, like, grown that's, tube impression, but I'm not, that's, that's I'm not nails, gonna drag you to that. I saw my nails, and I was like, yeah, I'll do my nails. <laughs> I'll touch him up. Yeah. I keep getting really high rolls for some reason. Thank you for the follow, BBW Wild Wings for. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? I didn't buy that. I wanted to buy that store, but I got so distracted by the name that I'm like, what? Thank you I for the follow. More, more money than you had on hand. Oh, hand. okay. Well, I, I probably could have tricked them. <laughs> The mind games begin. Yeah, you can just buy a Miami resort. Oh, I needed to get a third item. I, I was trying to sit to save that thing. Ah. <laughs> Why didn't it give me a point for the second one? Oh, it's my turn. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. When Vox was like super oh quiet, god. I was like, this is fishy. She's up to something. <laughs> Are you saying Vox was a little sus? Well, yes. now we're in the clever zone. Excuse me, I mean the clever zone. Yes. Oh no, I, I did want to buy another. Oh, whatever. Ah. Welcome to the Clever Zone, where we take the so called clever tips of so called clever gamers and see if they really are as clever as they said they are. It's that a volcano <laughs> high character. <laughs> Goodbye, Today's Sandra. Topic, Hi. Child labor. Oh no. You're just holding an L? Yeah, I'm handing you the L. Oh, I see. <laughs> I, I edited out the text There's that says hello that there, this is for you. <laughs> I can't <laughs> what? That. what do you have other hobbies? I just realized I was winning and now I'm losing. What the heck? This isn't supposed to happen. This is not how this was supposed to go. Yeah, this is yeah, how it's that way sometimes. Are you telling <laughs> me this isn't a game of skill?
Everybody's complimenting the Vox image. It is it is by Plush this is, Mayhem. This is one Tip. of those things where like the same name is on the shop, but they have new oh, management and stuff now. <laughs> oh, it's my turn. Sorry, I was You good <laughs> <That's Lord>. huge! <laughs> I was expecting to be that big. Uh, this isn't a joke. <laughs> when I grew up, growing up, I had Mega Man DOS and it gave me nightmares. Oh <laughs> no. Because the opening of Mega Man DOS is getting attacked by guard dogs. And it's like really bizarre compared to oh, all other Mega this. Man games. Damn it. Oh, and his face looks like that. It's good. <laughs> oh, Die, <laughs> monster. You don't belong in this world. I got another high roll. What the heck? I'm a high roller, but this isn't a casino. So it yeah, sucks. It's not like advantageous. <laughs> yeah. It's actually kind of problematic at times. He looks like a rug rat. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. This would be an advantageous time to bust out a perfect Rugrat impersonation, but I ain't got it. Yeah, but... <laughs> I, I don't. Man, I watched basically all of Rugrats as a kid, and I Ooh. could not remember the single voice of any of the characters or many of the plots. I can remember, like, two plots. What the heck? And I don't think That's it was a bad tip. show. I think it was a good show. Kind of. Yeah, it's kind of like Hey Arnold, where it's like, okay, tell someone the plot synopsis of a Hey Arnold episode, and I'm like, uh, Stoop Kid? <laughs> Leave a Stoop? That's it? That's all I got? Oh, I'm sliding. I will be right back. All right. Hmm. Wait, teriyaki burger? This isn't Chip this isn't Tokyo restaurant. <laughs> Are you allowed to sell this here? I, I own Tokyo restaurant too. So. <laughs> oh, fair enough. It's cross it's a, promotion. No, it's over. Yeah. God damn it, Vox. What? <laughs> you know <laughs> it. it's tail time. Oh yeah, it's tail time. Oh yeah, it's tail it's time. It's tail time. It's like a Mexican restaurant that will offer a cheeseburger and fries on the kids' menu. Um... <laughs> or like how all the burger places in Canada serve poutine. That is a lot of money. It is. What if, what if you just received a ton of money? Ah! And it's gonna come back and just be like, wait, wasn't that my pancake house? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what the heck? <laughs> oh, there you are. <laughs> Good timing. I was tricked by Chad. They made me hydrate after I had a full monster, eight ounces of Red Bull, an entire diet Arizona diet green tea. <laughs> oh, one square. Cool. Yeah. But are you sure you hydrated enough? Um <laughs> <laughs> and I was already drinking, or then they made me go get an Arnold Palmer. <laughs> Chat, please, I'm so hydrated. And I want poutine. I think I've never had it in my life. I feel like I have, but... This is my command. Scrunch I can purchase my an empty store. Stores in an area with the player's store can't be purchased. Other stores can be chosen using left and right directional buttons. I don't think there are any. Yeah. I was say. <laughs> what was the point of giving thanks, us all these messages you. then? <laughs> yeah, thanks, thanks, Colonel buddy. Sanders. <laughs> I give Scrunt this double down. And 
Dot, if we were in Jersey, I would say let's go get some disco fries. Yeah, sure. What are disco fries? Uh, New Jersey and poutine. New Jersey and. Yeah, pretty much. Thanks. Like poutine, but not as good. Oh, I see. But still delicious. So I have a question. Oh, holy hell. Guys, guys, look. Mm. Oh my <laughs> god. The world's largest candy store. <laughs> I could. Gee, I wonder if I'm gonna roll a one or a two. Soon the, <laughs> That's weird. I called it. Soon Game the land. candy store will be large enough to wage war against the U.S. government. <laughs> <laughs> be identified as a sovereign nation. <laughs> and that's how Candyland became an actual thing. Yeah. You got that Princess Amy movie? <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I really want to see you Princess Bride it. with just Sonic characters now. I finally sold it. <laughs> I just realized we're in Britain. I keep landing on the elevator down here and I do not want oh, to. Yeah, no, I want the bank. We are? How do you know? The bus. Yeah. Street lights are the same style you'd expect too, but the bus, see? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> These guys haven't had a customer for like an entire year. You don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine That's you a... work in this mall. It's and dry it's just age, four we kids promise. walking around. <laughs> just selling to each other over and over, and you're like, what the fuck is going on with this place? Hey, you bought a home earlier, would you like? these needs for your home? <laughs> I have plenty of needs I, on my own. <laughs> <Don't> <laughs> <have your distance. laughs> Understandable. Have a nice day. No. Well, at least it's really cheap. Are point. you playing this song on your belly? or <laughs> uh, My collarbone. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the most optimal human instrument. One. That's the seven. Oh my god. You like a nice payday. Um. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> Excuse <laughs> you? <laughs> How the hell? Um. <laughs> let's see. <laughs> this. This song. Wah! <laughs> Wah! <laughs> <sighs> I'm under fucking attack. <laughs> <laughs> the volume was really low, too. Man, I, I only have one completely working ear these days. Now I'm gonna have zero. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab a point. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys know the, um, the sound drop toys? Hmm? They're like, uh, little, like, teardrop shaped, like, plastic eels with speakers in them. Oh, I see. There's like, and there's one button, and you hit that button, and it like plays a clip from an anime or something. Yeah, I think I know those. I had a Kamehameha one, so you would hit it <laughs> once, and we go ka, and then again, and it would go me, <laughs> etc. I like that it was sequential. Oh. oh, where's the? Yeah, it was sequential. Yeah, it was awesome. So pretty good. One. I um, uh, I was playing a lot of League of Legends at this point in my life. Don't ask me. Real dark, <laughs> real dark time in my life. But <laughs> so uh, we all had the, you know, like a. Oh, this is a while ago. We had a Skype group for our League of Legends games. So like the everyone story else is clearly one slice of time. But as you keep adding these details, it yeah. feels older. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so. Uh, oh we, no. Uh, we just had like a, a single Skype group that, you know, if you were playing, you would join in on the call. Right? And uh, the other guys were playing and I, for whatever reason, wasn't in a League of Legends, but I, just, I guess because it's League of Legends. Um, and uh, all right, let's think. So you have oh, a button that makes yeah. Kamehameha sound. And you're in League. Hang you're on, I got to get banned. <laughs> I got a big some delivery of ferrets. Yeah. <laughs> Animal oh World God. that only sells ferrets. 
I mean, that's that, pretty big. That would smell horrendous. But it anyway. would. <laughs> so they were, you know, the guys were all playing League together, and I joined the call and held the, the toy up to the mic and hit ka and then hung up. <laughs> and then I I joined again like another 10 minutes later and went, May! And I did this over the course of like two hours, and they were like, dude, if you ever do that again, we're kicking you out. Oh, no. Because I held it right up to the mic. So I didn't realize this, but it was like the loudest thing they'd ever heard in their entire life. Oh, no. And I was hanging up before they could be like, you need to stop. <laughs> we're going to lose our hearing. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that, that is, uh, that's from the era of, oh, do like... You, would you like oh, a ferret? Just, just, I'm just <laughs> a ferret again. <laughs> You should buy another ferret. Gonna, you know, the first ferret's going to get lonely. That's exactly God, how I, Amazon recommendations work. You look at one ferret and it's like, continue where you left off. And it just recommends like 19 different ferrets to buy. Yeah. I freaking once had a friend who like got a bunch of ferrets and was just like, they don't smell. And like I went to the apartment. And I was like, this is the fucking worst smell of my life. Oh, no, I have yeah, to buy yeah, a ferret. I mean, they try to convince you they don't smell. And it's like, no, they do. They, they hey, do. You, you can actually get a thing to... Um, like get a gland removal or something so they don't smell but they absolutely mm. smell what does this mean oh, oh. <laughs> that's not good uh, that's <laughs> terrible <laughs> you just dropped your money you had a lot too my, my ferret money in my <laughs> pocket <laughs> yeah that's the Sakana cow that is a very good hungry Goria emo I love that game. I grew up with Dragon Slayer 4. Or Legacy of the Wizard, as it's known in the States. Yeah, we may want um, parts in our auto parts mega store. Just fill it with nothing but fog lights. <laughs> <laughs> if only if I only. had that much money. Yeah. What about Wax nothing but chains? Let's go with chains. Oof. <laughs> I can do chains. I can afford that. There we go. On a parts the store blast. that only sells chains. The fucking ghost of Christmas pass is gonna shop here. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, I hope I get this auto store. I, I think I need some chains. <laughs> Tragic. Ah, oh, damn it. So close. I guess. I guess I'm going to Hot Springs. But yeah, I feel like um, Legacy of the Wizard is like one of Yuzo Koshiro's best soundtracks. It's so good. I was happy when I found out there's also an MSX version. So that's like another version of that awesome soundtrack I get to listen to. Hmm. Golden jewelry is out of stock, but I want to protect candy store. I can't afford anything. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> hey, look, a, a deluxe Wait. snack set. We call this oh, the Voxandra strategy from earlier. <laughs> yeah. Mommy's been drinking. I have to fire you all now. Close the shutter <laughs> with them inside. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Apparently, the MSX2 version. Apparently the MSX2 version has an extra boss music, a new ending tune, and a more whimsical oh, tune for oh, Pochi's oh, area. Money. Yeah. Oh, I thought I had the money. Oof. <laughs> we are <laughs> both. I had tripped and dropped $2,000. Uh. <laughs> Is that a one? <laughs> yeah, it's a life point. Oh. Yeah, rip. Yeah. Rip. Yeah, rip. Yeah, rip. No, no. <laughs> I have eighty-one dollars. Spence turn. I have eighty-one dollars. I spill my dreams, good man. Over. Have you what a rotten way to die. die! Oh my God, JC, a bomb! A bomb. Oh, an old movie. <laughs> they don't make them like they used to. No, they don't. <laughs> This is one of those funny 90s comedies where they made fun of everyone who wasn't a straight white man. I was about to make a very similar joke, Dan. <laughs> we were on the exact they do, same they page. They still make movies like that, though. Unfortunately. Oh, yes. uh, 
I would like to know, uh, because we revisit a lot of content for Curse Content Club, we're kind of surprised every time there's a 90s comedy that's really good and doesn't do that. Oof, it's yeah. just like, oh, how did, like, this is going to sound really stupid, but for example, we watched George of the Jungle, <laughs> and we were kind of surprised at how good it was. <laughs> and then we were like, what did reviewers think? Oh, they hated it. I remember loving that movie as a kid. Well, whatever. They needed to punch down a little more. They're like, this is for babies. <laughs> like Van not, not, not enough racial slurs. <laughs> Too ah, the end. milk walker. Uh, yeah, so we need the star coffee so I can put olive oil in your coffee. <laughs> I, I just sell only lemonade. <laughs> With olive oil in it. Yeah. One moment. I need to post a picture of this in the, uh... <laughs> George video! Hey, Dot. Yeah? Would you drink it? I have posted it in the private voice tech channel. Oh, Lord. You know, is that, like, olive oil cold foam or something? It It's just... I, it's not even foamed. Here's it after. Uh. <laughs> yeah. uh, yeah. What the now, hell? Now you get why I won't stop bringing it up because it's oh, the worst. Oh, that's a ton of oil. That's like a bunch of oil in there. Yeah, like, bloody hell, that drink is like half oil at that point. <laughs> oh, like a drop of it or something for taste. That's, that's like... Oh. For taste? Alula, you thank you for me subscribing. I don't. Okay, first of all, no, I don't want the freaking olive oil for taste, but like, I just assumed someone did want it for taste because they're putting olive oil in there for some fucking Well, actually, it doesn't reason. have much of a taste I in the Starbucks. I spill my drink. In it. <laughs> hey. What was that for? I'm sorry, Vox. I love you, but you got the best position right now. Do I? Yes. Right, <laughs> one turn of no money, I guess. I love you, Vox, but your spine is so foldable <laughs> that she just pulls you over and throws you out the window. This man is wind injured. <laughs> <laughs> you just that from like the Baki always. This just folds him down to a pretzel. This man is injured. I just, I'd like that you stuttered a W in there. You sounded like Dr. Light. Dr. Wobble, why? Dr. Wobble. This, this man, man is this man injured. Is injured. Yeah. This man was injured. Bass, why are we fighting? We are not enemies. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I crack up at that every time. That dude nailed it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's a milk walker. Slosh, slosh, slosh. But what if you didn't? <laughs> Milk Walker wants to know where you live. You know what would be really good with that Milk Walker? If, like, for when you were talking, its arms just, like, swapped so one would become fully extended and the other one bent and it just kept flailing. This is my command. All stars, all stars are closed. Are closed. This is like oh, taking no. candy from a baby, for a turn, but which all is closed. fine by me. Uh, <laughs> I oh, guess that's a well. that's a way to handle it. <laughs> it's like fine. I'll take my ball and leave. A table flip. Uh, wait, it doesn't matter where I land. What am I? What am I doing? It doesn't <laughs> it's matter. Really not much of a choice there. It's like I could have gone the other way, but like, uh, what's the point? I'm very upset it's no that use. This happened on the turn that is closed. <laughs> So, I you just know, want to get closer to the, the milk walker thing reminds me of when I was super cringe and translated Ragnarok Battle offline, and I replaced the warning image when you start up Ragnarok Battle offline. It's so cringe. Nice. <laughs> no, that's sick. That's like some crack throw. Now, here's that's the good. here's the craziest part. <laughs> like, pull up the TV tropes page for Ragnarok Battle offline, and that is the tagline of the page. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was me, Ride Wings. Alhoon! What if you rolled a one? 
Aww. That's not one at all, it's a bunch of numbers. That's <laughs> not one at all. I'll buy a really expensive spoon, thank you. Thank you very much, please come again. Boy, am I glad the candy store was closed. Oh, good. Hello, Vinay. <laughs> Uh, uh, What's this? Oh, hey, not a myth. Take another card. What's, <laughs> What's right? the point what? of that? Right? It's just, what the hell? <laughs> the point of no, that? I didn't want to buy a shop. Oh, there are no vacancies, though. Yeah. Oh. What? Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, we're good, we're good. What a fucking turn. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yay. Yeah, I got my first game industry job because I had done a fan translation of a game and there was a company that was that had formed that wanted to bring it out officially. And, you know, I happened to have a friend who knew the CEO of the company. <laughs> so that made it really easy to make that connection. And that got me into the game industry. And then I later got my job with Xseed because I was complaining about my job with my first company to one of the rivals of that company, and they knew the head of Xseed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it turns out I was the best one for the job, but like... <laughs> that's that's quite a way to get Ooh. into it, huh? Opening this cook and fun costs $666. <laughs> the hell is this shit going on over here? What? Uh, what? what? <laughs> because your money is what? stopped. Because your money is stopped. Oh my god. I can't believe that affects the bank. Amazing. Oh. Don Are just shows up me? at the bank and the bank teller shoots him. <laughs> what the hell? You know, receive money store times 150 is actually pretty strong, but I think it might not do anything. I'm not sure if that would work. Right, because that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Nine! And then they unload their guns. <laughs> Open new store with rival money. What? <laughs> okay, fair. I, I deserve <laughs> that. <laughs> the movie theater! Understandable, have a nice People day. People must see Princess Amy. <laughs> <laughs> Please just stay on this floor elevator. This is Don't like take me anywhere. Candy from a Thank you. Oh, nice. Which is fine now I can get a me. double payday. Hell yeah. Take it easy, Grilson. I, I made like extra sure that I didn't accidentally pick yes. Right. <laughs> Why is it so hard to have candy? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? We could get candy later, it's just not gonna be the really good candy. Yeah, but we could get it, you know. If, I'm, I'm saying if there were like justice in the world, we'd have it all the time. I have it right now. Yeah, it's true. Everyone would be like, wow, Dot, I'm so jealous of all the candy you got. And I'm like, yeah, everyone is. That's candy for every works. kitchen. Yeah. Every day. It's Gren's turn. Yeah, candy should be considered a utility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not the burger shop. Okay, I spent this I'm gonna entire buy some fries. playthrough so far trying to remember what song this reminded me of. Mm -hmm. It's my burger shop. And there is a part of this song that reminds me of the Weird Al theme song for his <laughs> show. Huh. That's... that's I, that didn't even occur to me. There's just a part in that as... Which, that sounds way goofier than this does. Um, it's really hard to explain. Sure, For some nuggets and fries. Uh, 
clearly Dan's just listening to it too often. No, I don't think I've heard that song in 20 years. <gasps> <gasps> I've never Beautiful. gotten the bonus before. Oh my goodness. I've never gotten the bonus before. Yeah, but it feels nice. Yeah, I like when my bonus is zero dollars. Yeah, I'm surprised. Like, it feels like somebody should have won by now, but we've just been yeah. so back and forth. Like, it's unusual for this game, for it to be this back and forth. I really want a 10th point, but I also want to be able to spend it. <laughs> the point. Oh, here we are. <laughs> ah! I don't know how many scores I have. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, Vox, <Max>, clearly. <laughs> okay, I had a lot of stores, apparently. <laughs> Frodo says we keep destroying the economy and it needs time to build back up. No. Economy deserves it. You're not wrong. I never told you what the economy did to me. <laughs> this is my tragic backstory. I had to tip a waiter. No! <laughs> Tip no, waiter I'm once, that's it! That's it, I'm a libertarian now. <laughs> if we weren't all so freaking frugal, why aren't all of you at triple digit money like me? Then yeah. one of us would have bankrupted by now. <laughs> Just you wait. World. Oh, finally, another fucking carrot. Yeah, you want carrot. a carrot? <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> it's time, uh, the return of kid. <laughs> return of... Game over, return of kid. <laughs> the epilepsy screen. Yes. Freak me out the first wait, time I wait. Uh, that was a Ferris wheel. There's a Ferris wheel in this mall. <laughs> well, uh, let me confidently say I have not seen that. <laughs> yeah, maybe in the Mall of America. Yeah, maybe. Look, that's a one mall that might have it. You should just leave that out of stock. You know, it would be really unreasonable to open a shop right now. Oh, yeah, it would be. <laughs> but... Wait, that's even food. But I'm doing food. What are you doing? <laughs> this is rude. No, food. I, I know they sound similar. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Now you need auto parts from this place. Cancel delivery. I didn't ask for delivery. All right, elevator, 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 elevator. Alligator? Not the elevator. Fucking auto part. Fine, I'm by the wax. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you could, you could wax your legs with that. It's fine. <laughs> no, but she didn't buy the legs. Oh, that's true. <laughs> you need the legs so you could wax them. Why is everybody in auto parts right now? Look at this, this is a row of us. Would you like Everyone some needs wax? wax. Some wax, wax and chain. Wax over here. <laughs> You're gonna get the wax coffee from Starbucks. <laughs> yeah. Mm, what is that aftertaste? Is that tire? I swear to God, if I drop half my money again. What if you were oh, really big and crushed a shop, shop with your hand? Sell stores what? in shortage owned by Dot Level. I don't. What? Ink any of your stores? I don't. <laughs> what it, I think maybe it was gonna sell any <laughs> that auto parts. I had that were out of stock. Yeah, that's what, that's my best guess. Hey, what if we <gasps> went to the bottom floor? Damn. What if we went to the bottom floor? <laughs> Yay! Oh, it works. Thank God. Hoggers. I was so tired of it letting me back out. <laughs> maybe maybe you'll also get zero dollar bonus. <laughs> that's Bucking. what I aspire to. Run, roll one. Yeah! Oh, that's a little <laughs> higher than one. Yeah, that, that wasn't a one. Whatever. I want, I want some I want some noodles. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Yeah, I, I, I like that. Okay. 
I, I meant Fox clothes. Like, I'll just eat a veggie noodle. Oh, uh, wait, that wasn't clothes. filling. I'm getting a fish market. There we go. Yeah, who who here would like buy a men's like clothes store? <laughs> like, none of us have any interest in that. Like, I, I don't, I don't even think wait, Dan is would... It, is it the 80s style, like, power shoulders? Did dudes have that going on like chicks did in the 80s? <laughs> I don't think so. That, that would be awesome. They had chains, though. <laughs> I don't know. I already have one suit that says Dan Video Games on the inside of the jacket, so I'm good. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Damn, I wish these guys had a ferret. <laughs> <laughs> well, th there's probably a game with a ferret mascot that plays like crappy Sonic the Hedgehog, so... Oh, oh that reminds me. I played Awesome's Awesome. Oh? Like, when it was new. Yeah? Was it Awesome? No. No. <laughs> I owned the game as a kid myself. Yeah, oh, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah you know what? the deal ones. It's awesome, awesome. You can it's stock so the machine. No spot. Mm. I'm awesome. It had I'm a whole awesome. lot of voice. It had a whole lot of voice glyphs. Yeah, it's... So, like, my friend, like, his mom was, like, a big time, like, environmentalist. So she's oh. like, oh, I'll buy you a game for your Sega. Because hey, <laughs> I heard this one, you know, and... <laughs> Sounds like the sound of somebody cocking a shotgun. Oh, I'll, I'll buy you a video game. <laughs> Damn, that is super weird because you're Looks basically describing the way I got the game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, man. I mean, that's probably the only way anyone ever got Awesome Possum. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't know how I have Awesome Possum. It just happened one day. <laughs> it just materialized. I, really, I want to buy it, actually. Yeah, it's not that expensive. Go I feel figure. like I feel like if you're just into retro gaming long enough, it appears in your collection. <laughs> I feel like it's not the worst of those particular genre of bad games, but okay, the way Time it asks you them. questions between every stage is kind of <laughs> yeah, it's annoying. Let's get the ranking uh, chart out. Uh, Arrow the Acrobat versus Awesome Possum versus James Pond. James Pond. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Mods, make a poll about that. I want to know. I want to know what chat. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we got. There's got to be like two more options, right? I'm trying to think. I don't think we should put Bubsy in there because everyone would vote for Bubsy. No, yeah, they would vote. Yeah, for Bubsy. everyone loves Bubsy. It's great. Yeah, uh, even Atari loves Bubsy. That's why they bought the the game. Did you hear about that? They did that last week. What? Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, Atari bought Bubsy last week. No. Oh, so Mire, you type slash poll, and it'll give you all the options. Yeah, it, like, pops out a little window. They're like, we bought a hundred important classic gaming IPs from the 80s and 90s. And then one of them's Bubsy. <laughs> yes and no, Dual Edge. Oh, it's not it really is. Atari. It's, like, info Infograms or something. No, it's not even them anymore. No, it's not them anymore. You're right, you're right. Uh, <laughs> it's a nightmare. I think this is our sixth version of Atari that isn't the other versions. Yeah, <laughs> it's so... This, and as I've had people tell me they're not even the same Atari who ran the Bitcoin hotel thing. <laughs> this is a different. Yeah, yeah, that you was need to the open thing. A Bitcoin hotel at this mall. <laughs> All players reverse next turn. Okay. I think I can make the poll. Oh, I thought I thought it was gonna reverse me after this turn. You might roll back into the bank though, from where you are. That, like, I was thinking I would walk past the bank since my turn wasn't over yet, and then yeah, next turn yeah, I would go back, back into, into the it. bank. But I think it just reversed me mid-turn instead of... Let's wow. see, it was... Kind of unfortunate. It was awesome, Possum, Arrow the Acrobat, and who again? So much for that. James Pond. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Ugh. I'm trying to think. There's got to be two more, but they're not popping my head right now. Yeah, I feel like there's Sness a whole era, lot era. more, honestly. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. They're just not popping my head. Space shot! Star sweep! I'm not gonna count Titus the Fox. I feel like you're they buying, didn't try. You're buying out, kid? 
I feel like Punky Skunk does fit here, but... How many of those games actually came out? Alfred Chicken, do you have any opinions on that, Dot? Do I love Alfred Chicken now? <laughs> God damn, fucking Alfred Chicken. Man, <laughs> it's not even on topic, but for some reason I'm suddenly thinking about Socks the Cat, Rocks the Hill. Hell yes. Yeah. I'm surprised that game oh. came out eventually. I don't... Is this a sentient bar of margarine? What is this? It's oh, a gold bar, just running away from you. Yeah. Each player took 300 from Gigaboots. Hmm. <laughs> Uh. Well, you know, it's crunch yeah. time. E. Like, Socks e. the Cat is such a strange thing because it's like, it's a game about Bill Clinton's cat, right? And it yes. was supposed to come out when Bill Clinton was still relevant, but then it didn't, and it got kickstarted a long time later. It finally came out. Uh without saying too much to give it away. Have any of you seen the video that came out in the last week that's kind of like a... I guess you would call it a character assassination piece on Pat and Ian from the CU podcast? I haven't even what? heard this. No. Yeah, that came out in the last week. <laughs> Who made it? Yeah, I say this with no disrespect at all. A nobody, so... Oh. <laughs> like someone whose channel is about my size, right? So, not people nobody have been trying us. to like go after them because all because they're they're you know you know what's fucked up? The people who go after those two are usually doing it in defense of Tommy Tallarico. Ooh. Well, this time it's someone who's critical of the Amico as well, and Pat, in fact, referenced and supported them on an episode, but they're. Uh, like I'm living dangerously. <laughs> Do Imagine it. this is a 55 minute video and there's like three minutes of actually reasonable things to be upset and critical about and all the rest of it is insane. Thank you for the uh, hydration the reminder. Point of... hmm? It was the hydration Okay, give me a sec. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing it. Uh, chat, you're going to kill me. <laughs> I'm going to have some coffee. Hold the olive oil. <laughs> um... But yeah, like, part of it will be like, I kickstarted Pat's book, and it came to me damaged in shipping, and when I DM'd him, he ignored me. And it's like, okay, yeah, I understand you being critical, and then it's like, the N64 book, they're gonna use emulation for all the pictures, so that's not realistic, pictures and reviews, and I'm like, yeah, okay, that's, that's reasonable, and then it'll be like, they took ads for, like, their podcast for random VPN, so they're immoral. And I'm like, what are you talking what? about? That so, doubles yeah. as a that doubles as a call out for every podcaster I know. who's ever done anything. <laughs> right. Yeah. Seriously. Thank Which you, is Super SSG awesome. Nuke, for the follow. <laughs> super Saiyan God, I assume. No, super. Oh wait. Yeah, I don't know. I'm so oh, it's used gotta to be the super J. shotgun, right? But it's super SSG. There's too many supers in there. Maybe it's, it's super's shotgun. Super. Could be. It's a shotgun that belongs to Super. I really just wish one of these stores could be called Soup. Soup? Soup. I'm at soup! I'm at soup! <laughs> Yo, look at that. Thank you for the birthday wishes. That was a lot of hearts. <laughs> what do you mean you're at soup, says chat. <laughs> I'm at soup! Tell me where you're at. I'm at soup! Yeah, this, this game is called Top Shop. This is Top Gear for the <laughs> Super Nintendo. <laughs> Yay. Yay, cooking fun. Hey, what you cooking? What was he cooking? Fine. fun. I was cooking fun. Me. Okay. What Restock was the, the cooking star fun? coffee with nothing but lemon. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> you think that ever happens to a coffee shop? Somehow they run out, out of coffee. <laughs> yeah. You only got lemonade? Yeah! 
Elevator? <laughs> oh, what a week, huh? I'm blocking Dot. Whoops. Dan, it's Monday. <laughs> no, I'm just in your picture, too. <laughs> I'm telling you what day it is. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone. That's great. I just. Oh no! Oh no! No! That is so cursed. It makes me want to curse, and I'm completely say have, so. Have you heard about video games? No! Oh, I wish I hadn't. <laughs> I like to unlearn. I'm randomly thinking of a fan art that I got ages ago that I think you guys will enjoy. So. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world! <laughs> I'm going monster! I'm just seven times as tall as Dot! <laughs> but but seriously, uh... Oh, you're so funny, Vox! Oh, that was so unpredictable, too! <laughs> Take a look at this. <laughs> oh. Out of ordinary Out eggs, of ordinary. find some new ones. <laughs> oh my god. You're yicking uh, out. The funny thing is, I got that because I was playing an Earthbound randomizer and it gave me Alex Yickman <laughs> as the protagonist. Oh yeah, oh, I that's right. That. I remember that. Oh my god. <laughs> it was so no. cursed. Wait. No. I'm so indecisive. This menu would be so much better if it had a page function. Yeah, if it, it, yeah, that, or it had these things in memory so it didn't have to load each one. Or if it was, like, categories. <laughs> yeah, that would actually be the most helpful, because then I could skip the money and go to everything else. Hmm. It's too bad I can't, like, look around the board. Like, I just have to memorize yeah. who has stock. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Like, this this game is a very neat game, but a little quality of life would go a long way. I wish somebody would make a new a successor to this game, honestly. Well, obviously, it's got to be the people who make that one really popular board game on uh, PC. I can't remember the name of it right now. The Orange Shoes. 100% Orange Shoes. Yes. Juice. Yeah. Yes. Drugs. You know I worked on that game. I did not. Yep. Was that fun? Yeah. Is work fun? <laughs> it can be. I mean, no. I originally translated it in it my spare time no because dot. I wanted to, so... <laughs> no, Dot. Work cannot be fun. I watched George of the Jungle and it was very serious. <laughs> <laughs> George. George. George of the Jungle. Strong as he can be. How strong can he be, though? In this video essay, George, George, George of the Jungle. Wheels. Watch <laughs> out for that tree. Talk it up, baby. <laughs> Man, let's go. Oh, I got jump scared <laughs> with a <gut> pan. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dot. Remember, remember when I did during Silent Hill? So, um, I actually watched the original George of the Jungle TV show a bunch of, as a kid. It was on, like, Nick at Night or something. Like, the black and white one. Mm. That was black and white? For a while. Really? My brain colorized it in post. It's like one of those things when you remember watching an anime, but you forgot it wasn't even in English because it, yeah, as you play it back in your brain, you just, you know. To be fair, it's, this. it's entirely <laughs> possible that I'm the mistaken one because I don't have a visual memory. <laughs> Sara had black and white TV in like <laughs> 1999 or something, who knows? I could swear there's a really old George of the Jungle, and I'm not talking it about Tarzan. It probably is. I, uh, I tell the story a lot, but actually, I guess maybe not. I went over to Bob's house. Hey. This was when we first started being friends. 
and he, he had Ocarina of Time. This was like 2002 or something. I don't know. I don't know. Sometime Apple around gum, 2000. please. Thanks for but the one you, point. I'm you know fine. how Ocarina of Time has the pause screen uh, where you woo! hit Z or R to turn it to two different ways? Oh, yeah. Well, he has a monorail TV, and he didn't know what monorail meant. So oh, yeah. he would turn it to the left, and it would make no sound. <laughs> he would turn it to the right, and it would make the sound. And I'm like, dude, what's wrong with your speakers? And he goes, what? <laughs> it's supposed to sound the same both ways, man. And he's like, what? You want a Ferris wheel? <laughs> Fine, I'll take a Ferris wheel from the mall. <laughs> Buying a Ferris wheel from the mall. <laughs> so the results are in. Three votes for Awesome Possum. 11 votes for Arrow the Acrobat, and 14 votes for James Bond. Yeah, that seems correct, actually. Yeah. Yeah, I can't argue with that. I can't help but look at the size of my head next to Dot and feel <laughs> like uh, the boss at the end of Lament of Innocence, the super secret <laughs> boss, the forgotten one. So I'm like three stories tall and Dot's just whipping me and riding an elevator up me. <laughs> as long as the elevator doesn't stay stuck in the first floor. Yeah. <laughs> I think I was conflating the George of the Jungle cartoon from way, way back. It's a very old cartoon with the Tarzan show, which was black and white. Huh. Oh, what's the name of that show where they like film people's mouths to put them over the... Oh, Lord. I Something cargo? Conan. Horrifying. Conan. It's so horrifying. You know what? Wax. We need more wax. <laughs> yeah, clutch cargo. I saw a video of that clutch. again, just like yes. Yes, yesterday, yes. after a while of not thinking <laughs> about it. <laughs> and then it attacked you. Yeah, that's oh. how it always goes. That was a big payday. Yeah, it was a family size. Because if anybody can afford it, as if anybody gets a payday, they can actually help their family at all. Come on. Take it easy, Dark Matt. Close arrival store, I'm gonna save our points. The store is in the pocket of Big Wax. <laughs> Big Wax. Cooking fun! Yeah. I'd like glass, please, and and one <laughs> bowl. I'm hungry. Give me some glass. <laughs> that sounds like I something. Got That's what matters. <laughs> okay, there we go. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I won. Oh, damn! Look at that payday. Yeah, it's a pretty good payday. Could be bigger. I want a bigger payday. <laughs> I'll buy some shampoo. Ooh! Well, if I got money back, then yeah, I'm buying that tissue. With the money I got from the shampoo. Right. Yeah, pe people seem pretty unhappy with this one. I'll check. <laughs> <laughs> I forget what that is. Hey, it's Spark. It's Spark. Excuse okay. me, Spark. Uh, do you mean... Barp. The previous one, what was that? Uh, that was that was Ratchet from Ratchet and Clank in the Zelda CDI style. <laughs> well, okay. Barp the electric jumpster. Um... Hey, Winter, how are you? Hello. Hi, Winter. Winter. <laughs> I like you coming oh, to Star wow. Stream and be like, hello, Dot and others. Wow, wow, wow. What? What the? You're right. Winter, why? What are you doing? <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, other. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear other. I'll tell you how that makes me feel. Happy I'll tell you. Happy birthday to you. Come oh, back again, man. Hi, Masuri. <laughs> I'll just deliver to Game Land again there. You know what Game Land needs? Bro. I think Game Land needs more Ferris wheels. Probably, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait. To, I can't wait to hear the uh, the or watch the Company Men video about 
game lens, controversial, all Ferris wheel business model. And they had a really interesting model. <laughs> oh, that's good. I was pretty low on money. Oh, man. <laughs> At this point, Dot, you are trending toward winning, though. You are like 3,000 away. Oh, but hey, I got Ferris a wheel? Ferris wheel. <laughs> oh, that's, that, that hurts. That, yeah, that hurts. Hurt. At least I got a point out of it. Do now you're one dollar above Vox. Oh, huh. Most of game Yeah, but all that money is in Vox's didn't... pocket. She, I really <laughs> hope she doesn't get that event. Yeah. yeah I'm, you just I'm, lose there's, there's money a lot of... holding on to. I'm by, oh, there's dang. There's a lot of bad things oh, that you, could happen God. to me. Zelnu thank wants to hear about the coffee bounty. shop that only sells lemonade. <gasps> what if we opened a lemonade, like a trendy lemonade place, right? Go on. And and it's got it's like a it's got it's like an all female like staff, you know, and it's female owned. And we call it lemonade. Count me Ooh. in. I, do, I got it. Good. I'm, I'm, I'm a freaking genius, dude. Count me in. <laughs> Vox, you in? Store items double. Yeah, sure. Yeah, these are really interesting things up this far. Hmm. Fine. What do you think that did? Uh, I assume all my items are double price for four turns. So I'm going to need you hard. all to keep landing on my ship. It looks like your items are double price. <laughs> yeah, 704. That's the all cheapest right. item. So, yeah. so do I want to buy some arms or legs? <laughs> you can only you have... Never have legs. Apparently you can have both. Winter says, I'm gonna make a lemonade business, but it's just getting lemon to aid people with stuff. You want some fish? <laughs> I guess if I up. must. You can open it right across the street from Dan's man tea shop. <laughs> that was that was a weird tangent 16 hours into a stream. <laughs> oh man, do I wanna know? Oh, please uh, don't end so, on it. so back in the day, Dr. Pepper made Dr. Pepper 10, and their ads were really weird because they were no, like, they this were. isn't for women. Yeah. <laughs> it's for men. Oh, yeah. I I remember being annoyed about that because I like Dr. Pepper, kind of. Yeah, I like Dr. Pepper 10. I was allowed to, though, by society. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> deemed appropriate. <laughs> This is a so, gender appropriate drink for you, Dad. Video games. You may drink so, it. So I was like, they didn't go far enough, though. That was just puff pieces. I don't think they actually believe it was only for men. So they should have made it kill women. Introducing <laughs> uh, new man tea. It's literally only for men. Ah. Uh, <laughs> what does it do to trans people? I don't know. <laughs> I assume it's targeting a chromosome, but I don't. I don't look. We don't know how the how the magic works. <laughs> the cursed beverage kills people. Oh yeah, and there's a certain percentage of men it'll just kill too. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's like the... great because we were talking about we would commemorate all the uh, important female staff members that well, died yeah. in the production oh, of it by yeah. putting them on the label. So, by the way, what flavor is it? Is it lighter fluid, or is it oil change? <laughs> uh, I'm nervous going this way. Oh, I should be. One moment. <laughs> what's, uh, what's over here? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I don't feel safe either way. <laughs> suddenly those pancakes look good, huh? Yeah, suddenly they look... Oh, cream soda delicious. Thank you. I like cream soda. This soda is nice. And I hear it's making a comeback. You should you should buy another pancakes. Dot Dot makes more money and wins. <laughs> oh, I'm actually that pretty gave close that now. gave you more money too. Yeah, Dot's actually pretty close to winning. Oh my goodness. One. 
Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, no. Luckily, we have non-ferret uh, animals <laughs> in stock for once. All right, I'll, ta I'll take the turtle. I like oh, turtle. Yeah. Receive cash back? Wait, what? Oh, damn. That actually cost me <laughs> oh, <some> no. money. <laughs> Good job, <laughs> Box. Good job. How did I do that? That just happens occasionally. Yeah, it's just random. Fox just keeps going to dot stores, buying TVs, and then returning them within the return window to lose <laughs> dot loads of money. <laughs> so now that I'm we're going to leave that you're there. respectfully leave and yeah, <laughs> yippee! I did that earlier. Oh, oh, I know what's about to oh. happen. Ooh, ooh. Oh my goodness! <gasps> you can do it. I can do it, right? I think receive four. Yeah, I think. I think so. I think that's how this works. Oh, I could receive seven hundred, and I could win more. Yeah, I, I would win more. Yeah. Yeah, this game's pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> I like this how fifth is Island, showing up. Really <laughs> yeah, fifth. You can have up to eight <laughs> oh, people in a game. I'm gonna be in fifth place. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was brutal. <laughs> oh. oh I went down to third. I'm sorry, my neck just broke. I have a concussion mm, and my neck just broke. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> my knees weren't supposed to fold that way. <laughs> oh man, great job, Dot. <laughs> Oh my god. You did it. I was I was trying You'd really be hard. Too, to if you had a spring for a neck. <laughs> what a shame. I don't know why. I, I got after I got those shoes. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yippee! Um, Yippee! That Yippee! was really fun. Yeah, I, I really like Top Shop. <laughs> Good job, Dot and others. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Really oh, worth the no. dot others of the stream. <laughs> Everything must be. Ow. Is this transparent? Oh, it is not. Oh my god. god damn it. <laughs> it's not transparent. Oh, yeah. Unfortunate. <laughs> that, that game made me so so hungry for like candy and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it keeps coming up. I'm I can't blame you. I can't blame you at all. <laughs> like I'm very tempted to step away and get uh, get, get some candy. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna step away. Take? No. This is like taking candy from a baby. Some, I'm gonna grab which some is fine cats by me. There. Mm. Bonnie, my pebbles! What does he sound like? Uh, that's a hard voice. Yeah. Vox, nice glow up. Yeah, no problem. Hey, have you been working out? <laughs> Did you been working out? See? Look at that spin. I think this is the old one that I had. You ever notice that sometimes Sara just disassociates in the corner of her room? <laughs> what do you think she's thinking about? Kit Kats, she said. That's true. She's getting the Kit Kats from her mind palace. Yeah, I was about to say mind palace. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was the old one. Here's here we here we go. What is this on? Dan VG Cats. Dan VG Cats? God. You know, and, uh, you know what's funny is I can't even have a mind palace because I can't see images in my head. It's just dark in there, that's all. Mega Race. Sky Holder. The last chance. Oh, okay. Oh. 
The last yeah. chance speedway. <laughs> I like how Dot's so short arm like crouch down to sort of like <laughs> talk at her level tonight. Oh, you're so funny. Everyone's so funny. <laughs> my favorite thing. I, yeah. I, I, you know, now that I have this mental image, I can't help but look at that avatar and be like, <laughs> I have to start with the, uh, hey, kiddo. <laughs> all I can think, all I can think with you doing that dance though is, for some reason, the word scrimblo comes to mind. Yeah, scrimblo. Yeah, that dance is the scrimblo scramble, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, we all did it back in my day. I'm not confident enough to fact check you on that. <laughs> uh, ah, that was good. Yeah. You have a single fact check to back that up. <laughs> My sources, I made it the fuck up. <laughs> Man. I spill my drink. I'm sitting here, God. like, trying to think of something else to do for a little bit. Like, not even a long time. Yeah, yeah, not a long bit. Yeah. Uh, do you do you mind if I run to the gas station and get some candy? I'm going nuts here. Oh it's perfectly goodness. fine, Dot. It's perfectly oh fine. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'll, I'll be back. I'm going to try to make it quick. All right. <laughs> so when I talk... I'm out of here. I turn into an OSSSC, up, an OSSC upscaled Sonic 3, and when I don't talk, I'm the Frame Meister. Oh, I see. <laughs> Hmm. God damn it. <laughs> That's very specific. It is. Thank you for the follow, you, very best plot. If you can give me uppies real quick and lift me up slightly. <laughs> oh, oh, gosh darn it. It's more funny if I say that, isn't it? Uh. <laughs> it sounds so unnatural. Um... Hmm. Well, Vox is still here. What's a good three-player game? Do we have, like, a three-player arcade game we could play? I'm trying to think. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I'm trying to think. One moment. Obviously, we should play Bomberman. Thank you for resubscribing, Sasha, and thank you for wishing me a happy birthday. Man, I've been, I've been realizing that the chat is going faster than my notifications. <laughs> Secret of Mana is a three-player game. It doesn't need a mod. Trials of Mana is the one that needs to be modded for that. Yeah. I actually grew up with Secret of Mana. It was my first video game that was just for me, and I was like, what do you mean it's three-player? <laughs> this only has two ports. Yeah, I, I eventually got the multi-tap because I I got it like... Okay, so a rental store went out of business, and they gave me a bunch of their stuff because I had been a frequent customer, and among them was Bomberman and a multi-tap. Nice. So I was able to play three-player Secret of Mana. Hey, what the heck? I tried to open MAME and it never opened. Yeah, I saw that. It said nah. It's not even... It's not even listed here now, what? How am I recently... What? It doesn't look like you even tried to... Oh, there it goes. Man, that looks bad. You know, the problem is, like, people would never have known that Secret of Mana was three-player because you can't find a gamer with two friends. <laughs> Sad but true. Then what are, what are we? What? What? Oh, we're other. <laughs> Don't you remember? Yeah, we're others. Yeah. <laughs> this is not Dot and Friends, it's Dot and Others. <laughs> others? Yeah, we're Dot and others. Tag someone who's always waking up other. 
Man, the, the problem with playing something like Bishibashi or even like Newman Athletics or something is that latency gives gives everybody a disadvantage. <laughs> uh, brawlers, though, there's plenty of those. <laughs> Columbo's great. I meant to say the Avatar, but like, I mean, Columbo is great. Columbo is great. Thank you. Man, I don't know. You guys want to play like Sunset Riders or something? Sure. What's that? Sunset Riders is a Konami game that is a side scrolling run and gun for up to four people. <laughs> nice spacesuit, Fox. I actually oh, I love Dota. that. Yeah, it's it's game Boy saga. it's a saga thing. Oops, uh, let me let me hide Dot Dragon again. Cat Man made it. Thank you, Bandit King Bandit, for follow for following. I I did I did a double take there on that name, but okay. Let's see. Change. Let's see. I have a thing for this somewhere in one of my other scenes. Where is it? I need to step away for a minute. I'll be right back. All right. Okay. I'm lightly browsing 136 different Columbo images I screen cap while watching the Blu-rays. Amazing. <laughs> there were really funny things. That, that's, I, that's I really great. do love Columbo. I do too. Legit. Straight up. I'm going to pause this. Let's see, I guess I'll be player... Hey, these are color-coded. These are color-coded, so I should be player two. Oops, wrong button. Oh no, oh no! <laughs> oh no! This is going well. Yeah, it's clearly going well. <laughs> Let's see, Dan is green, so player three up. Okay. One sec. Down? Mm-hmm. I think the first button is fire and the second button is jump, but it could be the other way around. Okay, well, I'm going to try it like that. And yeah. we're going to hope. And here's uh, your coin thank button. You. Yeah. Where's the start buttons? They aren't. I don't know. Oh. Maybe it just uses the fire button. Uh, either that or service. Service is, is like, uh, service brings up the service menu, the operator's menu. Okay. That's how systems like this work. Like, uh, right. Yeah. If I, yeah. See. And now I can't a navigate this because I didn't assign anyone to player one. Um. A uh, little mixer says, "Happy birthday, Sarah." Thank you, little mixer. Sorry, I wasn't looking at chat at that very instant. Sorry, is setting up 12 million different things. As one does. Man, remember when Mono Earl used to be the default? Wait, why would that be the default on an arcade cabinet? Yeah, I'm trying to think about that. I guess they could have one really loud speaker. <laughs> one really loud speaker. Oh, that's... Yeah. I I would believe it. It's just yikes. Okay, so I guess we wait for Vox to get back. 
<laughs> and then she never returned. Plausible. <laughs> I mean, my my dad never came back with that milk. Yeah. Oh, I guess you can hear me opening that soda can, huh? Only barely. It'd actually be more audible to them, probably, because uh, oh, you're yeah, getting me through true. NVIDIA broadcast because they don't have, like, virtual audio cables set up to give you the proper filtered. So they could probably hear it more than you. <laughs> Go figure, right? Probably. Now I'm actually opening those Kit Kats that I got. <laughs> Your dad didn't come back with the milk, but will Doc come back with the candy? <laughs> Bob, I'm afraid you're going to have to go to Starbucks and get us some of the olive oil coffee. It's not real. <laughs> hey, a Bob cameo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to check if they actually have that here because I'm stupid enough. I need to know exactly how disgusting it is. What do you mean these Starbucks don't open at 9 p.m.? <laughs> I'm trying to live here. Fine, I'll just drink a third energy drink. <laughs> oh no. Sometimes pe people are robots. These things happen. Look at how much of a mess this is. <laughs> Here you go, chat. Read all the text you want. Yeah. Welcome back, Vox. Hello. <laughs> That's really good. My name's VTuber people, and I have cool 2D assets to show. <laughs> Meanwhile, well, I'm know. like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna edit Columbo out of these still images real quick. <laughs> and having Columbo there is pretty powerful. Dan, are you gonna create Columbo without Columbo? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a bunch of stories in which somebody gets away with it. I'm like. Some of these rich people are stupid enough where it really would just be they out themselves as doing the crime and no one made them do it. Yeah. So, Vox, you're the yellow player, so player one. Yellow? I gotta be player one? Yep. Them's the ropes. So, press up. Oh. I'm pretty sure the first button is shoot and the second button is jump, but I'm not sure. I'd like better be seventy okay. percent sure. Wrong, we're all going to be wrong. And the so coin we'll all button be coming in at the same level. You know what? Before we start, let me use the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. Okay. Anyway, Voxer coin button. Why do they call it a restroom when I'm fighting for my life in there? Good point. Good point. Okay, now we're waiting for Dan. That's fine. Everybody takes breaks. That's good. Technically, Bunny, I, I took the break first. I went I went to get the Kit Kats. <laughs> yeah, I just I made this big I'm playlist in this. of VGM files for like the menu of my mister and I just I was like, hey, I can reuse that for the empty moments on my stream. Why not? 
<laughs> Got uh, 447 songs in it. <laughs> Everything must be. Ow. Oh my god, at this rate, Dot is going to be back before Dan is. Amazing. I am the Ringmaster. You know what they say, the more the merrier. The audio isn't currently playing for them. Whoops. Activate the volcanic defense system that to shield on. the base with my lava magma. Well, we get rid of the mask. Hey, this song is good. I know this song. Welcome back, by the way. Yeah, yeah. I, I actually didn't pour the soda that oh. I said I was going to pour, but I heard this song and I was like, I have to race to unmute my mic <laughs> so I can say that the song is good. I'll be right back. Like five okay, minutes. okay. <laughs> Some hyper duel. You know what they say, the more the merrier! No, just Battle Garaka. I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. Okay. I'm interested in this. Welcome back, Dan. Attacked me. So, funny story, Doc got back before you did. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> wow. I guess I'm fucking owned. <laughs> the funny thing is, you saying that with the Columbo avatar somehow feels right. Yeah. Because that, yeah, that particular pose. Uh, there's just one more thing. <laughs> and you say... Uh, you had some friends co-hosting your stream. Uh, that just, that doesn't make sense in br my brain. Maybe you can help me understand. How, uh, if you're a gamer, how do you have friends? I don't, I have others. <laughs> <laughs> there will be others. <laughs> when a gamer falls, two others must rise up. Oh my God. Wow. Okay, sorry, Hello. what are we doing? I'm cool. Uh, Sunset Riders, if that's cool. I'm Bux. Is it a four player? It sure is. Yeah. Oh, okay. Who's, who's gonna eat candy though? That game's kind of fast paced, right? <laughs> it does, but. <laughs> what candy could... did you get? Uh, <laughs> watermelon flavored Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> huh. Just two syllables there. I'm you, like, you could... water. Is it a game that's like possible to eat and have a good time with with three players? Could I just watch? Yeah, you can, can watch. Or join in later if you want. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, why don't I buy, set up my like bindings on my controller then in mm -hmm. case I want to join in later? Okay. Yeah. And you said you were uh, streaming a PS3 game. Uh, that just doesn't make sense to me. Yeah. How do you stream a PS3 game if the PS3 has no games? I think this is shot. And I think this is jump. Okay. And I think you also press shot to join in because there doesn't seem to be a start button. Okay. And here's your coin button. Weird. There we go. Alright, cool. I'm hey. gonna mute my mic so that I'm not like chewing Thank in your ear though. <laughs> yeah, I, I know how that goes. 
Okay, so <laughs> let's bring the game back up. And let's play. Let's see. Yep, that is the start button. It's so not. One second. There we go. Yippee. Yeah, there we go. Can you drag the window well, I have for a us coin a little button, further? I don't have right. a start button. Yeah, press the fire button to join in. There's uh, no. It helps if I'm in Parsec. Did you know that? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> you can. You can. Yeah. You can mount whatever. You can jump up here by holding up and pressing jump. You can go in all the houses to get stuff. There's a whole bunch of cool stuff in this game, honestly, and like Turtles in Time actually has a reference to this game. Yeah, that makes sense. I was Ow. gonna say well, this looks like soon. it's about the same era. <laughs> yeah, because like I can't <laughs> can't believe the character I'm playing as is named Bob. <laughs> yeah, that's Never true. <laughs> Dan was Bob all along. <laughs> so. So the thing is, like, there's this... This guy says this line in this game, bury me with my money. Bury and me it, with my money. Yeah, and, and in Turtles in Time, there's a stage called Bury My Shell, It Wounded Me. Yeah. Ah! So it's sort, of a, it's sort of a compound reference there. We don't have a high jump this time. Nope. Run to avoid getting animation. killed. It's so good. Yeah. <laughs> Surprise! That's fucked up. <laughs> We're all like, haha, dumb bulls. We get trampled anyway. Yep. It's time to prank. It's time to prank. <laughs> What's the name of that Super Nintendo Cowboy game? That's so good. Sunset Riders? I mean, yes, but also, <laughs> the one that isn't this one. <laughs> Good wild question. Guns or something, oh right? yeah, Wild Guns. Yeah. Which uh, I love that game. I love that game. I that might be on my top 100, and if it's not, it was one of the candidates. Yeah, that thing. Um... Marry me with my money. <laughs> do you own it on cartridge? Because if you do, I know how you can buy a house. <laughs> 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 Unfortunately, I only own this one, uh, the SNES version. Yeah. I wish I owned that on cartridge. I feel like there was the distinct opportunity to have that happen. Just remember, everybody stay in your lane. No moving up or down. Yeah, that's no. weird. The bullets are kind of hard yeah. to see in this. You're telling us we're on the other side of Parsec? <laughs> fair, fair. But but the bullets are hard to see even for me, because like, you know, they're very small, they blue and red. They mix us together. Oh, we all ate it. <laughs> murdered all of us. <laughs> it's over. We all died to a single log. That's perfect. Everybody's like, where's Komano? Carmano is eating uh, candy. Ah! <laughs> I jumped into the bullet. I'm supposed you to shoot the bullet. Candy. Everybody should have candy. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I just want coffee. That train had like somebody. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's all we got. I mean, I know we're called uh, Star Coffee, but that's like an asterisk, you know? Ugh, womenade. <laughs> <laughs> All we got is womenade. Yep. I got you two guns of man here. Ah. I miss when Minute Maid was based and didn't make woke juice like <laughs> womenade. <laughs> oh, Lord. Woke. Keep 
grabbing these power-ups and then like immediately dying. <laughs> yeah. It's cool when you have two guns though, isn't it? That's it more than one gun. Fair. Yeah. It's one more. Like an arcade machine that politely asked me to keep playing it. <laughs> yes. Please continue. Please continue. <laughs> that, Please give us more money. That voice like actually is strangely satisfying, though. Like it's just—it's a Fair soothing like, no, voice. Please. please, come on. It's okay. You got it this time. <laughs> it's all right to continue. Sometimes we all have to continue. <laughs> See now you're <laughs> now you're getting into the Japanese Sonic the Hedgehog cartridge text. <laughs> like on the box art. <laughs> Don't let time laugh at you. You got me. <laughs> you got me. I think it was a lot. Wow, I shouldn't talk with my mouth full. Thank I you for the follow, one. Mike WWM98. <laughs> but we have to aim and shoot, okay. Box is just taking names. What the heck? <laughs> oh lord, <laughs> there's too many of them. That was on parsec, baby. Let's I go. Got three. Yeah, dang, Box. Dang. That was on parsec. Let's go. <laughs> I was gaming. You really were. And now I'm drunk. Oh hey, auto fire! Great. Oh no, I lost it. I can't auto fire anymore. Oh no. I mean, it's cool that that's a power right, up. I'm but... Hello, Carl. Oh lord! <laughs> Welcome back, Dot. Thank Wait. you, Rysewall89, for the follow. I've been I've been meaning to do Mario Kart as a multiplayer stream with friends for a while now because yeah. they did all those new tracks. Yo, that's I, a good idea. Yeah, that is I a good still idea. Haven't gotten around. What did you turn into? Did <laughs> 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 you turn into Doctor Pepper Ten? <laughs> yes. Huh? We were women and we drank <laughs> Doctor Pepper Ten. That's what happened. And that's what happened. You yeah. turned into <laughs> Doctor Pepper Ten. You, you, you gotta drink. be careful, dude. Yeah. Just. You know what? If you've never played this game before and you jump in like at level like 18 or however far you guys are, it's like basically impossible. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. What if I told you it's almost all noise? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much true. Like, there's just bullets flying everywhere. Yeah. Basically, you lose your power ups when you die, so all of us are in bad shape. Because we all die all the time. You would be Shoot, right up. I'm like, oh yeah, well what if I leap up here? <laughs> and the guy inside took a shotgun to my head. <laughs> it's not great. Like, by the way, I have friends in this window. Yeah, well what if my corpse fell on you, huh? Oh, you can, uh... You can, like, uh, slide kick this, huh? Yep. Oh. oh. It's a move you don't use very often. Kick the horse. Big trouble. Do you get iframes on that? I have no idea. Dot, have you ever played Mega Man Network Transmission, the two, the two and a half D platformer for the GameCube? You all right, no. Oh, Infuriating game, but it ends up being that you can slide underneath bosses, and it's like a Mega Man style Mega Man game. So I never, <laughs> I never assumed that I could slide underneath their legs. Thank uh -huh. you, little CJ two forty for the follow. However, it's one of the few Mega Man games I haven't beaten, so faded someday to play through. Please continue. Please, continue. Please come on. You 
you've got it this time. Yeah, jump up. Oh my god. I'm trying to conceptually wrap my head around. I was not on the fire, but as the chandelier swung, I became on the fire. <laughs> ah! That animation for being burned is good. The game just took pity on me and never attacked the corner I was hiding in. <laughs> you know what a That's lot of a people don't know? There is a sequel to this game, and it's a ninja game. Huh. Oh, you're right, I didn't update the... I didn't update the stream Those title. Some moves. Yeah, oh, they, you know... This is a traditional white person dance. This is our culture. We're being told a secret. Yeah, what if several times I typed Sunster Rider instead of Sunset Riders? Sunster Rider? <laughs> yeah, Sunster Rider. Look at this. Look at this dude. I can't remember. Is, um... Wild Guns? Uh, the, the newer one, like... It's good. I was gonna say, is it, is it like, four-player? I think they did. It is. That, but I'm not. It is four-player. Unlike the original. Ah, yeah, that was always... <laughs> not that I had a multi-tap back then, but... Yeah. Oh, I had one. That but, came you know, with, they... uh, Bomberman or whatever, right? Yeah. Yeah. I was actually telling the story earlier about how I got my multi-tap and a copy of Bomberman from a rental shop that was closing down, and they just gave me oh, a bunch of free yeah. stuff. That's free, huh? <laughs> yeah, because I was one of their best customers, so they were like, sure, you can have all this. <laughs> also gave me a copy of Dragon Warrior. Oh, And Inspector yeah. Gadget for SNES. You Ooh, remember that I game. That. <laughs> I actually have not played Inspector Gadget for NES. Oh, NES. I, I heard S. I said SNES. I know what? Oh, oh, okay. I think I've seen that. So I heard it because you said it. <laughs> yes. That would be why. Ow. <laughs> I feel like I've heard this game isn't, like, that tough to learn out of 1cc as arcade games go. I'm pretty sure the Super Nintendo version is, like, way harder. Yes. That's, that's what it's I heard. It's like, too. messed up. <laughs> That's funny. You like your new hat? It's a very fancy new hat. Completely different style and everything. Yep. Oh, God. Right. I'm going to call shenanigans. Because I'm on the other side of the U.S. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My goal is to hit more than three this time. You know, I should just sit out the beginning for a minute. <laughs> Wait till they're all over the place. Yeah. What if I just stay looking here and the second one pops up? Yeah. Yes. Results. <laughs> I got four! I did it! I didn't get any. Holy crap, Fox! How are you doing this over Farzak? <laughs> Fox is know. like, I have fiber internet. One millisecond of latency. I'm in your house. <laughs> I'm gaming out of my gourd. Apparently. <laughs> Oops. Eh. Wish. So, a rotten way to die. The sequel with ninjas is a game called Mystic Warriors, and it has a system where there are five playable characters. <laughs> oh. But if you have four people, um, well, let me put it this way: at the start of the game, somebody gets kidnapped, and it's always the person that wasn't picked in a four-player game. <laughs> And then you spend the entire game chasing the fifth person. And your character will constantly say their name whenever they see him. And one of them's named Brad. So, so they'll be like, Whoa, Brad! I 
<laughs> it's, it's very funny. <laughs> but it's otherwise pretty much exactly the same as this. Like, you just throw stars instead of firing guns. Me ready for powwow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Whoa. It jumps right into the knife. It's okay, guys. We could be playing a working design game from the same time, and it would be yep. worse. Yep. <laughs> that is absolutely true, unfortunately. What games did working design do? <laughs> Too many. Uh, they, they, they did uh, Popful Mail. Like the, the translation. They did the yeah, Lunar the games. the localization and, uh, company that adds really good jokes and punches up the script. Yeah, they also uh, harder for no reason. The one that still kills me, and I mention it all the time. Alright, ma'am, we won't shoot him. Anyway, um anyway, I mean we just shot him a million times, but anyway, um the one that really bothers me is Magic Knight Ray Earth for Saturn. Because it's this game starring a bunch of teen girls, right? And they added uh -huh. a bunch of sex and porn jokes. Ah. Appropriate. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, they, they they punched up their scripts a lot. Let's just put it that way. They also, like, would, like, triple the difficulty of some of their games. Yep. Yeah, they... they Do you ever hear their explanation as to why they did that? It's not what no. you think. It's Waldensoft, specifically. Mm -hmm. Waldensoft had a, like, uh a 30-day return window on all video game purchases. You could just, if you didn't like a game, you could just return it for any reason for a full refund. So they were worried that their games were, that people were going to buy their games from Waldensoft, beat them in under a month, and then return them. Well, so, they, they should have just not done business with Waldensoft then. Yeah. I You really, you needed to, though. Walden... Walden Books was like a pretty big retailer at that point still. That's true. I actually bought some games from them myself. Yeah. That was like our main game store for a while. Because you returned them after before a month? No, I never I never knew about that <laughs> policy. I didn't, didn't either. Re That's didn't wild. Advertise it heavily. Right. I have yeah. a I have a thought that there may have been a kind of perverse logic at work here that like it actually made sense. Because probably working designs customers were more likely to shop at Walden Sock. That's the size, so do I. Okay, Pluto. Oh god. Ow. Do you know if you run right into the bullet it hits you? Whoa, <laughs> Did thank you. Know you. Seriously? Did you know? Thank you, Professor Dot. Yeah. <laughs> I should have slid under those bullets. Like, we gotta remember we have slide, right? Yeah, I've been doing it sometimes. I keep forgetting it even exists. I don't think I ever used it back yeah, in the day as a much, kid. The parsec is pretty laggy for me, personally. Yeah. Not that I care. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry, though. Do Anytime flip. I slide under or through I'll something, I did it, like, bye. so far in advance. I feel you. I talked over the Ocelo bye bye. I'm sorry. <laughs> Funny enough, it I looks like you all that. have just about like sixty to seventy ping. Yeah, that's well, you not. You can actually bad. see that. That's cool. Dang. How do you? Can we see that? Um, I think so. I think if you press the button to bring up the menu, you can see your own ping. I'm not. Saying oh well. Because like a bar appears at the top. <laughs> oh. When you have the menu open, that shows some statistics. Oh, okay. Do I wait, wait, wait? Oof. Please continue. Please continue. Fine. Maybe I will. <laughs> I mean, they ask nicely. They're so kind about it. They weren't like all the other toxic arcade machines. <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> I ran right uh, into it. Uh, I got killed by the I screen like scrolling. I dying before, for so I was like, alright. For some reason, it didn't occur to me that, yeah, that's gonna hurt my allies. Ah. You know, kind of like you how I was just gun. cut down. <laughs> I'll be up here. Okay. <laughs> God, that running animation is so good. It, it is. is. Powerful. 
We can wait. We're patient, cowboys. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Oh no, we ah, <laughs> What the- I thought we landed after the rocks, but we got crushed by the rocks. Yep. <laughs> Use Gatling gun! No! <laughs> oh, oh no, not me. Bob! You know, the green person we have in the Actually. stream, Bob! Actually, you know, that's a good point. You, you guys, you, none of you had the opportunity because it's on a, it's on a Patreon and the content just came out. What do we do? Uh, I think we dropped down. Um. Ah. Okay, what the? Oh, there uh, what? Just was having scrolling issues. <laughs> These are good Bob emotes. Thank you, chat. Uh, so, on the Chugging Bleach episode that just went up for patrons, Bob's the host of Chugging Bleach, and he goes, Hi, I'm your host, Dan Vitti- Wait, no, I'm not! <laughs> <laughs> and everyone loses it, and Chris is just like, Really? Are you serious? <laughs> you forgot who you were? <laughs> we should all wish to be as handsome as you. Whoa. You know, in, in games like this, I like two two different uh, functions that not all of them have. Oh my god, yeah. I was shooting one of you. I was like, dude, this boss doesn't take any damage. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I did say bury me with my money, so that, that was on me. <laughs> oh my god. But I really like when you can lock which way you're aiming with the shoulder button. Yeah. And, and I also like when you hold the shoulder button to just stand still and aim. Uh what? Oh, yeah, he got it. Baby. Yeah. Man. Why did we all shoot him in the belly? My question is, why did he take it off? Yeah. <laughs> he wanted to see our reaction more than he wanted to continue living. Again, <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> He's like, you know, as soon as they get me no, into no, critical no. condition, I'm going to take off my vest. This could be so cool. We probably dented it. We had to. Yeah. Winter says this game would be way better with friendly fire, and I'm horrified to think about it myself. No, that's, oh, that's bad impossible. enough every time the gas yeah. gets manned. I did it. You did it. Good job, Sam. Hey, chocolate coins. I love sacks of cash. This song is a classic. It's a good one. Oh, I've never oh, played this game, but I've heard all the music a million times. Yeah. <laughs> this is a good video game, even if it has an unfortunate moment. For some reason, my eyes misparsed the horses when they were close to screen as chickens. I couldn't explain why. <laughs> You're like, the wait. end. The end. The end. And it's like, hey, want to keep playing? Want to keep playing? It's like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll turn you into space dust. I always loved that line. <laughs> Bury me with oh, my money dot com. Does it just add it lead to Dino Please's streams? It's surprising <laughs> no, it, that it it's doesn't. A cool site, actually. Oh, it is. I'll click on it. If I if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> it's like it it spawns a a new guy every time you click or something. That's oh. really funny. Oh, it's a clicker. That's cool. <laughs> That's really good. Where's that damn fourth oh, chaos okay. emerald? No, I, I was mistaken. No, I wasn't. All right, we're good. Anyway. <laughs> okay, we're good. Because it was important. Yeah, that that is cool. That is cool. <laughs> I like the part where he asks to be buried with his money. Yeah. Relatable. <laughs> yeah, so like, I think... Far less people have played Mystic Warriors than have played Sunset Riders. Yeah. Part of the unfortunate stuff is it lags a little in four-player. <laughs> it's too intense. Apparently so. 
its ambition too much. Let's see. This is another Konami one. 92. Gotcha. Yeah, it apparently has three buttons. <gasps> Just let me know when it's, it's my turn. Too many buttons. You're right. Mm, You're not wrong. My gamer brain can't parse that many buttons. Does it have a separate it start button? That many buttons. Yeah, it has a separate start button too. Okay, so player two, whoever whoever wants to be player two. I can be player two. Okay. okay. Let's go. You have that many buttons, you made the game wrong. <laughs> uh, any idea what these buttons do? I think that it's jump. I mean, I think it's shoot, jump, and probably like a bomb button. I'm not entirely okay. sure. Well, we're going to try this. We're going to see. If you guys need to rebind later, it's easy enough to do. Okay, okay player three, whoever that is. Uh, I'll do it. Okay. You know, I'm realizing I don't need to go to Starbucks for this olive oil coffee. I can make it myself. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that that that's a revelation too strong for humankind. Okay, player four, Vox. I'm Vox. Yep. You're Vox. Well, you know, I have my moments. <laughs> oh my god, Vox is here. She's gonna backdash everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> She's one of those players, after all. Oh my god. I forgot it's about that. So okay, so we have start funny. buttons here too, uh, Dan. Oh, sorry. Oops. What? Okay, let me try it again. Okay, that got it. There we okay, go. Okay, uh, dot. I promise you I hit the button. I think I must have tabbed out. Yeah, yeah. that's what happened to me yep. just now. And Fox. <laughs> I'm trying to re-promote uh. the stream, so it was for a good cause. And here's the coin buttons. Let me set mine. Dan? We have to pay Not. to play this game. <laughs> oh my Fox. god, video games nowadays are so pay to win. Don't worry, we're just using tokens over here. Yeah, they're nothing like money. Yeah, <laughs> they don't need they don't need to look like money. Okay, let me see. Is there a service menu here I can get into? What do I have to do to get some service around here? I agree. Okay, okay. I can't tell what I have highlighted because there's there's no indication. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> great design, guys. Great design. Okay. I think we can you made the game something. good instead of wrong. Oh, we're on free play anyway. Yeah. Okay, um, so can you drag the window for this a little bit over to the right? That's so what I was thinking because it was yeah, confusing me a bunch. <laughs> in um, well, it actually did a really interesting thing. I wasn't going to bring up because I didn't want to sound like I was complaining. Yeah, because whatever I, I can tolerate it. Um, and I wish I had properly. That is just the Terminator thing. <laughs> anyway, um, so it would try to scroll the. Play field, and since there was a hard edge and then a repeat of the exact content yeah. that was to the right of it, it actually caused a vertical line to appear <laughs> six times throughout it as it scrolled to the left because the codec <laughs> is like, I don't know. <laughs> That's interesting, actually. It's struggling. And now, these warriors are pretty mystic. Wait, what is this artwork? What is this? What is this on the sides? Gee, we don't have any way to change that right now. Whatever, I guess we've got a bezel. Yeah, that's fine. Exhilarating non-stop ninja action. It's sure to be it's... mega hit. It <laughs> doesn't say a mega hit. Sell me on playing the game Armageddon of the ninjas! <laughs> you are the only one that can stop this Armageddon! You guys can start without me. I'm going to jump in like in 15 seconds after I make a coffee. Okay, okay. Ninja, ninja. Yes, that's the coin sound. I don't mind whoever anyone wants to be. What do we got here? All right, this, this dude looks wild. Okay, um, I will play as him. 
Let's see who gets kidnapped. Brad. Ha. Check that out. It just steals away <laughs> the remaining character. Isn't that awesome? Hell yeah. And the guy who's not oh, playing Brad. just... <laughs> yeah, you're gonna hear that a lot. Oh my god. Oh my god, I have my jump and my attack backwards. Okay, um... Uh, I'll figure it out. It doesn't matter. Okay. What does the third button do? I think it's... I think it's a bomb. Whoa, what is, what is this? What is this shit I got going on here? Bomb. Oh, I see. That's the slide. Because remember, this is Sunset Riders, basically. Then I have, like, a hair whip. Yeah, check out how the frames drop so easily sometimes in this game. It, it, it gets... I'm just swinging my hair at <laughs> Fantastic. That's, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I would move Dan to not be in front of the video as much, but I think it looks great that way. <laughs> yeah, I like it. <laughs> Columbo just... Take it out. So this is uh, oh, one of those video games, huh? <laughs> exactly. Well, you, you are know, not. I have a, I have a nephew. Game's really <laughs> into these. Uh... <laughs> the game lags that we can play better in Parsec. Yeah. Yeah. Believe me, this game lags a lot. It can't be helped. The first, the first game ever optimized for Parsec. Hey, check out that game. Looks awfully familiar. Ninja. <laughs> That's French <Right>. flammables. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Fortnite, says Roto. <laughs> you notice he's got the same, like, hurt noise as Sunset Riders do? Yeah. Yeah. I think TMNT also uses that sound. I would believe it. Like, they're all from, like, that same era, right? It's yeah. running on basically the same hardware, except this one chugs. Uh -huh. <laughs> one might say this doesn't run. <laughs> yeah, they, this walks on the hardware that mm -hmm. Sunset Riders runs Aww. on. <laughs> Sunset, Sunset Riders ran, so this could walk. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if I can overclock the CPU. No, that's rules. You know that guy who um. Yeah, this is so much easier for, <laughs> for the yes. slowdown. Don't don't change it. Okay, you fair. Things. I mean, actually, I kind of agree with you. So. Check this out. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Wouldn't change a thing. Uh. That dude got deleted by a VFX package. <laughs> Damn, he's dead. <laughs> Brag! Brag! I love that jump. That's a good jump. The super high jump. Yep. Thank you, Professor Bad Vibes, for the follow. Hey, Professor. But yeah, the uh, the person who made that PS1 Mr. Core actually made a specific ah. spin-off for Nice. Made it cleanly over. Um, where the CPU is cranked insanely high. Oh, and it's shit. like just just for games that are absolutely the slowdown is 100% on the CPU end. Yeah. Oh, I think uh, Kingsfield would probably run really well on that. I'm pretty sure that's one yeah. of those games. Mm -hmm. it, totally. That this... absolutely looks like the type of game where it would be on the CPU end. You know, the moment you said Kings, I thought you were going to say Kingston. Kingston, yes, yeah, same. Yeah, Kingston. I'm scared to up? throw it back. I'm gonna, <laughs> I was gonna roll. <laughs> it waited for us to get close before it blew up. <laughs> that's a smart bomb. Yes, clearly. This is like when you're playing Goldeneye and you have, like, proximity mine. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Check it out, isn't this rad? This is the horse stage of this game. 
This is this is just a Jackie Chan movie now. <laughs> I'm trying to remember the one that actually does have an opening, kind of like this. Thank you, Simon, for the bits. Kingston 4, the ancient kitty. Kingston, the ideal Kitopia. <laughs> hey, there you go. Yeah. Mutopia? Mutopia. What about Mutopia. Mutopia. I, I hate when people do what I just did to you. Like, oh, uh, no. joke? Well, you could have made it a little better. <laughs> no, I love that. <laughs> I'm I'm very much a writing room guy. Yeah. A writing room <laughs> It's a workshop, guys. I feel bad for all these minions. They're just taking a real tumble. Look at that. I don't feel bad for them. They're trying to kill me. True. They took Brad. Fuck them. <laughs> Okay, okay, you've you've convinced me. I keep hogging the items because I assume one of them's gonna be a life refill, and it hasn't happened yet. <laughs> I'm so strong, but I'm on the verge of death. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I lost my sick powers. <laughs> I'm this animation. I'm just punching, dude. <laughs> Get off him, man. Punching him with a shuriken. <laughs> I'll hit you. Oh. That was hell. Constantly <laughs> eating these these ninja stars is just ridiculous. <laughs> We're just eating yeah, people. Know. You ready to get to battle? Let's go. <laughs> just throwing these things over and over. <laughs> yeah. <as a> <laughs> I I'm love this game. There weren't 80s movies that like were just somebody throwing 300 ninja stars. Ninja. ninja. I love that coin sound. It's so dumb that it's perfect. <laughs> I feel like every ninja game should have that sound somewhere. Also, every game. Yeah. Yeah. Make it the new Wilhelm scream. Yeah. Ninja. I was going to say something. I was like, wait, you, you all already saw that I posted the raw Wilhelm tape recording. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was really cool, Can't actually. You get by an alligator and he screams. <laughs> it makes sense. I mean, I would <laughs> scream. Yeah. He just makes the Roblox sound. <laughs> hey, that you, you can't use that anymore. Tommy Del Rico has, owns it. And yet, I don't believe him. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he also claims to have made some Sonic music, like Sonic of the Black Knight songs or something. I'm just like, yes, he does. I'm just like, no, obviously not. And then, and then he said that was the first time uh, Sonic Team had ever worked with an American composer. Yeah, and oh. everyone's like, oh, <laughs> what? That's a special kind of bullcrap. Of course, it Whoa. is Tommy, so I don't know what I was, what I would have been expecting. You know what's funny? All of you are in Parsec, and I'm the one who took a tumble. <laughs> it's okay. You what? <laughs> your, your brain's running in real time, but that's not syncing up with the game, which definitely <laughs> isn't. Oh, man, we all ah, fell for that. Well, two of us fell for that. Trying to get ahead of the problem. It put me right square in it. My ninja is named Spyros. That's not like a ninja name to you? Spyros? Yeah, no, Spyros. That sounds like a dragon name. Yeah, it's like a plural of Spyro. Yes. I can't tell where I'm supposed to jump with these. Like, it's like the edge of the skis or... Yeah, I'm not entirely certain. I think it's your feet, but I'm not. Yeah, I think it's the feet. Yeah, I think it's the feet. It's the feet. Whoa! I tried to jump in between them. I'm just gonna pretend that's what I, I did. Cool roll. Like, there's. What was I gonna say? It's interesting the air control you have doing. Yeah. That's a really good stopping pose. <laughs> hey, everyone, oh show goodness. him your ass while he I love. Dies. I love what Vox's character is doing, though. Everyone else is in stasis as you flow. <laughs> Thank you.
Oh yeah, I guess I should tell people so they can be disappointed now. I did not stick olive oil in my coffee. <laughs> Why not? That's like the new fucking trend. Well, trend. Bob has really nice olive oil and I didn't want to waste it. Oh, okay. That, that would have made the stuff. best coffee though. Like the best olive oil. That's how you make it good. You have the premium, like, dark green glass bottle and jar. Yeah. How cheap do you think is the olive oil the Starbucks puts in your coffee? I'm looking over at it now, just thinking. Because <laughs> I got that picture over there, and I'm like, mm. <laughs> What know. was that Part sound? Of me is like... Part of me is like that... I know weird. olive oil's yellow, but, like, that yellow? I don't... Yeah. Sushi. Sushi. <laughs> 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 oh, crap. Oh, cool. We're now in another world. And the tentacles have a port. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> Thank you, Felly. I was wondering if it was going to become a shmup. Kinda have. Always has been. <laughs> Fortunately, you can melee the missiles. Thank you, Neo Zero, for gifting a sub to. Sally. I don't know how to do the melee. Like, I keep doing it if I just hit the like, jump button I think a it's bunch, the but I it's think proximity it's based, right? It's proximity. Yeah. You just yeah. have to be close uh, and it's a fire button. Fox has a problem getting close to people. Oh! It's true. <laughs> Jeez, and we're getting real over here at the birthday party. <laughs> you might be an expert gamer, but you oh, are. Yo, check this. Yeah. Yo, nice! <laughs> Dang, I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> I, got, I got hit by one of the things spawning up there. Oh no! I want to try to get up to him and like do a melee. Yeah. I wish this game had you a know, charge do, shot. Do a melee. It's my only wish. I don't wish for a better world, I just wish for a charge shot. But yeah, that's what the dip glitch settings look like, and I didn't even let me go. Well, you could change the sound of Mono World, and you can change the number of players. Ooh. You could uh, change the unused. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid so, oh Philly. God, my parsec. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, crap! What's happening, God? Is... It's fine. It's fine. It, it, it hits pretty hard, but we're good now. Okay, me. good. Uh. Oh sure, now we can shoot just... while standing still. <laughs> <laughs> my expression on my face as I do this. <laughs> that hair whip is so good though. Thank you, Monty Rob. I just I can't get over it's just four of these four of these dudes just showing up like alright, let's go. Throwing throwing little ninja stars. Let's just all do four it, of them. Ninjas. I really want to know whose idea it was to retool Sunset Riders a sequel as a ninja game like this, because, like, I get it, but also, it's funny. <laughs> like, that's a super inspired choice in the strangest way. Udon! Are you player three? Yeah. I'm sorry. Why? I took food. Oh, <laughs> you and player four are both like one. Yeah, geez, where's, where's my apology? Huh? <laughs> well, fine, oh, I, I was in the water. A little closer. I just realized I could jump in the water. Oh no! There's something else I'm creative? Oh man. I love my hair whip attack. 
Yeah, that's a mood, isn't it? This game's a lot easier, isn't it? Yeah. I think I've continued once. See, the thing is, if you were playing by yourself, it would be running at full speed. Uh-huh, yeah, and then it would be impossible. Yeah, exactly. Bizarrely enough, this game is easier with more people, not because there's more people, but because the game can't handle it. Yeah. You ever think about, like, that image where it's, like, the future if, or society if? Yeah. Yeah, yes. yeah. That's, that's me if I had, like, a sharp X68K growing up. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that and an Amiga. Let's go. An Amiga? Yeah, no, the Amiga I'm... had really cool stuff. Yeah. yeah. Like, legit. I, hey, I, I'm not going to take that from somebody who, who played uh, Gianna Sisters on DOS. Uh, Commodore 64, I'll have you know. Check out this oh, Spider-Man okay. villain. Yeah, this guy seems a little borrowed. Oh, no. No! Oh, I jumped too early. <laughs> Aw. Uh, there's food up here. Player one needs it. Ooh, unfortunately, I... Yeah. I'm player one, by the way. Yes. I assumed as such, but I really didn't want to, uh... Do so out loud, just to get up. <laughs> oh crap! I usually hedge my bets on me being wrong. Oh crap! Is that money? Five hundred dollars. Yippee! <laughs> I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy a carousel. Where is my <laughs> Poor guy. Your comrade is now. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, I ratioed that boss. <laughs> I love that scene though. That poor guy. Uh. Your comrade is now... <laughs> Yo, let's yeah. go! Yeah. Music? I could tell this was going into a Streets of Rage Music? sort of area. I like it. Oh, I can't remember what the song I was listening to was, but Amazon Music is like, would you like to listen to this next? It was one of the songs Yuzo stole for Streets of Rage. Like, Hell yeah! Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh, Dan, you didn't steal it. It was a homage. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you. I thought I was the only one who who said whole bug game. I'm trying to get out of here, I promise you. There we go. Yeah. At it's least it wasn't like that. To drown in a river. At least it wasn't like that mystery hang up that we got before in Sunset Riders. Yeah. <laughs> so after this is Turtles and Time. I mean if you guys want, sure. I'm gonna uh, for basically anything. I just thought that would be aesthetically fitting to follow this up. True. Wait, how many ladies were there? <laughs> a lot of ladies. <laughs> where all the women at yes. to here? <laughs> They're all standing on top of each other in this one frame. <laughs> yeah. Skull oh. one. Udon. Whoa. Very cool. <laughs> Good job, team. Our synchronized jump shows we're ready for the acrob <laughs> the aerobatics competition. <laughs> we're gonna go for that gymnast gold. <laughs> Whoa! Sick. <laughs> awesome. Check out his the thing on his sash. <laughs> the anonymous gifter gifted a tier one sub to Brad. Ha, that is a giant brain. Ow! Jumping in front of that turret killed me. Yeah, Shredder's Revenge is totally worth it, Cryonic. Really good game. Shredder's Revenge is worth what? Oh, it's picked up. Okay. That's a Game Boy one. Shredder's Revenge is the new one. 
Oh, sorry. Yes, okay. The Game Boy ones have weird titles I could never remember. True. So that's why my brain defaulted to that. Yeah, I, um, I got that new one, and I watched all the endings for the main four, which is not easy. It's kind of annoying. It's yeah, because, like, the boss fights. even if you're in multiplayer, it only shows you the ending for the first player. Uh-huh. I was like, why am I doing this? This isn't even worth it. But I really enjoyed that game. We had to wait for the turret that to come out. That gonna open. Yeah. <laughs> We all, kinda, we all just kind of, we all just kind of turned like, screw that guy. I should have just, I should have just slid. I don't know. Oh. Can I? Get Ow. Up here? No. We both oh went God. for it. Damn. <laughs> Don't you love that you can slice the missiles? It's pretty good. I'm trying to remember, doesn't uh, Revenge of Shinobi also have a, if you're close, you do a melee? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Shinobi did. <laughs> that victory pose? Hey. Maybe he's Her born with it. Yo, this song is sick. Absolutely. Stuff like this song is why it sucks that so many people know Sunset Riders, but not many people know Mystic Warriors by comparison. That is true. Yeah, I'm honestly not sure I'd ever heard of it before. Yeah, I... I certainly I have no clue. What is easily describable as too many retro YouTubers over the years. <laughs> And I don't think ever once that they brought this up because it doesn't have a SNES game, does it? Yeah, that's no. a big deal. Yeah, there's no yeah. port. Maybe there would have been a port if the SNES had a really good CPU. Yeah, this, this runs bad enough on arcade. <laughs> right? You'd have to turtles in time it and just make a new game and call it the same thing. Yeah. I don't get it. Why didn't they port this to the Sharp 68K? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, did you ever, um, did you ever hear that thing, I believe it was a Sharp 68 cape, or I could just be mixing up the MSX with it. You know what? It's, it's the MSX. It totally is. Um, but it had two floppy ports, and Konami would literally code games, so that way if you had a different game of theirs yeah. in the second port, they'd give you cheat codes and stuff. They, they would give you, like, bonuses and advantages and stuff. Yeah, and the fan art is coming in today. It was a pretty, um pretty unremarkable game, but a lot of people bought it just to have the ludicrous advantages they would give you in all their games. That's really interesting. Legit. Yeah. I was like, that's cool. Man, it's like Amiibos if they kept doing things instead of doing things for a bit for some games. Except for they're also games in and of themselves. Honestly. Which is weird. I was thinking about it and it's like... They used to do stuff back in the day, you know, like the Metal Gear Solid 1 moment of reading the memory card and being like, oh, you bought this other game from us, ooh. Uh, and you can do that even better now with hard drives being standard on every console, but no one does that. Yeah, oh like, my god, I thought you were going to say, and you could do that even better now with NFTs, and it's like, what? Oh. <laughs> 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 I got in the call with an NFT head. <laughs> hey guys, check this out. I'm checking it. Miserably. Miserably. <laughs> this game rules. You read I can't that believe line. Brad is fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, you could do that way better with that FT. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I've been getting a lot of fan art today. I haven't even shown all of it off yet. I'm too absorbed into the game right now. I got a Sunset Riders piece. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it looks so good. And there's more too, but you know. One thing at a time. One thing at a time. Oh. No, everything everywhere all at once. <laughs> I still have to watch that movie. Congratulations, here's your Oscar. Whoa. Thank you. You know, I actually consistently said something really close to the title of that movie for years. And now that the movie's out, I can't really do that anymore because it'll just sound like I'm referencing the movie. Did any of you notice that. how the game... Oh, let me watch that. Yeah, it's a good movie. The game sped up a lot when somebody was dead for a second. <laughs> <laughs> like a lot, a lot. I picked her because of her name. I'm just, I'm just putting that out there. Because <laughs> her name is Yuri. Come on, little, little baby. Sorry. Sorry. It was clicked off. What's with this music? This is sick. Is this like Brad's mixtape that he left for us or something? We'll never know. It's gone now. Yeah. <laughs> he died miserably. Uh, <laughs> and curse! <laughs> Games is like, bet you regret destroying that so fast. <laughs> Help, please! <laughs> so, Dot. Yes. Say you had to... Oh, God! <laughs> oh, my God. Say you could get coffee from a coffee shop. Uh-huh. What kind of coffee are you making? How are you making it? Are you buying it pre-made? Huh, I make it oh, all the time. Can I, can okay. I say it, Dot? Can, can, I, can I say what you get every time? Yeah, sure. Dot gets a cold brew. With mm -hmm. uh, with uh, a little breve and mm -hmm. three three shots of simple syrup. Pumps. Pumps. Three shots would be a lot of simple syrup. Okay, three <laughs> three pumps of simple syrup. Yeah, correct. And that's why you make it at home, or that's why you order at the coffee shop. Yeah, that's what I order at the coffee shop. Okay. But when I make it at home, it's the same thing. Because simple syrup is like you just boil water and sugar. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I worked at a liquor store for a yeah. few years. But how does it pair with Italian Beth? Uh, just fine, actually. <laughs> oh, how I see. It, how does it pair with the olive oil? Oh. I'll let you know. <laughs> I'll do no! It. No, I'm not going to do that. Five <laughs> pumps of olive oil. Oh my like lord, Dragon Cat Man is on no, fire so. today. <laughs> you have five pumps of olive oil. Yeah, he just five shots. He just pumped out a Mystic oh, Warriors one too. Holy crap! Um. <laughs> uh, what is happening? What? what is happening? Is this uh... the game's having an issue? Apparently, that was just a front layer. We still have to thick it. Picking the uh the the, the peepsy. Yeah. Uh, we really ugh. don't have to do that. No. <laughs> Nobody has we to do that. Would. That's it. I'm you know, if you say honest. you're gonna do something. The slowdown okay. gives it soul. Then, yeah, you can change your mind at any time because we have free <laughs> will. That yeah, exactly. <laughs> that is what they say. <laughs> I know those boxes I are would, supposed uh, to say skull, but it just seems to have a box and then coal. Um, I think I'd rather drink the olive oil coffee than drink Pep Peepsy ever again. That's that stuff was revolting. Yeah, it was no, really it was, disgusting. It was so but bad that I picked it thickened? up at again. <laughs> what if it was oh God! Coffee? Huh? Maybe a little, maybe a little thick. Something tells me Mame is maybe not prepared for this. Yeah. Game. <laughs> Maybe its lack of popularity has resulted in a blind spot for the MAME community? Yeah. You are finally beyond hope. 
Okay. <laughs> True. That guy on the right's hair. Oh, the, the left too, actually. He like sent some supermodel assassins after us. Wouldn't you? I mean, yeah, I would exclusively employ supermodel assassins if I were a supervillain, but... You just don't expect everyone to live up to that standard, though, you know? Yeah. I'm really good at catching these blades with my face. <laughs> yeah, I just got maced. Um, actually, it's a ball and chain. Man, you got mace. What did, what did, uh, what did you say? Hello, my lady? Cops <laughs> 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 flying off in the distance. You see that shit? <laughs> it looks like he has an exclamation good. point above his head. is running so well. Yes. <laughs> it's almost like this arcade board can't deal with this many projectiles, so we maybe shouldn't have a four-player game. <laughs> <laughs> like, of course there were two-player cabinets as well, because Konami did a lot of those, but like... <laughs> yeah. I liked how when he threw his flail and I got in his face and just started twirling my hair. And that's, <laughs> that's how we leave. Oh, Bye. This is how Mind blow up. Get food. <laughs> Check out this music. This game soundtrack rules. Yeah. Yeah, this game might kick ass. It actually reminds me a lot of PS1 soundtracks for games. Yeah. Oh my god, the freaking long skirt. Attention. I mean, didn't we learn that in Sunset Riders? I may have actually not been playing at that point. <laughs> <laughs> the lessons I learned from Sunset Riders is it's really hey, cool don't go to up get there. with your money. <laughs> Oh. Got Maku time. Whoop. Man, all this, all this Toho is paying off. <laughs> we blew up that house. Good. Is this a Final Fantasy VII reference? Frodo yeah. says West 42nd Street? Isn't that just down the street from Times Square? I mean, this is clearly Japan, but at the same time. Yeah, New York, Japan. Yeah. yeah. This is this is the future of New York and the timeline where the economic disparity between Japan as a superpower and us just kept going in that direction for another two decades. Yeah, we're just here it's in like, New York. And literally every American company is owned by Japan. <laughs> Wait, even Tencent? <laughs> Tencent's Chinese. Yeah, not American. <laughs> you said every company. I said American Coming. It was in there. Okay, okay, fair enough. I missed that part. That dude's rocking out. <laughs> yeah. Okay, see you, bud. I miss him already. <laughs> Tempura. 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 <laughs> what do you want for dinner? <laughs> Tempura. Sushi. What the? I've been facing the wrong way for about half the boss fight. Yeah, that happens. Happened to me a bunch of Sunset Rider ones. If only it ran slower. <laughs> <laughs> if only it ran slower. <laughs> Wait. Wait, is it done? I'm a good loser. Please finish it for me. Oh, 
beautiful. That was perfect. Sliced in half with the hair. You know, I, I've been missing out on an opportunity to just bring up things about your list this entire stream. Oh, yeah? I should have been like, where's Spanky's quest? <laughs> <laughs> Immaculate super game. It runs uh, <laughs> slightly smoother than this. <laughs> the thing is, I, I like want to... game a lot more when you use the other name. I want to play it, but I want to play it at a time where you can be there. <laughs> it's, it's a good game on the Super Nintendo, the Game Boy. I, I don't know. It's neat on Game Boy. Baby but, bottle uh... pop. Baby bottle pop. Yeah, I do. Yeah, that what? drives me insane. Suki Yaki. <laughs> I kind of want them to just be like fried shrimp. <laughs> Can you imagine if they localized the game into something more American themed and they did that? Cheeseburger! <laughs> Chicken tender! Cheese pizza! Five piece nugget! Hot dog with ketchup and mustard! Okay, I gotta ask all of you. And you may not know. Does your McDonald's charge an insane amount for soda? Because our local, like, the people who own all of the McDonald's around here insanely raise the price. Really? Mm. I never go to McDonald's. Yeah, McDonald's no is known for having, like, a, a buck for a soda. On yeah, its own. and they Ow. raised it to, like, $1.70 or $2.30 or something insane. Sheesh. Yeah. It's to the point where they, they started doing a bundle where they're like, a McDouble bundle, it's only three fifty, And I'm like, yeah, but if I get a soda, it's back up to $6. So this is just bringing me, this is bringing me back to the subject of what if this game were more American? Like, what if you pick up a health item, McGriddle? McGriddle. <laughs> I'm good. Cool, I got a jewel. I got a jewel right Oh crap! He got fire arrows. Watching him turn in slow mo was so funny. You know, if I stop shooting, we move what? pretty quickly. <laughs> oh, yeah, we do. Up to get the help. <laughs> All right, well, so someone else can grab the health then. Uh, apparently oh, not. too late. I die. My, my coin button doesn't seem to be working. Well, we're in free play, but. Ninja! I just wanted to keep hitting it and I hear it say ninja. I think you set it to the right trigger or something? Yeah, it's not doing anything. Huh. Oh well. Oh, look at him! Everything must be now. Oh, <laughs> I would simply not be there. <laughs> That's the correct method. Oh crap! Looks like sliding doesn't work. No, I thought it, it would. It worked for me just now, anyway. Yeah, I saw you do it, and then I kept bouncing off of it for some reason. Maybe oh, the gear needed to be raised up. Oh yeah, that's yeah. What's with the power oh, generators in the background? Uh... It's okay. He's just swinging his spear through me repeatedly. There we go. Ah, not that time though. I think what actually was the case was uh, I was only holding down. I didn't realize. Oh yeah, it has to be diagonal. Yeah. Crap. Oh. And it was like, yeah, you can try to jump down <laughs> he blew a up. solid platform. I wish That's I could it. pick okay, it bye. up. <laughs> we walked over here to kill that guy. Ah. Oh, it's those Streets of Rage 3 lasers. Oh, I was going to say those uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade lasers. Well, both of them, really. <laughs> well, these are Thunderbolts. <laughs> if you think about it. Huh. I'm surprised you got this far. However, 
You won't go any further, as you'll never beat me. <laughs> this nerd. Oh, he's just gonna become Crank. Well, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Dude never skips arm day. No, he bought a lot of arms at Aesthetic Julia. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Ah. Please continue. Uh, it's a little more. Mocking. <laughs> yeah. So, so it's a little less polite. But it's funny that he still says it. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, now, now he's using his legs. Oh crap, those are bombs. Uh... Whoa. <laughs> it just sped up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For comedic effect, it will in fact run better. frame. It's over. <laughs> 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 to microwave. <laughs> that guy is really American. What a good game. <laughs> I can't yeah, believe Brad is fucking dead. <laughs> I wonder if BBH has one CC this. The answer is usually yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Not surprised. Guys, I miss Brad. Brad was a good guy. He was a Brad guy. <laughs> he was a so, good man. I've had that very with me with my money site uh, on my laptop this whole time, and it's still occasionally dropping a new guy. <laughs> <laughs> he did, he did. I looked it up. Ah. <sighs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Dab. <laughs> yes, perfect. Perfect. 
<laughs> oh, what a good game. Um, I gotta go to the restroom. You guys said turtles in time after, right? Okay. Uh, I actually need to eat. Fair enough. Uh, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> That's uh, fair. Yeah. I guess I'll just go, and then if you're still going, when I free up, I'll poke my head back in. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, oh, either yeah, way, I'm going to go to the restroom. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right and then I'm going to show all the new art. Yeah. <laughs> the way it synced up perfectly with the dots icon disappearing was way too funny to me. Yes! I hope I make that sound when I die. <laughs> Reaction so image of the club was so good. Uh, yes. So good. <laughs> I, I'm really glad I had two random frames ripped from Columbo to, to crop this out of. I'm going to become one of those Columbo tubers I've heard so much about. Columbo tuber? Could you imagine? That would be so funny. Oh, I wonder how Columbo would look in uh God, what is um I wonder how Columbo would look made as a meta human. Like that Unreal Engine 5 thing I showed you. Oh. Yeah. Maybe. Or what, what would be cool is if you just made a character kind of based on Columbo. Oh, yeah. Lord. And it's got like the huge oversized jacket. And... It's really just me as Columbo, which doesn't look that much different. It's just my hair is less curly. Ha. Well, you know. And I don't have a lazy eye. That's about the only. Well, he doesn't have a lazy eye. He has a fake eye. Um, for yeah. anyone in chat who didn't know. The actor Peter Falk uh, had a replacement eye. I can never remember which one's the false eye. Well, that's what you got to puzzle out, right? Yeah. <laughs> I spend every scene switching where I'm like, it's this one. No, shit, it's that one. No, shit, it's this one. <laughs> what about Columbo as a cute anime dog? I feel like that's been done. That has to have been done. It sounds like something somebody would have done. What would what would Dog Columbo's name be? Columbo, honestly. One second. <laughs> I'm almost there. <laughs> or maybe just Frank. Columbone. 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 There it is. Uh. Yes. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Like, this has been a great stream. Like, I would have been happy Cappy get off here, but it does make sense to play Turtles in Time. Oh. The Holy Trilogy. Well, I, I will probably be hopping off for now. That's fine. Okay. Thank, thank you for having me come by for your birthday. Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Let me do this one more time. Thank you so much, Fox. You're, you're welcome. <laughs> Have a good night. Good night, everyone. Good night, Dan. And happy birthday again, Sarah. Thank you very good much. Night. Thank you, Yzok Plex, for following. Where is the two-player version? There it is. Thank you, Digimonda, for following. Hey, Digi. Okay, I've got art to show. Yes, show this art. Let's see. There's a bunch of stuff. First of all, it seems like JD has improved this. I will show it. You could play some music while we're doing this. Yeah, I, I kind of forgot. It slips my mind because I'm not used to having ambient music on my stream yet. Need to do it more though.
Thank you for the reminder, See, really. Uh, I honestly... Yeah? We're in a weird situation because I have my co-host that we don't prep a lot of things like an away screen, um, musical transitions to show stuff. Thank you, Sally. Or dancing emotes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Where did I put that? Let's see. There it is. Chat seems to be of the opinion that Soldier Blade owns. Yeah. So we've got this, and it does look great. A nice background. Yeah. And from Dragon Cat Man, we have. And the Dragon Cat Man folder is so huge. Like, yeah. fill this up. We got this, imagine. and it's very good. <laughs> Just throwing, throwing the dynamite right back. <laughs> and then that's, you know, so one of one of your allies is standing next to where it lands. Of course, of course, that's the only way. Oh lord, apparently a new- another new art just came in. But anyway, I gotta show Retro's to Coma first. Okay, so, first panel. This because of course, <laughs> even has the text. That's <laughs> that's really good. And then the second panel. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't make me carry all this heavy prop gold on my birthday, would you? <laughs> Thank you, Retro. Okay, we've got another piece from Dragon Cat Man from Mystic Warriors. Oh my god. So how many terabytes is Dragon Cat Man's folder at this point? I I'm not sure if they have a measurement for it yet. So yeah, so here we have the Mystic Warriors one. <laughs> it's very good. Thank you so much, Dragon Cat Man, for all your hard work. <laughs> and then, lastly, so far, I wouldn't necessarily call this fan art because it's done by my official artist. Um, but we have this. <laughs> That's really good. Yeah, apparently it was done in two hours. Really? Apparently so. Yeah. Yeah, that's nuts, right? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> that's also good. Okay, um... <laughs> so, Dan, I guess it's you and me. Thank yeah, you. absolutely. Let's do this. Thank you really tiring retired for following... <laughs> Okay, so bring up the game, stop this audio. Put on that audio. Hide the game at first, I guess, so I can edit this. Okay, we got. Uh, my controls are fine. Okay, so player two. Okay. Boop. 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 Okay. Yeah, sometimes it takes two boops, it seems. Here's your start button. 
Here's my coin button. Here's your coin button. Okay. That was simple. The only thing is, like, have you played arcade Turtles in Time? You probably have, right? I haven't in 30 years. Okay. Well, something you uh, ought to know is that it is very different from Super Nintendo Turtles in Time. Very different. They may as well be different games. Yeah, you were talking about that earlier, and I'm like, I had no idea. Yeah, there are some differences, but overall, it feels like completely different. Okay, let's start. Can you move the window to the right? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Let me, let me, oops, crap. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Feel free to join in. That works. So this first level is basically all I remember. Understandable, to be honest. Like, the I thing about this is, of, uh... like... You don't have many attacks, like, there's not a whole lot of variety in the game. I played a whole lot of, uh, 2 and 3 on the NES. Mm -hmm. And at one point I did have the Super Nintendo game. I don't know what happened to that. Yeah. It's possible to tell. Yeah, um, so that's widely the opinion, that the home version is better than the arcade version. But the arcade version deserves to be appreciated because it's different. And the 3D graphics are even better. <laughs> they resized the graphics so good. Oh lord, is that true, Masami? There's more latency on the collection? How is that possible? I thought they had good oh, yeah, net play. The, the, uh, the collection's pretty rough. I actually own it and haven't even booted it once. Oof just because I know how rough it's going to be. And... Yeah, I like, wish it wasn't that way. I thought it was supposed to have, like, rollback or something. I guess not. Well, I mean, it it can have rollback, but then it's stacking it on a really, really laggy emulation. Yeah, that would do it. Watch out for, watch out for Krang. Oh, I forgot to change the game name. Let me just do that real quick. Like, you know, it's our last hurrah for the night, but may as well change it. May as well make sure yeah, you put stuff in order. Plus it shows up in the VODs. Yeah. It is interesting how this feels so different from 2 and 3. Like, for example, running and how that works. Pressing yeah. and holding in this. Do you have a favorite one of these? Uh, favorite one of these games? Yeah, yeah, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles beat em ups. I would say Shredder's Revenge. Is that cheating? Yeah. <laughs> uh, maybe. If, it kind of feels like when people are like, my favorite 2D Zelda is Metroid Dread, and it's like, yeah, okay, what was it more than one year ago? <laughs> <laughs> but it's always good when you get a situation like that where the latest entry in a franchise can be considered the best. Yeah, they they expanded so much on the gameplay in Shredder's Revenge that it's basically incomparable. But um, otherwise, I would say TMNT 2. Arcade? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is surprisingly hard to hit him properly like this. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, well. At least we're very in sync. <laughs> yeah. 
For better or worse. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, those attacks get you every time. Like, I mean that in the general sense, not you specifically. Right, yeah, of course. Come on, die already. The one thing that bothered me about, like, traditional Konami beat-em-ups like this is that a lot of the enemies are HP sponges. Right, yeah. They just got so much health, they take damage forever. And then you, like... You could compare the actual values and see that, like, with the full amount of players, they have a ludicrous amount of health. Thank you, Laconic Shock. Alley Cat Blues. And now onto the parts you don't remember at all. Yeah. I'm like, if it doesn't show up in this or the first, I don't know, 20 minutes of Hyperstone Ice. Hyperstone Heist is another interesting one. Yeah, that one's weird. I actually did not grow up with that at all. Um, so coming to that later, I'm like, whoa, this is a really different thing. Yeah, it's like a completely unique version, but it's also kind of still the same game, so it's like, what? Yeah. You know, the thing that I kind of wish more of the, like, weird Castlevanias were... Hmm, hmm. Like, you know, we have the Super NES version of uh, Dra uh, Rondo Blood. Oh god, Dracula. And that really does just try to be that. Yeah, I mean, I took the other one. But yeah, anytime somebody says Dracula X, I assume they're talking about the real one. Yeah, they, they should be, but they aren't. Right, right. I sure do not. Call... I do have fight games. Oh. But I wasn't really suggesting... thinking about it. Interested in Magical, magical Drop. Dro magical Drop is really cool. I would love to play <laughs> Yeah, of course I'm interested in Magical Drop. Are you sure? What do you mean? Are you sure you're interested in Magical Drop? <laughs> it's a... a pretty hardcore video game. I'm not sure you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> this is my top 100. <laughs> mm. uh. Dot putting a quarter on the stream. <laughs> yeah, I would love. To, I would love to. Like, I would. I would bow out so that way YouTube could play it first. Because, because uh, I I played a lot of that on my Neo Geo uh, when we got the uh, flash cart working mm -hmm. for that. Um, and I hit a point with it where I'm like, I really enjoy this. I'm not sure about the high-level play here, but I really enjoy this game. Yeah, like, Dot, do you mean, like, right now, or, like, after you finish eating, or whatever, or... I'm asking. Because I'm totally down to, like, pause here and <laughs> play a little, yeah, but... absolutely. If you, you know, yeah. if you're eating, we can do it after. Oh, tonight, tonight. Yes, okay. yes, yes. Ah, oh, so we can play Street Fighter 3. Third strike. <laughs> I'm so Fight bad Kate. at third strike. Fight Kate in my brain is just the third strike adapter for my computer. Man. <laughs> uh, do you uh, do you have an arcade fighting game that you prefer? I um, my favorite is Rage of the Dragons, but the ones I'm good at are like Garo and King of Fighters 2000. Ooh. King of Fighters 2000 is really good. It's underappreciated, I feel. A lot of people don't like the Strikers games much. It happened. I thought I was you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's some pretty significant differences between us. Yeah. For example, uh, these tiny blue bands and what color they are. <laughs> ow, oh, oh, ow, you're ow, talking about our turtles. Okay. Yes, yes. I don't know what you're talking about. We're both Columbo right now, right? <laughs> King of Fighters 2002 has the cutest of Phoenix outfit. Oh, hey, we're here in Hyperstone Heist. <laughs> my toes, my toes. My toes, my toes. <laughs> they have the same voice. They all have the same voice. And I think they're all Rob Paulson. At least they're 
coming in at a very Rob Paulson sounding register. His name was Robert Paulson. His name, his name. was Robert Paulson. <laughs> you know, maybe I am messing up his name. No, that was that was me making I'm a Fight Club reference. His last name in the movie, yeah. I'm trying to remember that guy. What was Bob's last name in the movie? I'm pretty sure that was. Oh my god. So the voice actor can't also be that, right? I'm not entirely sure. Oh my god, help. It's a time. Oh my god. <laughs> the Digibone is like, I thought Bob's name was Bob Video Games. I don't know, Bob seemed pretty unsure about what Bob's real name was. Yeah. <laughs> the latest chugging beliefs. So. <laughs> yeah, so apparently he's we're, Dan. We're not, we're not sure, Digi. Rob Paulson. Okay, there you go. That's the difference. Robert versus Rob. These xenomorphs, though. I like that they're banana color. Yeah. Now it's okay for kids. Exactly. That's how that works. And legally distinct. That was I'm scary. Dot, welcome back. To me. Welcome Rob, back. Rob Paulson is like my nemesis. Oh? Yeah. yeah. Do Boy, tell. He voices a whole bunch of characters I don't like, and whenever they're on screen, I'm like, I must have been this guy wasn't on screen. <laughs> so, so what characters? I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> you seem mad. Rob Paulson might be watching. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, I might be that famous. Come on, Sara. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. Oh god, I chose a really bad time to choose to sit up straight. <laughs> <laughs> you chose pizza time. Okay. Why do these all um, destroy and what hit they just blow up? So I did this bit for let's say let's say at a conservative estimate four years straight. Mm-hmm. Where any time a certain voice actor would come up, I would specifically refer to that guy who's done countless roles as cat from cat dog. <laughs> oh, that's that's so, great. I'm playing through the Kingdom Hearts games and Pete will come up on screen and I'll be like, oh, it's Cat from Cat Dog. <laughs> Did you both just call you out saying, Dan, you still do that? My patience is wearing thin. I'm banishing you to a time warp from which That's what I'm going to do to you, Digi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm banishing you to a time warp. Prehistoric Turtle Saurus. Prehistoric yeah, Turtle Saurus. Really Word box go and she have to get I yeah, she bowed out as well around the time you did. Like she stayed a little longer, but she wasn't up for another game. Yeah, I think I think she referenced food at some point. I think so. I'm not entirely yeah, sure, I did, but I think I so. I do definitely need to sit out and beat them up so I'm fine to just sit here and watch. Yeah, this this game is a real button masher. Like those that riders oh, and mystic yeah. warriors at least have some option for auto fire. <laughs> Oh, I didn't oh. know that. I was just matching some real fast. <laughs> yeah, in Mystic Warriors, you can always auto fire. In Sunset Riders, it's a power up for some reason. Hey, you got dark. Uh, I get the Super Nintendo one like just enough that this game looks like weirdly over animated. You know? I get uh -huh. you. Yeah. Like. In general, that's about where I'm coming from too. It looks like those anime clips where they interpolate it to CPS. Oh God, I hate that. that. So it looks it, they do that. Have you seen that? It looks yes. like the LSS three. Yeah. Oh Lord. <laughs> it's funny. I, I keep referring to DLSS three as TV soap opera modes, and uh, mm -hmm. on a recent big thing, Chris was like, "Damn, kids don't know what that is anymore. You have to say 60 frames per second anime." So. Do you want to hear my review of DLSS 3? Oh. Don't like. Smeary screen. Yeah. Yeah. For anyone in chat who's like, what the hell are they talking about? Um, NVIDIA yeah. invented a technology like TVs have for smoothing, but it does it at the GPU level for games. But it just creates a lot of garbage artifacts on screen. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the worst is like when you have a major screen transition, like the screen has just gone black or it's just 
going from black and like it has no idea what to do with that yeah like if you cut from inside of a car like say you're playing a racing game you cut to an inside a car from inside the car to a third person perspective it will literally just smear in a way that looks insane <laughs> yeah it's just making stuff up at like that point wiping the car off the screen with a rag or something. <laughs> yeah that's a good way of describing it actually <laughs> Yeah, I don't recognize this dude at all. Yeah, that's yeah, the most thing. Of my like, experiences with the SNES version too. Man, I just had a shower. Like, this, what is with that emphasis? <laughs> but yeah, like, there's so many differences between SNES Turtles in Time and Arcade Turtles in Time. A lot of people think, hey, that's the same game. There's some small differences. No, there's some pretty big ones. Most it people I know, I think, who are like really into beat em ups actually prefer this one, or the Super Nintendo one too. Yeah, the Super Nintendo one is usually better rated. This one gets kind of dull because you don't have many attacks to use and the game goes a little long. Uh -huh. But. Also, there's a Mud Man that takes a hit. <laughs> Nami's whole like, relationship with Hit Stop is a little, like, and Hit Stun is a little frustrating to me, honestly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, and like the, the way that you see people play these games, if they're trying to one CC them, it, it doesn't look that fun. There's a whole lot of like running away as soon as you hit once and everything. Thank you for the follow, Raztron. Skull and crossbones. Okay, super God is quiet. quiet. Okay. <laughs> God is super That's quiet. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Seems like she's just speaking quietly. Like earlier, she was louder. Yeah, I was. I was running my mouth. I had all kinds of stuff to say. Oh well, <laughs> we're talking in terms of actual volume here. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm trying to attack you. <laughs> but yeah. Like, this game got strangely split on consoles into the Super Nintendo version, which is kind of just a better expansion of this game that feels more complete, but has worse animation. And then Hyperstone Heist, which I don't know how to describe it. It's a very strange game compared. Yeah. But it's still related to the game. Like, it is based on this game. It is a port, sort of. It's, it's got stuff from the first, uh, the first one too, doesn't it? Yeah, I, yeah, think, I think so. so. That's why it feels so weird as somebody who played a lot of the second and third game growing up and I, I like a bit of Turtles of Time on SNES to only come to Hyperstone Heist when I was like 30 or something. I was so, like, what in the world? <laughs> Ow. My nose. Oh, he's saying nose. I thought he said toes. Oh, yeah, wait, because you, you stand. His face. Why okay. is he saying toes? Okay, well, now you get it. Yes. Pizza power! Every line in this game sounds like it's being delivered by someone who has earplugs up their nose. <laughs> what? That's very specific, but I can kind of hear it. Because it's not its not waxed over like... You, I think they... Do they? No. No, they don't. They, the, the wax plugs are just for years. For swimmers who, like, whatever. Mm. I used to work at a pharmacy. It's been a while since I... Work there. I don't know much about this stuff because I have um, I have a particular kind of deviated septum. I guess I would be able to swim if I could plug my nose like that, but I've never... I didn't bother looking huh. into it. I can't hold yeah, my breath underwater at all without anything, though. Somebody made, like, a creepypasta-style edit, I guess. You know, internet shit post, but also trying to be creepy, sort of thing. But it was a video edited where it was. What did they call that thing? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to remember. What is the fitness game on the Switch? My brain is leaving me right now. Ring Fit. Yeah. My brain kept going, We Fit. Anyways, 
They added in Ring Fit to have a warning screen that says you're having a heart attack and to calm down and to breathe calmly. Oh, dear. It has, like, ominous music and stuff, and I was like, oh, my God. There's Thank just you. something really believable about it. Sorry. Anyway. Thank you, Professor Bad Vibes, for the 500 bits. Anyway, yeah, that sounds really unnerving. Yeah, I don't know. There was just some part of me that was like, yeah, that's how I'm going to die. I'm going to see the heart attack screen on <laughs> It's going to become real, just so they can do that to you. Ow. It's like the, the, the only game over you could get that's real. Anyway, what I'm saying is I should exercise more so I don't have to be afraid of a potentially imaginary uh, heart attack screen on me. But what you're saying is, if you die in the game, you die in real life. Yes. Hyper-realistic like sweat when you play it. Sorry, I don't mean to keep interrupting you. No, 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 no. You're good. Oh, that's right. They shriek and they're like little babies. Yep. This is what's going to happen to Elon when enough people roast him on Twitter. He'll just drink. <laughs> He'll turn into a little puppy? He'll turn into a monkey. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. He'll just, he'll just shrink into a chimpanzee or something. Oh, like the the Mario movie? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Which I Very also had to watch for content recently. <laughs> I, think that's, uh, I think that's fun, honestly, that movie. It's like yeah. so weird. That Check out what so game we're weird. in. It could be anything. I, I don't know. This seems fully weird. <laughs> okay, this is hilarious. This is thrifty. This is, like, looking at this stage, I'm like, I feel like I'm watching a TikTok video where somebody's showing me how to save a ton of money. <laughs> like, yo, check this out. What if the turtles went to levels based on themes that our other game was based yeah. on? Yeah. Yeah, it even has the pink barrels and everything. And the music, like, it isn't it isn't a song from Sunset Riders, but it has a bunch of callbacks that are just subtle enough to say, yeah, that's legally distinct, but... Mm -hmm. huh. Yeah, thinking about it, though, I guess when it comes to, like... When it comes to beat-em-ups, mm -hmm. I feel like I like Streets of Rage 2 and Altered Beast more than I like most of the Turtles games. Yeah, Streets of Rage 2 was in my top 100. I don't yeah, think any other beat-em-up beat was. That's fair. Funny how the best beat-em-up is the one with the most stolen music. <laughs> no, as Fox was saying, that's a homo gay. <laughs> yeah, homo gay. Yeah. Also, thank you, Uncommon stuff. Soul. Man, I, I, so I finally hit Battle Network 3 uh, a couple days ago, and yep. I thought the, the, the weird translation problems and other stuff were bad before, but once you hit Battle Network 3, it's like, they'll end a sentence with a quotation mark, and then it'll just, that'll be it. There's no continuing text that made that make sense. Who's a present so for? <laughs> it goes to minus. <laughs> it really is that bad. It, yeah. It's kind of shocking. I'm like, this came out in like 2002, guys. This isn't. Hey, you should show your top 100 off again when you finish the game. Absolutely. Like, so, I yeah. mentioned it, and I was like, oh, yeah, actually, probably a lot of people here. Were there. Yeah, I'll definitely post it on Twitter after the stream, too. Twitter, a great place to post opinions. No comment. <laughs> but, um... I feel seasick. <laughs> what? I feel seasick. But we're on a train! I feel seasick. I got I it. something and I'm very oh, ill. Uh, this, actually, this oh crap, I should have given you that. Night. It's okay. Yeah? I had a tweet pop off recently and like notifications kept exploding, so I was like, mm -hmm. I'm just muting this. 
I wonder yeah. how far it went. <laughs> oh lord. Would you would you like to say what the tweet was? Because it's about a, a jumping normal in Guilty Gear XX. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 690 retweets. Oh, I don't know. It's, it, it's always the worst post that two numbers. <laughs> Man, it wasn't even about guard piss. Yeah, it wasn't. That guard piss went normal or went uh, viral on like two different accounts. Hmm. And then when I made my my current account, I was like, I should see if that can happen again. And I tried like five times. No one ever retweeted it. They're just like, that's gross. <laughs> hmm. I would ask, but I feel like. Maybe I should have. <laughs> I feel like I... Oh, I remember what I was going to say. When I was younger, I didn't like Battle Network 3 at all. I'm planning on revisiting it on stream because I feel like I will like it more now, and it's one of the most liked Battle Network games, but I think the translation really did it in for me back then. Understandable. Also, um, there are certain elements of it where it's a little bit too much like... Run here. Okay, now run all the way over here. Okay, now run all the way over here. Like, more so than basically most RPGs ever. Mm. It really does just want you to run to very similar spots all over the place repeatedly. And yeah, I enjoy it. But I yeah. can totally understand anyone being like, nope. Yeah, back then my favorite was two easily. But I also really liked five because I just thought liberation missions were the coolest thing. See, I actually have, before this collection came out, I had only played two. The thing about five is I liked the DS version, which of course they, <laughs> you know, it's not there. It was sort of the best combination of the two versions in some regards without truly combining them. And the music yeah. in the DS version was kind of neat. And if you put in the cartridge of any other Battle Network game, aside from six, of course, it would change the battle music to that. Huh. Like, you would have the Mega Man Battle Network 1 music in the DS version if That's you had Mega awesome. Man 1 in the GBA slot. Yeah. That's such Except, a cool feature. Yeah, it was a new rendition, though. Like, it had updated instruments just and everything. It was really so, cool. Hey, about that exact thing I was talking about earlier. <laughs> how cool it is to just have two games in a thing and it gives you bonus yeah, stuff based on that's the That's the thing, yeah. like, lock-on yeah. technology is a technology we really miss in every form, even the distant forms, like save bonuses. Yeah, part of me is wondering if there is something with these new consoles where they literally disallow checking the system for a save that isn't for the game you're in. I could see that. I could see Sony definitely doing that. They really need to warn you about these health power-ups. <laughs> nope. <laughs> hey, it's Mazinger Krang. Because he's got, like, a jet scrander. Whatever. Yeah, I was trying to... No, it's Salamence Krang. <laughs> this is all going over my head. Salamence is a Pokemon from 3rd gen. Oh, yeah. Whereas yeah. I was making a super robot reference to Mazinger Z. Yeah, I, I know about yeah. I like know the, what that is, but I the wings. Like, out of my mind. Yeah, the wings on the back of Krang are extremely similar to Mazinger Z's Jet Scrander. Okay, ma'am, I need you to calm down. <laughs> In this lineup, do you see the Mazinger Z? <laughs> <laughs> And then I like point to a Gundam or something. Oh no! <laughs> you point they, they to they take Jishar. away my nerd card, yeah. <laughs> Have you ever seen the uh, strat to deal with this guy in the Super Nintendo version? Mm. No. You just you do the the move where you jump and then kick really fast, and it's like a goofy looking like upward kick you know what i'm talking about yeah this and it just hits him like 19 times <laughs> you land and you do it again it's it's really reliable yeah it doesn't work that well in the arcade version no. i guess but <laughs> no it's it's not even hitting yeah <laughs> it hits him like once and then he hits us yeah and then he just smacks you <laughs> Cowabunga! 
But yeah, so far I'm really enjoying the Battle Network games, uh, which is good because I bought the both volumes Star together Race. for sixty dollars. No yeah, I got both. Am I still too. super quiet, guys? By the way. Huh? What's up? Oh, you seem fine oh, to me. I'm asking Chat. Am I? Yeah. If I'm still super quiet. Yeah, Chat will yeah, have I think to answer. You're good because you were quiet for me earlier too. So you're probably good for them. Chat. Modern Vintage Gamer is also having a birthday today. Oh lord. Why do I have so many people sharing know. a birthday with me? Like, Neo Zero, the RPG fan, Dr. Orochi. That's I'm crazy. Me? I made that up. <laughs> yeah, I was like, wait, what? <laughs> My birthday's in early June. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just wanted attention. I got jealous. <laughs> it's okay, we'll give you plenty of attention on your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> this is when someone in chat needs to go, you want attention? Do you want uppies? <laughs> shut up. Won't you shut up. Oh, Lord. <laughs> well, Dan's the one who wants uppies. Dan's the one who's jealous. He's projecting. Yeah. <laughs> As always. <laughs> chat, you guys should hear... You, you guys should give Dan uppies. Good luck. <laughs> Well, I mean, if there's enough of them, it'll be, it'll, it'll be workable. You got like a hundred people that's here. Like that, yeah. yeah. I, I would like to believe it won't take all one hundred. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have probably yeah. heard about like the the whole birthday statistical anomaly. It's it's interesting. No. Like. What is it? Like, if you have, like, ten people in a room, the odds of them having the same birthday are surprisingly high. Like, one of one pair of them. I've heard of this, yeah. I don't fully understand why it's like that, but it is. <laughs> 26. God, I'd take 26. <laughs> Yeah, Digi constantly makes these posts in chats of stop saying how old a game is, I feel so old, and then one day revealed they were 26, and I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> that, kind of, that kind of explains it, though, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, you're new to that phenomenon of things you remember, like, being <laughs> yeah. super old. You do get desensitized to that. You're like, oh, Dark Souls is like 10 years old? Yeah, that's not great. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie Wag saying, I just imagined Columbo doing the O oh, the whole oh you're so funny after oh, getting many Oh you're so funny. <laughs> you're so funny. You know, my my wife she likes a funny guy. No, I'm sorry, my Columbo voice is really bad. They can't all be my lick of tongue. <laughs> yeah. Froggy. Froggy? That one. Froggy, where are you, Froggy? I wish I could do a better Columbo. That'd be so convenient. Cause I really love Columbo. Nope. Ow. But yeah, Ow. I, I simply, I simply dodge roll, uh, ever feeling old by you know, every passing year, instead of feeling older, I just get angrier at God. Oh, so, okay. Like, you know, I don't have the space to feel old. But, but, <laughs> shoutouts to God for being such a great guy. <laughs> Can we get some shoutouts to God in chat? I, I <laughs> type slash Mom, shout out. Please. I, I type slash shout out Christ in my friend, <laughs> my friend's chat once, <laughs> not thinking about the pop up. That comes up. Oh man! Uh -huh. Join us in following Christ. <laughs> <laughs> the funniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Check out God. They were last playing no game. Hello. Like the stream title is Hello. <laughs> Join us in following God. <laughs> yeah. See. <laughs> and the stream overlay said God. Worth checking out. Because, you know, I've got I've got one of those things kind of like Fang where it pops up the avatar and <laughs> text. Yeah, every... it pops up the little deal. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so glad you don't have the one that picks a random clip. 
Oh yeah, that that would be I, horrible. Here's a, here's a clip God. of me making an extremely undignified voice or noise while playing uh, Mighty Final Fight. Also, also, there's one of my most viewed clips, so <laughs> those things love it. Uh -huh. There's also that really bad chance of you get raided by somebody whose clip is like extremely racist and somehow flew under the sensors, or things like that. Yeah. <laughs> and then you're the yeah. one who gets in trouble. I just, I really did. So I was playing the new Crash game, mm -hmm. and there was a tangent in chat. A tangent pointing out certain assets that the alternate universe Bandicoot has. Certain design choices they made there. What do you mean? So, <laughs> this evolved into me doing an Alex Jones voice. Oh, no. Oh. Talking about how I can see what they did there. They're not tricking me. Hell and shot. I played once when I uh, raided a friend, and I was like, oh, I'm not a fan of this system anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Admittedly, my Alex Jones is pretty spot on, but oh, you get good. none that, of the context. That makes it even worse. Exactly. Yeah, that's, that's it. That makes it worse. Hey, Gigaboots, thanks for raiding. Let's just play this clip. Oh, oh. <laughs> and that... they knew me. <laughs> but still. Oh. Good thing they did. Otherwise, it'd be what they know you for forever. Oh, hey, Lady Liberty. Oh, hey, Shredder. Ow. <laughs> it looked like you were laughing. I know. I don't know why I was laughing at him. Dude, he's got a lightsaber in this. Does he have that in the SNES? I don't remember that. No, I don't remember, remember either. That. Does he get really big in this version like he does in 3? Yeah, Professor Bad Vibes, that's actually my one complaint about Shredder's Revenge is that it's so long. Which is fine if you're playing in story mode because you can take a break, but if you're like playing in classic mode, ooh. I'm a broken freak. If I'm gonna play a game, I'm, I'm basic. So I'm that ADHD meme turned to 11, where it's like if I have something to do today, I can't function. <laughs> which means the only time I play video games is when I'm ready to sit down for eight hours, basically. Yeah. I, I totally feel you, Dan. I really do. I don't play video games by myself much, even, like, aside from when I'm streaming. But, um... The thing is, like, when you're playing a game like that... Oh, gosh. Um... <laughs> you just got many turtle. Um, anyway, um... When you're playing a game like that, you're probably playing it with other people, and they are probably not as focused as you are. True. True. It launch day is different from... You know. Yeah. Like, I played Shredder's Revenge a bit back with um, a couple of my friends, and, like, it seemed like it just took too long for a game that I was dragging two people along with, you know? <laughs> I get that. I think uh, Dragon's ah. Crown worked around this in a, a pretty interesting way, which, like, as a beat em up, I'm not sure I'm, like, a huge Dragon's Crown fan. It's a good game. That one? Yeah, I have. Oh, it, it's a great game. Uh, but, like, an individual, like, story chapter is about the length of a normal beat on credit. Mm -hmm. That's that's how I like games like this to be, you know? If they don't have the guts to just make them beat em up length. Uh, Thank you, PR Rosa, yeah, for actually, following. I love Our Dragon's Crown. Um, have overcome the arc villain Shredder. Yeah, I consider that the best game of seventh generation. Uh, <laughs> it's a good game, it's why. It's, it's oh. a really great game. Uh, I played the Vita version while watching Initial D. It was a really great week. <laughs> Man, that is, that is a weird final battle. Yeah. I thought the final battle in Shredder's Revenge was uh, unclimactic. That was way better. <laughs> yeah, like... Arcade Turtles in Time is weird, right? Yeah, especially that face Raph is making right now. Yeah, I mean, it's not a bad game. Man, what's going on with his teeth? I don't know. It looks like he's mocking someone. Like, he's not scared right now. He's like, this is how you look. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, 
this isn't a bad game, but like a lot of the appeal is just in like the visual design of everything and the music. The actual the gameplay is frames per second anime. True, true, true. <laughs> but like the gameplay is not so great. We know where I'm going. If if the latency will let me. There is a slight lag on this for some reason. Like the name entry specifically. I couldn't tell you why. <laughs> It's just too optimal. That's the problem. Clearly. Where is... Yep. Let me... <laughs> yeah, Mr. J, it's like a remake or a spin-off or something. Yeah, Hyperstone Heist is weird because, like, it's sort of a port and it's not. It's hard to explain. Thank you, Blasticator. <laughs> uh, the I don't know if you're expecting this, but the old Parsec links don't work for me. Oh, you you want? Okay. I wasn't well, sure since Parsec or should, we could just play Magical Drop if you wanted to do that. Yeah, that's yeah. what I thought we were doing. Like, okay, yeah. Otherwise, I'm pretty much done here. So Magical Drop is good. How? Uh, how do you want to? What do you mean? I'm already actually in the fight cave room. But actually, let me set my button because I forgot to do that. Oh god. I can make a private lobby. You can make private fight cave lobbies? Some people can. What? So I will make a private lobby. Also, thank you for subscribing, Rich Crisp. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for the happy birthday. Man, I gotta oh, I tell you. I gotta tell you, historically, my birthdays have been bad days that I dreaded because, like, for some reason, it was like a curse, everything would go wrong. This has been one of the best birthdays I've ever had in my life. Hell yeah, thank you for, for having us. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys. Um, are we doing FC2 or FC1? Always FC2. Yeah. I don't know the difference. Would you like to tell me? FC2 is newer and better. FC1 is old and busted and just works on some old computers better is all. Okay. Oh, it's versions of Fight Cave? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Okay. okay, so you know how sometimes cats swat at, like, screens that they see stuff on? Yeah. I feel like I just did that because I tried to click your fightcade window and drag <laughs> it back to the correct monitor. Also, there is another piece of art. Dragon Cat Man. Holy cow. Unimaginable the amount you've been doing. Special. Like, this is the fourth pick from Dragon Cat Man today. It is me as April O'Neil. <laughs> you know, I didn't say anything the other time, so I have to this time. Oh, man, you must have such terrible back problems. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Um, what the, there's I another. I, do, so. I literally just looked at Discord again, and there was another piece of art <laughs> from another <laughs> artist. Holy cow, dude. I used Amazing. to think I could do a really good Plinket voice stand, but it turned out that my microphone was doing all that. <laughs> so oh. I tried it on a different mic and it didn't sound anything like it. I went, oh, well, that's not very fun. <laughs> what, what was the mic? It was like a, a laptop mic. <laughs> I would like get up, get really close to it and like kind of puff my cheeks out and be like, things don't make sense. <laughs> it sounded like it on the, the laptop. <laughs> so... That's really good. <laughs> Thank you very much, Ride Wings. And oh gosh, there's a sketch too. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you got so much art today. Yeah, it, <laughs> I, I'm completely overwhelmed. Like, part of me kind of wants to cry. <laughs> Not in a bad way, but here's the sketch for Ride Wings. 
Like, both of these are so beautiful, thank you! <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so... I... All this on the way to post the, uh... The private lobby. Put that in the search box in Fightcade. Okay. Hmm? What? Uh, put this in the search box and fight Kate. Uh, look at oh, the okay. Got it. the private voice chat. Yeah. I see. It says maximum concurrent amount of channels reached. Oh, you you should. Channel. Yeah, you have oh, to leave one. Okay. Womp womp. Uh, goodbye, King Fighters 2002. You're, like, good at this, right? Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> and it was my idea, too. <laughs> Do you know the tournament rules? Yeah, same character. Yeah. You know who they start with? No. Magician. Do you want to start with him? I hate his voice. Long window. Let me see. Why is this... Sorry, I just need to make sure that it captures the correct here. Yeah, yeah. I understand. And I need to adjust the sound. Cuidado. Okay, Cuidado. That'll have to do. I don't want to play fool thing. <laughs> Can I just defeat you as oh, fool? Oh, yeah. first to do, though. It's going to kick me out. Oh, whatever. It's not my birthday. <laughs> that works. I took matters into my own hands. <laughs> Definitely not on purpose, by the way. Yeah, I wouldn't suggest doing that in real life. No, I mean, I mean, like, I was, I was trying to like actually play. I like moved the cursor too far or something. Who do you want? You pick. Um, star. Lava lava this. Crap, bad starting layout, but that's okay. Yeah, this. Uh-oh. Okay, that's... Uh-oh. <laughs> Quota. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Tara Thiel. <laughs> it's not like I'm lying. It's what she is. I keep really making small time. mistakes to myself. I swear, like... I sh okay, I'm not making excuses, all right? I'm okay. Just <laughs> There's uh -huh. something up with the PS5 controller, I swear. Like, I, I don't make this many execution errors on any other controller. Well, have you considered overclocking it to 8,000 kilohertz? Oh my god, is that it? Uh, no, probably not, honestly, but... I do. I have done that in the past, so it's a freaking awesome feeling. But yeah, I don't doubt that there's something going on.
Oh my god, this drop pattern is really annoying. I've yeah. never, I don't think I've ever played Star before. I play her in arcade mode a lot. Get to moon pretty much every time. Yeah, I usually get pretty far in the game. I don't think I've ever one CC'd it because this game is like notoriously difficult to one CC. It is? Yes, yeah, because of Black Hero. Hmm. So I have memories of one CC in this game. And based on what I've heard about it, I feel like I might be thinking of the console versions or something. Console version's definitely a lot different. Oh no. Control better and everything. The Neo Geo one is constantly dropping inputs and stuff. Yeah, you can kind of adjust to it, but like it's something you have to spend a lot of time with it to adjust to, in my opinion. Yeah, yeah Vox, I uh, I don't think the dual sense in the way like its size and the angle of the D-pad is like ideal for D-pad stuff either, which is why I like, agree. Yes, I bought a Dual Shock Four because I think I'm already dead. Um, my original DualShock 4 was a version 1, which actually has higher input latency. They actually improved the input latency in the controller halfway through the gen. Oh, shit. Uh, so. I... How do you deal with this? This this drop pattern is nuts. <laughs> I guess I'm, I'm just not used laughing to at you. I'm just seeing it, too, and it looks you like should, a nightmare. Like, there's a lot of shoveling stuff out of the way with this pattern. It's true. Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm looking at it. It's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Playing games where I have to hit R1 a lot will really give you bad pain. Really? I For me, it's always that the D-pad's not uh -oh. at a super great angle and that it kind of squeaks, almost. Let me, let me ah, this. quota. <laughs> so it's pretty close. Yeah, it's it's pretty close every time it seems. <laughs> I keep getting quoted out. Okay, you pick. <laughs> I figured. This character sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. She's so uh, weak. Yes, Zelda, you can actually use a DualShock 4 on your PS5 for PS4 games. They just stop you from using it on PS5 games because for every smart idea Sony has, they have to have two bad ones. It's basically arbitrary, just to, you know... So they can use some excuses, like... I shouldn't like, be talking while I'm doing this. Yeah, I know, I, I, I feel bad, because I'm like, I don't want to talk to either of you and distract you, because I see how high level the play is here. I don't care, this is birthday. Um... But yeah, it, like, if they Oops. want to sit there and be like, the well, one. it would... It would give the the PS the DualShock 4 player an advantage to not have the haptic feedback, and it's like, okay, then why are they doing the hap the adaptive triggers rather in a way that's impeding my ability to play the game? Like, in, if there is a situation where the DualShock 4 is an advantage, then they made the game wrong. So there really isn't much of a excuse. Yeah, well. The only plausible excuse, and I don't mean that uh -huh. it's a good excuse, is third-party right. controllers. And the fact I mean, that yeah, they can they communicate just... as DualShock 4 convincingly in many cases. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, they, they were absolutely just uh -oh. doing that to... One moment, I just saw something. I'm toast. Oh, my God. I had a dropped input. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was, was sure that I was dead there. Heart. It uh, it was like I had a, a red match on the right side of the screen. Mm -hmm. And if I dropped it one column to the left, I died. And Thank then dropped the right input. <laughs> Thank you, Bubble Roxy, for subscribing. <laughs> oh, I guess man. Kosh is probably watching. She actually drew you some art on Twitter. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Sorry to distract. It's hey, completely you? okay. Thank you, Digital Basic, for rating. Oh, oh that is... Basic. this is this is lovely. I am going to show it on stream. I must. Oops. <laughs>
Uh... Also, hello everyone, hello. I'm Sarah Lenny, the magical cat girl who has her birthday today. It's a magical birthday. Magical <laughs> birthday. And here we have some lovely art by Tosh. It's very nice. Thank you so much, Tosh, if you're watching. Thank you. So, who has next? Like, who's up uh, next? You can, you can yeah, mulch you do, me you if you want. <laughs> mulch I'm you? I'm okay with that. <laughs> yeah. Well, you I, have to I, set, you have to set yourself as ready, then. Sorry, I do this so seldomly. Um, how do I do that? It's uh, your status. Click on your icon in the bottom left and click on mine. Bottom left. Okay, got it. One moment. Boop. Okay. And now I challenge you. Oh my god. <laughs> that volume mixer in Windows. One moment. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like the stream. Yeah. Oops. Okay, pick any Ooh. character you want. Hopefully my controller and stuff is all good. Hopefully. Oh my god. It's no, not? because I haven't played Magical Drop on Fightcade. Okay, okay. Then why don't you? Yeah. Uh, let's I'll let's drop out and you go to can... you go to test yeah, game. If you yeah. have a test game, it'll. Okay. Yeah. You guys I'm going to challenge you to one game. Okay. Yeah. We should play a uh, strength, <laughs> so we just have no fun, and it's over really fast. <laughs> <laughs> I. I popped up on Digi's stream momentarily. Oh, was was Digi playing East 2 and finishing it or something? Was I in the credits? Is that it? Uh-oh. Oh, I'm on this side. Okay. I'm not used to being on the right. Um, yes, that confused me too. <laughs> I got fried because of that. Congrats, yeah. Digi, on finishing East 2. Congrats, congrats, congrats. I hope you've had a lovely night. Oh, I'm on the right, 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 right. Isn't it funny that I almost immediately fell for the same thing again? I still <laughs> lost, but... I did it too. I looked at the other side and I went, huh? My cursor's not moving. Pattern, this drop pattern is so annoying. Would you believe strength is top tier? <laughs> kind of. I'm just kind of surprised Star is so low tier because her drop pattern seems to confound people. Yeah. Uh, the thing is, you can at least play around it. This is just like the like even odd <laughs> pattern is is too much. Oops. Do you know how like the damage system works? Not too clearly. Yeah. So. Pick strength again. Do do what I was doing to me, and you'll <laughs> it'll probably go differently. So you stop at two hits. Rather right, than changing right. full board, you just keep doing twos over and over again. Ah, uh, uh, like that. Especially with characters like this, it's so annoying. I can see how that would be. Oh my god, I did not mean to chain the whole screen. You're like, try this, it'll work. And then you, <laughs> then you start and then changing I did the opposite. Streams. Yeah. By mistake. You did the so, opposite like, of what you told me. There's reasoning behind it, though. <laughs> it's the most, like, bubble efficient way to send garbage. So, if all you care about is sending as much as you can, you don't want to do long combos. I think it also depends partially on the characters, though, because the part of the drop pattern that you get would depend on how long your combo is. So, like, it also is just mathematically, you send more bubbles per broken bubble if you play that way. Oh, I believe you. I'm just pondering because, like, in games like these, Oops. you generally get just a part of the pattern when you do a mm -hmm. simp when you do simple attacks over and over again. So right. that part of the Which, pattern will keep dropping. Yay! This like three-pronged drop pattern is especially annoying for that reason. Whoops. 
When I think about this game, I often feel like, oh, this game is just a sorting algorithm. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Like, I know it's a funny way of looking at it, but it's not wrong. It's 100% true, yeah. <laughs> Man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! <laughs> but hey, it, at least it's not Father Strength, right? I know you don't like Father Strength. I hate his voice. I don't like Kid Strength's voice either, though. Have a good I night, bless though. her heart. I know she can't help it. She's a kid, but... What are we even supposed to do? See? Yeah. <laughs> I was playing somewhat normally, but... Okay, so Laconic Shock, the thing with Magical Drop is... Well, Magical Drop 3 especially, is that the characters are so poorly balanced that you can really only play if you're playing mirror matches, otherwise it's completely unfair. If I Kate's smart enough to, if I only set inputs for player one to flip yes. me to yeah. do. Okay. Yeah. That's what I remember, just thought I would check. Oh my god. It's over. No, it's not. It's over, Anakin. Whoop. I have the high drop. It was over. You were my brother, Anakin. I dropped oh you. Oh my god, I picked the wrong row. <laughs> I was trying to break the yellows and I just threw two reds on top of him. You won't believe what happened next. <laughs> well, you were there, actually. Number three may surprise you. Honestly, when I'm doing an arcade run, she is usually the make it or break it moment for me. Believe it or not. Who is? <laughs> justice? No, justice isn't this isn't justice. Justice has a sword. Yeah, that's what I that's what I meant. I never get them right. This is judgment then, right? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody played are the. You, are you ready, Dan? Uh, yeah, I'm good. Okay, cool. And now I will reset myself to. I forgot to change the stream title again. I think people, I think people will be okay with it. Twitch is gonna ban you. <laughs> this isn't that game. What are you talking about? I'm pulling this stream over. <laughs> You're grounded. I'm so doomed. Probably. But, you know, <laughs> it's okay. Just do your best. Die, monster. You don't belong in this world. Oh, <laughs> harsh words. I'm sorry. I have to play as new grounds. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'm on the right. Got it. Yeah, you can tell by the place the names are on at worst. Ame. Cuidado. Hmm. Yoi. Start. Ame. 
What am I doing? That's completely wrong. Ah. Thank you, Stealthy Golem, for the follow. Oh, hey, Stealthy Golem. <laughs> no, don't skip her victory animation, people say. So sorry, sorry, <laughs> sorry. So, you I guys want to... understand, wanna... I'm sorry. You guys want to know something interesting. I am two follows away from 1.5k now. I looked over at the dashboard, I'm like, wait, that number is a lot higher now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've been really happy seeing regulars come in here tonight. <laughs> Thank you, HR Blanks, for the follow. <laughs> that puts me one away. <laughs> His voice is This is my least favorite voice actor. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> you know who this is, right? This is a famous, very famous voice actor. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yes, this is the guy that plays Dio in the David Productions JoJo. Really? Yep. If you listen, you can hear it. <laughs> Assuming you've got the Japanese voices and not the like cuidado, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it like, it, it gives the voice in that. I'm pretty sure it gives the Japanese. So there's a funny story there that somehow a lot of people don't understand. Um, you see, there's three versions of magical mouth. There's the European, there's the North American, and there's the Japanese. Now, in one of them, you only get the cuidado voice, but there are actually an entire set of European voices. And they're only used in the Europe ROM. No kidding. And the Cuidado one, for some reason, is what's used in the North American one. Like, when the BIOS is set to North America. Uh -huh. Like, that's wild, right? Thank you, Stealthy yeah. Golems, for subscribing! Thank you so much, Stealthy Golem. Seems like my thank yous are a little more subdued when I'm playing Magical Drop. <laughs> like I'm multitasking, but... <laughs> at what cost? It's okay, you have plenty of attention span to do that and beat me. <laughs> Wait, now you're onto something. We need to play this with an instant run- or an- uh, what are they called? An endless runner running in the, uh... <laughs> In the corner, and like <laughs> audio from a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Maximum distraction mode. It'll teach you not to be distracted, surely, or drive you insane. Whichever comes first. That is such a weird like phenomenon. I wasn't even really aware of this until recently because I don't use TikTok, so I've never heard of this. They call it sludge video thing. Sludge. Sludge. I guess because it's weighing you down in so many things. Yeah, I think it's just because like they, there's no effort, and you just pour a bunch of video like <laughs> clips into the meat grinder and let it run itself, and some sludge comes out. Yeah, that makes sense. It's like the McDonald's the McDonald's thing. Yeah. <laughs> Of videos. I'm glad they have a word for it because my god, I uh, only somewhat recently started checking out TikTok and I'm like, oh man, the site's cool except for when it's an absolute alien nightmare. Right? Uh, <laughs> you are a lot yeah, better than you give yourself credit for, Dan. Yeah, eh. you're good. <laughs> eh. Like, seriously, I was... The way you were talking, I was expecting to just completely roll you, like you had no idea just what you were doing. Just play a single player game. <laughs> like, it turned out you, you were pretty good. Eh, thank you. 
I mean it, go. just so you know. Want to do something weird, like playing as Moon? Yeah, sure. That was pure skill! Yeah, I wasn't 100% sure. <laughs> I spill my drink! Like, it's so uncommon to play as the bosses, so... <laughs> so unfortunately, it's not playing her theme. It always plays the same damn thing for versus matches. It's a yeah, big I maze! Got so sad. It contrasts so heavily against a game like, you know, Pendle Day Pong. Man, that's a good game. Yeah, yep, it is. I love it. I love Pendle Day Pong. I can't remember if Magical Drop or Panel Dip One was higher, but they're both on my list. Yes, they are. I can't remember which one is higher either. I think um, the second column had Panel Dip One. I don't remember where Magical Drop 3 was. The Magical Drop 3 is probably higher. But where does Tetrisphere land? <laughs> it has been so long since I played Tetrisphere that I, I can't judge I it. I haven't thought about Tetrisphere in a long time. <laughs> Tetrisphere was like new the last time I... <laughs> was even cognizant of it, you know what I mean? Understandable. Yeah. What's your attack pattern? It's really confusing. It Is it seems. just like the, the opposite sides, like most of the bosses? I think so. Um, I hate that pattern. Fox says she wants the I, uh, Dot versus Dan panel day pawn match. <laughs> I'm up for it whenever, because that's literally one of my favorite puzzles. Uh-oh. Yeah, I do it. I don't have a lot of, like, confidence in my Pony Pony ability, though, so you might not get your hopes up for, like, a challenge. <laughs> eh. You're probably underselling yourself. Yeah, that's easy to do. It's all streamers constantly undersell themselves. It's what we do. Well, or just some of us, like me, <laughs> do the opposite. Where I'm like, yeah, I'm awesome at this. I've gotten, like, eight deathless runs of this game. Watch, I'll show you, and then I like immediately have to reset. Just don't worry about that part. <laughs> <laughs> you should continue. Yeah, you should hit the continue button. I'm, I'm trying. Oh. Did you set the coin? Well, I just put in coins, and it's not. Oh, maybe I have to. Hang on. Okay, maybe once the game starts, you can join in. If it makes us. Yeah, useful. I think it's. I think it's that. Don't make us use fool. Thank you, Stealthy Golem, for the birthday wishes. Oh, that's good. All right, who do you want to pick? Um, Justice. Hell yeah. <laughs> Sorry, what are your money puzzle exchanger thoughts? Oh no, I <laughs> like that game a lot, but it is like trying to learn an alien language. Because I already have enough trouble with math at all, let alone that kind of high-level lateral thinking with math involved. No! I hit the drop button, I promise you. I'm dead. It happens. Maybe there's hope. Alright, we're good. Well, for the time being. So anyways, when you start doing the weekly claymate speedruns. Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I, okay, I actually liked that game, honestly. Yeah, I was, I was there for uh, everything past the first two hours, I think. I was just kind of quiet. I felt bad because uh, you got to one of the overworld puzzles and you're like, Okay, chat, uh, you're allowed to give me hints now. And I'm like making a sandwich in the other room. And I'm like, shit. <laughs> This overworld puzzle is so weird. Yeah. Oops. Man, I've never played that game. You guys gotta tell me more about what you're talking about here. So, uh. like, <laughs> Playmates is a, a platformer where you can build up way more speed than you control, can control. Okay. It's it's what every then journalist says like describes Sonic the Hedgehog as, but it's actually that. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, you start uh. as a basic blob, and your only attack is to make a fist appear out of the front of you. <laughs> but you can find other types of clay and become your claymates, which are a cat, a bird, 
Uh, what was it a head? No, it was a wood. Like a chipmunk no, or something, right? Chipmunk, or yeah. Uh oh. Oh, I should not have done that. Yeah, I uh -oh. wasn't even there for a part where uh, Dot was playing as the fish. And it's been so long since I played that game to the extent that I get the fish that I can't even visualize it. That is unfortunate. I think. They have traversal abilities that are very dependent on what the level throws at you. But since they know, like... You won't always be able to get that because if you take one hit, you lose the cat form. Uh, they don't really build the levels out in a way that are interesting. Yeah, and that's, that's the game for, for sure. Yeah. Dang, that was a close quota. Yeah, that was pretty close. <laughs> you were at nine. Yeah. Got this uh, uh, sucks, huh? I don't know. She's got a sword. <laughs> and scales. Uh, but yeah, Dot, she basically hit the uh, nail on the head at the end of the stream when she said just that. And I'm like, yeah, that, that is the problem. Every level needs to be designed for you to just sort of roll through it as the blob. <laughs> Which doesn't mean it's easy. Oh my god, that game would be better if it wasn't so fucking hard. <laughs> Frankly. Mm -hmm. yeah. Man, like, it is I rare like for you to say that. that. Yeah, I... For the record, I grew up with that game, but it was at like one of my parents' house, so there's a good 15-year gap of me playing it. But yeah, it is a weirdly, really hard game, and I'm surprised I got as far as I did as a kid. I didn't beat it, though. I, I really didn't try to beat video games back then. Yeah, I never really conceived of beating video games as like the point when I was a kid, you know? I was, just, I was just way too impatient to beat video games myself, so I was like a heavy game shark or game genie user, believe it or not. Like, it wouldn't take me oh, that. Too, yeah. Like, I don't think you would expect yeah. that from me at all, right? But it, no. it is how it was. I mean, I, I'm not surprised to hear that because I remember gaming back then, and like, it was not uncommon to use those. Yeah, they were I mean... Popular products. We grew up in an era where devs, uh, either originally or when they brought it over, would make the game's difficulty unhinged on purpose. It's not like, at some point it stopped being a challenge and started being obstinate. Yeah, like, Ooh. my first experience with, like, that stuff is one of my friends had Punch-Out! and also had a Game Genie. I, like, I... You know, I saw them playing Punch Out with the Game Genie, and I'm like, wow, this is really something. And so I had to get a Game Genie. Yeah. And so that's how I got yeah, into the cheating the culture. Yeah, yeah. Like, not only could you, like, <laughs> that's see how they part of the you. game that you weren't going to get to on your own, but you could do, like, really cool stuff, too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, all the me. Mario 1 codes that completely changed the game. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, for me, I got my first one with the Super Nintendo, and it was the same thing of just like, oh, I can jump and just never fall in Mario World, <laughs> and that's cool. Vox says she used the Game Genie to change the color of her blast in Mega Man X. <laughs> so, one of the things I did is I made myself invincible in Lufia 1, and early on, there's a boss fight you can't beat, and I just stayed there for, like, <laughs> hours, stubbornly, Depend, you know, I wanted to beat that <laughs> boss, and like, <laughs> that's really Techni good. Technically, you eventually <laughs> can, but then it doesn't really. The game doesn't know what to do with that. Right. <sighs> Does it not just continue as though you lost? If I remember correctly, it just locked up. Oh. <laughs> like after the battle was over. Frodo, are you okay in there? Honestly, GBA yeah. Breath of Fire wouldn't be bad if it didn't look so washed out. <laughs> like, that's that's a problem with a lot of GBA games. Yep. The Battle Network collection keeps making me think of Breath of Fire 1 and I 2. I spill and my drink! Those translations were. Breath of Fire 1 was a Woolsey translation, actually. 
Yeah, I always think of two because that's the one I played more. Yeah, two had it. Two is the one that's completely unreadable. It's disastrous. Jump in the toilet? Yes? No? (laughs) 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 Yeah, Breath of Fire 2 was was pretty wild in that regard. Like, the fan translation is obviously way better, but it's so memorable how bad... The translation is, yes, it's accurate, but also it's not something you would write when translating a game normally, right? Just jump in the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh my god, I hit the mic. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I, I gotta stop playing video games because my thumbs are kind of bothering me. That's totally fine. I um, got, and I gotta save those for Super Ghouls and Ghosts tomorrow. Yeah, I I hope that'll go well. Dan, you want to do one more set and then we can call it quits. Yeah, sounds good. (laughs) Oh my God, JC, I hit the mic. (laughs) You hit the mic. (laughs) Pick whoever you like. That took a while. Hard decision. (laughs) I mean, I could see how you made that decision. We all know. It's purple. Yeah, obviously. I mean, we we all know. I'm interested in this. (laughs) I'm interested in this. That was a good one. I can't deal with this drop pattern where it's just all on one side of the board. I get overwhelmed so fast. (laughs) I'm sorry, Chad. Am I skipping the win animation too fast? It's just how I am when I play. Game. Understandable. Like next, one. next one. Next one. Not that horn sounds like the Resident Evil director's cut horn. Is that what it is? Yes, it is. Um, okay. Thought. How do you feel about Landmaker? You ever play that? Not familiar. You should play that game. It's a puzzle game, except you are putting together houses, but it also is still this kind of puzzle game. (laughs) And it is really neat, and I think you should try it. (laughs) Please. (laughs) (laughs) I started our review for the Resident Evil Netflix uh, series with that. (laughs) That's good. That's good. People yeah. Like, okay, now I know what to expect coming. Yeah, so my Biorand run gave that song to like so many rooms. So it became an instant meme. Oh boy, this is going to be interesting. Oh, fool is so stressful. Because you can't kill. <laughs> Bull's pattern is just a complete. Uh, it's just complete nonsense, but in a very simple way, so you can just do ridiculous things. Oh crap. Like that. I shouldn't have been able to come yeah. back from that, but I did. That's fool. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, you have like the same board at the end of round one. <laughs> uh-huh. Oops. Is that what chaos control is? There was a time in my life where this was basically the only game I played. I only found this game two years ago. The thing is, like, I was playing almost exclusively arcade mode, so I never got completely used to fighting 
other people, but at the same time, it's not actually that much different. Yeah. Just the quota is the main thing that you won't be as aware of if you're an arcade only player. Because the quota doesn't come up very often in arcade mode. Maybe Even not on level play arcade mode, I lose on quota all the time. Even on level 8, I didn't run into it much, I guess. Na 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 everyone's favorite sound. Oh yeah, his voice is the same in the US version. Yep. If, if memory serves, he's like the only Japanese voice they can touch. Yep, that is Probably accurate. They didn't like recognize. <laughs> yeah, they couldn't figure out what was going on there, I think. <laughs> Damn, and they're like, uh, well, it's already nonsense, leave it. Vox is like, you know what would be cool? If this character was deleted from the game. Oh, <laughs> oh man. I saw this in your top 100 and I was like, I have to play this. Oh, yeah. I mean, I should your top 100 off after TMNT. Oh, yeah, I'm right. definitely going to do it. No, 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 no. still here. <laughs> like, um. <laughs> words. I don't like words. I've been, I've been, I've been trying to get you to play this with me before, but we just never got around to it. I'm glad no, I was, yeah. I'm glad that I was able to motivate you with my list. <laughs> Mostly, you reminded me that the game exists. I was like, oh yeah, you play the game all the time. I do, but uh, I have it. A... Understandable. Yeah, I have a brain. It's hard to. I I have a brain too, a brain and too. it sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> it's some, yeah. Sometimes I don't think that the correct like, functionality is there. <laughs> that is a suboptimal brain. No, 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 no! I don't like this. I do not like this. I am in this image, and I do not like this. Oh my god. Get it together. You can do it, Dan. Oh. Oh. That was close. <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> That's a good one to end it on. <laughs> Indeed. Let me let me pull up the top one hundred. Hell yeah. I, I think don't... Laconic Shock went to bed, but <laughs> My layout is a bit of a mess because, like, I was, I was doing this and like, I was doing this right up to the wire because I had so many other things to do, and making the actual image ended up being my bottom priority. So it actually uh -huh. turned out way better than it could have, considering that because I made this in like <laughs> the last half hour before the stream. <laughs> I see your highest rated Final Fantasy is five. Yeah. Um. Have you played the Pixel Remaster, and do you have thoughts? I have not played the Pixel Remaster. I've seen the Pixel Remaster. I think that any of the Pixel Remasters taken on their own, like in a vacuum, are good. But the thing is that, uh, first of all, all the games using the same spe spell animations is just really unfortunate. Yeah. And then there's oh, the fact that... I didn't that, know about that. Yeah, and then there's the fact that... Um, you know, five and six at four, they all look kind of washed out because of the fact that they were based on the GBA graphics for some oh. reason. Like, they are that color. And that's the reason they don't look as good. If the colors were corrected, I think that people would look on them more favorably in terms of the sprites. The battle scripting is totally broken, though. There's no yeah. getting around that. Yeah. I, I hope that they'll like patch more of that stuff up. Maybe the, the switch versions don't have like FF three bosses using quake two turns in a row and you can't survive it. Yeah. You should, you should play final fantasy two.
I, I, I honestly, I'm a big Final Fantasy II fan. You should play that one. Oh, I am aware. Because <laughs> <laughs> I never shut up about it. <laughs> well, I I, uh, I saw, I, I've watched Roto play Final Fantasy II. Like, I, I, I played it vicariously through him. Yeah, yeah. That's, it's my favorite, except for the, like half of them, but hey, it's still good. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's definitely a good game. I think people have like underrated it, but it's also understandable because there's that whole situation of it being one of the ones that we didn't get back in the day. And like in later marketing, it was always, it was always bundled with the first one. And like, if you're just getting into the series and you buy a bundle that has the first game and the second game, you're going to play the first game and maybe you'll get around to the second game if you beat the first game. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. The game on my list here that I think everyone should play because it's easy for them to access and it's a good game that almost anyone would enjoy is number 11, Treasure the Rudras. Hell yeah. That's the one where you can like make spells, right? Yep. And it's the one with three different characters whose stories are happening in parallel and you can switch between them whenever you please. So this may please you. Uh, mm -hmm. I know literally nothing about this game. What's its genre? What did it launch on originally? Treasure of the Rudras is a Super Nintendo game from late in Square's history. The graphics look a lot like Final Fantasy VI, except basically all of the enemies, and I mean all of them, not just the bosses, are completely animated, despite still being the huge size that you would expect enemies to be in a Final Fantasy VI, like, you know, That's something nuts. that looks like that. On top of that... You do not learn spells. You instead enter text to create spells. So you can oh, make a spell called okay. Voxandra if you want. It'll work. <laughs> and the setting is a post-apocalyptic world that is pretty well done. And the characters are pretty interesting. Like, like I said, there are three characters, and their stories are all taking place over the course of the days leading up to Armageddon, basically. And... So you can change characters anytime by resetting the game. They all have save data, like it's all saved together. And, you know, you can proceed in whatever order you want. You can do one of the stories all the way through, or you can take them all one day at a time so that they're mostly in sync. Like you have a lot of control over what order you play Treasure of the Rudras in. And the game will, throughout the period of the game, teach you various suffixes and prefixes and such that you can use for your spells if you haven't found stuff that you can use just from things that you chose yourself. And obviously, you can just take that knowledge with you to the other stories because, hey, this is just text. I know these words. How long is it? Um, I would say it is about the same length as Final Fantasy VI, maybe. Hmm. Like I am looking for a game to play after Etrian Odyssey 4. It is definitely a good game. To beat dot com. Oh, good. Oh, it no. It is 29 hours, so it's either way longer than that or hours shorter than that. Yep. <laughs> I could see it being about that length, actually. Let's see how Let's see how long How Long to Beat thinks Final Fantasy 5 is. Yeah, I was comparing oh, to Final curious. Fantasy 6, but I want to know about 5. That's got to be... Way shorter than it is, right? <laughs> How long to beat thinks that Final Fantasy V is 32 hours long? <laughs> so when the Pixel Remaster came out, I beat it in one sitting, and it was like 14 hours. It's like not knowing speedrun tech, too. Well, so if you don't know the game at all, fight. I think that then Final Fantasy V is significantly everyone. longer than that. But you if you so? know it pretty well, then it is not that long. God knows, something like a battle network, the time goes down to a fourth as long if you know where to run to. Exactly. Yeah, it's that kind of situation. East 1 and 2 were planned as one game originally, and they're almost always sold as a pair. I only yeah. know this because Sara said this earlier. <laughs> yeah, you see, the reason that they split East 1 and 2 into two different games is because they ran out of budget and they couldn't really deal with how many discs it would take. So they released the first game as as is, as what the chunk that they had done for the discs they could afford, and then they used that money to make the second half of the game. I forgot to pull out my favorite bit. 
uh, during this stream. Yeah. Uh, I noticed Sonic Adventure 1 is on your top 100. Mm -hmm. uh, but I don't notice Sonic Adventure 2 up here. Explain. It is, two, it is three spaces down. Is it really? Look at 87. One moment. One <laughs> moment. There are two. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dyslexia is a bitch, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Every time I looked, I was like, nah, that's my brain taking the two from Resident Evil 2 and putting it on Sonic Adventure. <laughs> I mean, that's plausible, but that's not what's happening. <laughs> you're like, yeah, that's, you know, a thing you're doing, but that ain't real, bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dot, have you played have you played um Fury? Nope. I think it'd be hard on your hand, but it's a really tough Where's game. That You'd probably enjoy it somewhat. Emerald. Yeah, by virtue of the difficulty. <laughs> well, by virtue of you would be pressing certain buttons really fast, but it is a very hard oh, game. Meant, like, you would like. I think I might enjoy it because of the difficulty. In part, in part, but yeah. I feel like it would tickle your fancy in certain ways. It's hard to explain, like the gameplay. I've seen like five seconds of it, but that's not really enough to make an assessment. <laughs> I do think you'll like Treasure of the Rudras, though. Most people who like Square RPGs would like Treasure of the Rudras. And it's really something special as far as that goes. Yeah. Where's that damn play... Sonic Adventure 2? <laughs> Where's that damn Sonic Adventure 2? Um, <laughs> I do need to play... Uh... Because I, I've literally had Final Fantasy in my life since I was born. Because mm -hmm. we got one when it came out. But Hell the yeah. thing is, the ones that didn't come over when they came out originally, I never played. So I never played two, three, or five. Understandable. You definitely need to get around to that, though. I do. Don't don't force yourself with two. You'll know whether it's your thing. <laughs> like. Don't worry, I won't force myself. I'll just be in a 30 hour stream. Yeah, I'll just, I, so, that's what I was going to say. Like, please don't do one of your like one stream, three months, like 70 that's hours. That's all Dan long. does. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, Dan, like, <laughs> you know, those old DOS adventure games where you had to learn words and then you could use the words for someone else? Mm -hmm. Final Fantasy II has that system as one of the main dialogue systems. It is like way underbaked too. Yeah, it's like, it's, like, it's wasted potential for sure. They Man, improved they should it. Do a cool remaster of that. They improved yeah. it somewhat in the like later versions, although pixel remaster doesn't count since it's based on the original. By basically giving you a whole lot more words to work with, but even then, huh. it kind of adds to the confusion in some ways. Uh huh. Because like it doesn't necessarily tell you what words you need to use or what words you have used in all cases. That's really interesting. Man, I'm so looking forward to the Ghost Trick remaster. I was I was looking forward to it anyway, but when they announced that they were actually doing an arranged soundtrack, I was like, holy crap, that's the only thing I wanted. Yeah, Tarathiel, I just haven't gotten around to it. Just like Foxandra yeah. hasn't gotten around to Undertale. Is Ghost Trick that one game? Wait, Fox hasn't? Oh, right. I always forget that because Fox did so many freaking sands. The video, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> this is impossible. Yeah, it's difficult, right? Vox can do it way better. Yeah, only Vox and Undertale itself can do that. Yeah. I noticed number 55 and 56 are next to each other. Is this because they both end with online? <laughs> no, it's these were both very influential games of my life that I kind of had had enough of, but at the same time, I still love them so much. Fantasy Star Online 1 is like... No! No! It, <laughs> that was really weird timing. It's like Sara had just stopped. I was so confused. <laughs> like, uh, uh, so like, Fantasy Star Online one has just so much hit stun, and you are totally committed to every single move that you do. Like, it's that kind of game, and mm -hmm. it still has a lot of appeal, but it makes the game feel really slow for the kind of game it is now. But I love it. I still love it. What did you play it on? 
um, GameCube, and later I played Blue Burst on PC. Now, here's I a funny story. The, I played it on the Dreamcast. <laughs> yep, yep. Here's a what's funny the, story. What's the level cap? Um, I don't remember. It's, I got to that level minus one on the Dreamcast. Anyway, go on. I think it was now. lower in version one than it was in version two. Yeah, that um, sounds right. So I want to say it was 99, but it might have been. So here's the thing. I did Tarathiel. I don't anymore. It's back at my family's place. Anyway, um, I bought Fantasy Star Online for Dreamcast, and I got home and tried it, and the disc didn't work. And so we returned it and tried to get another copy of the same game, and the disc still didn't work. So I didn't get to play the Dreamcast version of Fantasy Star Online because we tried twice to get it, and it didn't work. I have no idea why. I never had any issue like that with any other Dreamcast game. Huh. Yeah, weird, right? Yeah. <laughs> For me, the only time I have major problems with Sega consoles and reading discs is when a local retro game store sells me a rotted version. <laughs> <laughs> of Panzer Dragoon for way too much. Oh no! Ooh. <laughs> oh, like, that oh, is rough. That's great. Oh, oh, it's not. Oh, that is disc rot. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like there is stuff in my list that is really high, but that I can't recommend to absolutely everyone because, like, Arcturus is not very accessible, even if you can find a copy and get the translation. Like. Um, Rich Crisps, I would say that with Dura Langrisser, if you can read Japanese, the best version to play is on Saturn or PS1. However, if you cannot read Japanese, the Super Nintendo version is your best bet. The Genesis version of Langrisser 2, Langrisser 2 is a different game. There is less content in Langrisser 2 on Genesis. It's still a good game, but Dura Langrisser improves every single aspect of Langrisser 2. So Durlangrisser is significantly more worth it. And unless you know the Japanese to play the updated versions from, you know, the later systems, Super Nintendo version's fine, really. And the fan translation is quite good, aside from a little bit too much swearing. They kind Hi, of... Vox. <laughs> Hi. Hey, Sorry. Vox. Like, how can I put it? They made some characters just curse up a storm unnecessarily, and it doesn't add anything. It's like I wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, that's just a truth about me. I try, but this is the best that you're going to get. <laughs> yeah. Have you Mr. played the first, the first game that they did, or the first strategy game? Gaia um, no Moncho on the, rest of the Gaia. PC Engine? I have played a little bit of it, and it is super interesting. Like The PC think, Engine one sucks. <laughs> I think that but, it's very difficult to play, but it is super interesting. And it is canon to Langrisser. Yeah, I think I knew that. And what, what's crazier is you know how they made a sequel to it? Um, Guy Frame, who is, which is um, more futuristic, but it's basically the same game otherwise. Like, it's set in the far future. Mm -hmm. That is also canon to Langrisser. And it That's turns cool. out it is not in the future of Langrisser. It is in the distant past of Langrisser. So, That's like, actually pretty thick. So, like, in Langrisser 4, like, at one point, there is an enemy that can get a guy frame, like, excavated and use it against you. And it's like, holy crap. In this fantasy setting, this guy's got a mech. And, like, that makes sense in the timeline. Yeah. I feel like, yeah, I played this. I played this because, you know, I was doing that PC Engine thing for, yeah, for, yeah. Two, for three years. <laughs> you got that PC Engine thing going on. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, I, just, I just noticed Star Control 2 as well. Yep. At 25. Yep. Star Control 2 is a really fine game. Uh, I still have to I, play that. I think I can. I think, I think enough time has passed that I can say this without it being a uh, oh no that's never gonna happen anyways ha. so uh one of my one of my happiest memories before the dive into the pandemic era was me hanging out at a taco bell watching you stream star control too oh 
<laughs> well, I'm just like, time. oh, I'm decompressing. Everything's nice. I'm just hanging out here by myself. That is <laughs> very sweet of you. And then Vox came down to Florida and caused it. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> it is sad. It's, it's a shame I came down and then left the pandemic in my wake. <laughs> yes. I was like, okay, well, you have to go now, Vox, because you caused the the wave that's happening, and we need to get you out of here before all air travel shut down. I, I, I love how we were so excited. We were like, wow, we found a, a really cheap flight, and, and I'm able to come down and visit. This was awesome, you know? We can do this every now and then because we found how affordable this is. And oh, man. How cool that oh, no. us friends who live so far away found <laughs> found out that it's actually pretty easy for us to visit each other. Oh. We got to do this again sometime <laughs> soon. Yeah. And then wow. I flew home. And then... You and played then that da -da from Mario again. RPG. <laughs> yes. Da -da. Da -da. <laughs> Yeah, little did we know that Vox was patient zero all along. <laughs> Wait, no, <Yes>. that's... <laughs> she traveled all across the U.S. and just read the whole thing. She, she, she got she the flew. Florida environment back into her bloodstream, and that's what caused it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. What a shame. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm I'm happy I did this list. I was worried that I would show this list off and you guys would be like, wait a second, most of this is mainstream. You're not a real gamer. What are you talking you about? Have you have Aerobiz on, on here. here. Like, <laughs> you're right, exactly. Steins Gates 4, Romancing Saga 3 is 2, Poppin' Music is up there. Salamander <laughs> 2. Princess yeah. Maker 2. Like. Right, Princess Maker 2. I mean, you don't even have, as far as I could see, once again, we've already proven I'm blind, but as far as I could tell, you don't have Final Fantasy 7 on here, right? No, just the remake. R right. At 50. Yeah, so I that totally noticed that too. <laughs> so, I did notice um, that earlier, but then I thought forgot about it now because I those aren't the same game. They are not the same <laughs> game at all. Not Remake is close, way better. But... Oh. <laughs> Whoa. I'm glad I'm on headphones. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's not like you're like, not like number one, Final Fantasy seven. Uh, number two, Mega uh, Man two. Would you uh, like to just stab me with a sword, please? I, you know what? I'm more interested in making that top 100 games than I am making my own genuine list. I, I'm sorry, Dot. All I have to stab you with is this automaton. It's it's a little pointy, I guess. Hang on, please. Hang on. Pointy. I'm not letting this go. Hang on. Dot, your number one's Final Fantasy IV. Come on. Yeah, well, Final Fantasy IV is number one. And then okay, Dark so Souls, and then Final Mega Man 2. Seven is number four on mine, and Mega Man Two is number nine. What do you want to say to me, Dan? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no life's been drawn four, to that's the That's completely sand. different. That's that's completely different. That's not the yeah, same. Nice, seven. nice, nice deflect. Look, all I'm saying is, I had multiple different managers at CVS, none of which were into gaming, and all of them played and loved Final Fantasy Seven. <laughs> Final like, Fantasy 7 oh, is the most good. popular, like, mainstream JRPG from that era, I think, ever. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. good, though. <laughs> oh, no, and I don't think it's bad, but I am saying if Sara was supposed... Like, she was expecting to get shot like, to death base, as a mainstream yeah, gamer. Yeah, yeah. You're saying that it's like the pumpkin spice latte. Of yes. Oh, yes. JRPGs. God, I no, hate yeah. spice lattes. <laughs> That's just the thing about so... me. I can't stand them. I don't think it's just those games. It's like, what if your top 10 list was number one, Final Fantasy VII, number two, Ocarina of Time, right. number three, Mega Man 2, what number if, what four, you like, though? Let her Super cook. Mario R uh, 64, number five, uh, Dark Souls 3, Number Three? six. Dark, you don't know anything <laughs> about Dark Souls. Three is the one you pick. <laughs> I, don't, I don't. I don't know who this person. I'm hey, hey at least at person. least she didn't say two. I feel like two would be the more offensive to most people. Uh, it's, it's not really offensive. <laughs> 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 
was the gonna... basic picks. Okay, fine. D Dark Souls one. Yeah, better. one. Whatever. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, one. Just okay. Seed. And then, uh, and then, then, and then, then, the, in... and then the slot oh, below the that has to be the Last of Us. Of course, no, the slot below that has to be Elden Ring, because oh, it's you... really great, but it's not as good as Dark Souls one <laughs> at some level. Mm. We. I'm. I'm giving you a. I'm giving you a. Hang on. I'm mm -hmm. gonna Google something. By the way, I have oh, no Skyrim, idea what my. That's right. Sky, I don't... Put Skyrim in the top ten. Of course. I don't know what my one hundred is. You can just finish me off, Dan. Oh, okay. <laughs> is is is? Are you going to have Elden Ring one slot below Dark Souls one? You you look at <laughs> look at my top one hundred. I'm I'm sending you my top one hundred. This is really funny. You keep you keep accidentally like needling me. <laughs> All I'm going to say about my top 100 list is as I struggled to think of a game I streamed in the last few years that I hadn't played before the stream that would go on my top 100 list. I'm like, number 100, Banjo Nuts and Bolts, just to drive Banjo fans insane, because that game actually is great. Yeah, I've heard good things about that. Yeah, yeah I I thought for the for years, I thought it was just a thing where... Um, people who were hating on Banjo and Banjo fans really liked it despite them because mm -hmm. that game does have a weird amount of venom for uh, like the platformers. But then I played it and I was like, oh no, this is actually a really great game. Why the hell did they make it so angry at its own fan base? Right. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'm looking at this list. It's very Look fancy. for Elden Ring. Get twice. <laughs> I will I will attempt to do this through my dyslexia. Okay. Is dot naughty right. or nice? No, see, I agree with that placement. Oh, okay. So, yeah. All right, well, we're good then. No, no, no. My statement's mostly about the reverse of that, frankly, where it's like, nothing can be as good as the original. Um, that, send, put it in the, in the private. No, it's just between us. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put it in the private. Don't put this on stream. There's like a chunk of the the image missing and sure sure it's, it's not fine. my birthday anyway yeah <laughs> i just i understand <laughs> she's like peace missing this is so i could do the the like wonder momo like face in the inside the zero hundred <laughs> you know wonder momo that's the first example people go to for that effect and not like the the mgm logo or something or sonic MGM lion yeah or sonic yeah. uh-huh But yeah, I don't know. I struggle to think of things that I streamed. Hmm. Thank you for the follow. Hey, Ixiet. Ixiet. Hey, look at that. Hmm. It did a little thing. <laughs> Interesting. Thank In you guys chat, so yeah. much for getting me to 1500. That is wild. I was so far away from it when we started the stream. I can't believe it. <laughs> Where were you? I... I honestly no longer remember, but I think I was like 30 or 40 short. Like, <laughs> let me see how many follows I've gotten during the stream so far. I think I can check that. Um, I think there's a way, yeah. Man. 33 follows. Nice. Holy crap. Thank what you, you guys. Think, what do you think about that? Oh man, I really enjoy streaming. Streaming's yeah, pretty cool. I could not make one of these lists. I I don't know. I'm getting a panic attack. <laughs> oh man, I want you to so badly. And like no, no one would be happy. Like the thing <laughs> is, like <laughs> that's what's so fun. Up through like twenty five or so, it was pretty easy for me to understand how I would order this list. And for the rest, I pretty much had to lean heavily on a bias sorter because, like, how the heck, it's right? It's too hard. Yeah. It's too hard. And, like, th this list's order would change in several ways, like, every minute, frankly. It's like, like if I randomly hold a hold, uh, hold you to one of these, like, oh, really, really, Sara? Really? Uh, Garo, Mark of the Wolves, you like it more than you like Sonic Adventure? <laughs> Are you sure about this? Uh, uh, like this this fighting game more than this you know yeah exactly uh, game who do you play See. mark of the wolves <laughs> uh just uh do an infinite forever 
yeah, with Terry. Who do you, Terry? Okay. But I oh, play, you, I play as the, the taunt thing. Yeah, that's ridiculous, right? I hate it. But yeah. like, I actually play as Hotaru and Rock. Hell yeah, those are my favorite characters. Like you might have noticed, that game is like you might have noticed the Hotaru poster in my room in the stream. Yeah, yeah. Actually, now that you mention it, <laughs> um, the not... that's like a great house rules game. I think. Yeah. I was looking at a tier list and I didn't realize that Kevin Ryan beats like most of the cast nine to one for some reason. He has, I don't know what's going on there. He has really insane mix up. And if you don't like, if you can't like recognize it, the frame, it starts to come out, it will hit you. Why would, well, I mean, that's true. Is it like also massively advantageous on or something like how, you know yeah, I mean? he has massive okay. advantage on most of his moves if, you know... Well, that'll do it. Yeah. And yeah, I know Lufia 1 ahead of Luf Lufia 2 is very strange, but the thing is, like, there's just a lot of history for me there, and I like the story more. As well as the music. I'm actually really interested. I'm really interested in trying Lufia 1. I watched, like, five minutes of it. And I was like, oh, this is... This is the best soundtrack I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> it's got such good vibes. Yeah. The the main problem with Lufia 1, honestly, is just the encounter rate. Like, you're going to be going through these dungeons, you walk pretty slow, and the encounter rate is very high. I... Hmm? Hmm. I'm just sitting... Mm. <laughs> What's up? Yeah, I'm just yeah. sitting here in this dimension imagining 100, and I'm like, I don't know if that'll out me as an ultra boomer or too new or... Mm. So Do both Shadow of the Colossuses end up on it? This is how much of a slut I am for some of these games. I would absolutely put that game on there twice, and that would upset everyone who thought the remaster ruined the original's imagery Yeah, well, Shadow of the Colossus. Well, Dan, uh. you worrying about this is the same as, you know, like how much I was worrying about this in silly ways. Like, I thought this was too normie because it's like the world that I was engrossed in. I think whatever you put down, there will be people who will really dig it. I've actually never played Twinkle Star Sprites. Really? Yeah. That's a fun one. Dan, why don't we play Twinkle Star Sprites against each other sometime soon? Okay, that sounds good. I'll have to look into it. Yeah, we can play that on Fight Yo, Cave. are those snacks? I'm sorry? Snacks? It was got there. Sa Sour Patch Kids. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll mute my mic now. <laughs> no, no, no it, was, it was fine. Also, also, Dan, whatever you do with your list, it will still be better than the mangling of the name of 68. That's, I don't know. I, I could easily have way more typos. Cast yeah, Lovania. No, this, is a this is Cast Yevania. Um, this is a really good list. This is a respectable list. Whatever I could potentially make would look degenerate compared to this. <laughs> but but really though, Vox's list is a mulligan because she hasn't played Undertale, so Yeah, she needs to play Undertale. <laughs> and I need to play chapter I... two of Delta Rune. Well, look, you know. Mm -hmm. lot, lot, lot of people sometimes, you know, they um, they like some things and they don't play them. Word number one, Undertale fan, excited to play the game for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> if I ever do stream it, that is what it's gonna, the title's just gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> Look, so so I've told the story. Undertale came out when I was like super fucking broke. And, like, couldn't just throw money on games. And I watched, like, five different Let's Plays of Undertale because it was cool. And I was like, oh, this seems actually pretty neat. And so I just watched a bunch of them. And then I just, you know, never... Then I eventually bought it. And then I just never got around to playing it myself. Yeah, most people will it. tell you don't play Undertale on stream. And there's very good reason for that. There's all kinds of bad raids and stuff that happened with Undertale. The same the same thing you're kind of concerned about with Yik, except worse. Uh, I I streamed Yik, and um... And it went great. Uh, I will stream the Yik update when it's finally out. Yes, Winter, it is. Silence me. 
I have to, I have to know. I have to know. Clearly, I have to know what the fuck they do to that. Clearly, you just have to have somebody uh, monitoring chat for you and completely filtering it out like you did with Dark Souls. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. Man, <laughs> it, it's funny because like I've said that I'm not really interested in Dark Souls and people just keep pressuring me and pressuring me. And I'm like, what, are you going to get Dot to guide me through the game? <laughs> I'll do it. But I, I, that's also easy for me to say because I'm not going to. <laughs> okay okay if you're saying you'll do it then i'm like okay maybe maybe okay like, yeah we'll, yeah, we'll talk we'll, about we'll it figure it out we'll do that <laughs> i have to stream undertale after i play a bunch of uh some more toho so i'm just like really good at dodging i okay. i think okay. that's oh, yeah, fair you're gonna love how undertale controls after playing shmups oh god <laughs> it's yeah. really really sluggish and like kind of loud so, I, I am I am aware. Um Vox, have you played Earthbound? Uh yeah, remember when I streamed uh Yik and I had a stream goal for Earthbound? <laughs> what the, what the yeah. fuck? I... <laughs> I I thought it was pretty fucking funny. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> There, yeah, I just stream called to play, play, uh, play Earthbound, and and uh, hey y'all, yeah, I've thanks, eaten this trash. If we hit this stream goal, I could eat real food. Yeah, <laughs> that was exactly what it was, and it was really fucking funny. Oh, it was like man. the reverse of it, and then I then I streamed uh, Earthbound finally, and uh, yeah, did you know Earthbound's good? And yeah. I never, I don't, I don't know if anyone knew again. that. <laughs> <laughs> What's funny is like my first experience with Earthbound is being like a teenager and playing it on an emulator because like I couldn't fucking get my parents to buy me Earthbound. And um, I, I went to the waterfall where there's the password mm -hmm. and it just didn't work. <laughs> and like I kept I kept looking up how it works and I'm like, OK. So like I just left it there and like I, I walked away from it for a while and I came back and I'm just like, OK, it just doesn't work. And so I couldn't figure out why. And I just never played it again until that stream, actually, years and years and years later, because I just never got around going back to doing it because it's like, you know, you play that much and then you get stuck. It's like, oh, whatever. That is interesting. That is... My brother actually had the, um, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. I was just going to say that is really interesting. Like, I was just going to repeat myself, really. Uh, my brother... You know, he's part of why I had RPGs from a very young age, but uh, he got Earthbound and uh, I got to play it on a real cartridge and that was really, really cool. Um, and then my friend borrowed the strategy guide and scratched all the scratch, uh, scratch and sniffs in the strategy <laughs> guide. And my brother was fucking pissed. <laughs> he's like, wow. what the fuck? <laughs> and ever wow. since then, he's had problems lending anything to anyone. <laughs> understandable <laughs> because i guess in his mind he was saving those to sniff them someday <laughs> far in the future <laughs> the answer was pizza spoiler alert <laughs> yeah spoiler alert it smells like pizza <laughs> oh my goodness ah <laughs> uh. I gotta, I gotta take meds. Are, are we wrapping it up? Yeah, uh, yeah, we should definitely wrap up. I cannot thank all of you enough for making this birthday so special. It means a lot to me. You guys mean a lot to me. I want you all to know that. Well, thank, thank you, you for, for inviting me. Yeah. So, so the deal here is generally, you know, we roll the credits and, oh, Dot's gone. Whoops, that's my fault. Am I gone? There you go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I am. <laughs> So, you know, we roll the credits and we do the raid, and obviously we're raiding Dr. O. Like, there's no question of it today. Yeah, yeah. But there's one more art. Yo, he's playing Mario 64! <laughs> he sure is. He sure oh! is. For people who don't know, I'm a huge Mario 64. The Dragon Cat Hell Man yeah. made another art, and it's... What? It's pixel art? It's <laughs> pixel art. Wow, um... I wasn't expecting that. Uh, let me let me pull it up.
I swear to God, if Dr. O is yet another person who's like, this is my first time playing this game. Look at this. I'm just going to be like, no, <laughs> it's not a bad Dr. O voice. Dragon Cat Man <laughs> yeah. tried to make me in Magical Drop style. Look at this. That, that is, is so, so cute. good. Bob, check this out. Sorry, in Magical Drop st <laughs> style. That, that, is, that is good. <laughs> it is very that cute. Is Thank good. you so much, Dragon Cat Man. You're you so did close so to being much a Newgrounds today. gif. I can't believe how much <laughs> stuff you did today, Dragon Cat Man. You worked hard. Like, that's incredible. So, <laughs> so uh, you three, what are you up to soon? What's coming up? Uh, no one wants to go first. <laughs> I'll go first. Um, okay. So Thursday, uh, like every Thursday, I do Big Think Dimension, a uh, weekly gaming news podcast where we talk about what games we've been playing, which is almost always retro stuff, except for uh, occasionally when a new game comes out that warrants our attention. Uh, and then Friday, I don't know. <laughs> uh, that that stuff is always announced on Thursday because it's always up in the air until, until the last minute. Um, but it may be our death stream which is a single s sitting stream of majora's mask for like 18 hours or something gosh uh yeah that may be friday but that's what i have going on <laughs> can you do the death stream line <laughs> i you know people are impressed by the duke nuka voice until it's not bit crushed <laughs> Oh man! Well, well, it's still. If it's, it's still called fun. a death stream, then why are they alive? <laughs> that's, a, that's that's still pretty good, honestly. It's really good. Yeah, like, you do hit it, like absolutely. <laughs> that's good. That's good. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, dot. Yeah, you're next in you the it. row. So why don't you t tell us what you're up to soon? Okay, so tomorrow. My friend Eltriok and I are racing to see who can beat Super Goals and Ghosts Deathless first. Uh, and that does mean both loops. We're not calling it after one. I think we have both beaten it dying only once now. So it should, in theory, happen any time now. But the game is really random if it turns out. <laughs> so that's probably going to be all night tomorrow. Yeah. Night. You know, I'm playing Etrian Odyssey for a bunch of other stuff, but the Super Ghouls and Ghosts is. Is. Not. Windows 98 shutdown sound. <laughs> oh, no. Bing did bong, you lose bing me? Bong. Yeah, you, we did. You just kind of totally. cut off in the middle of uh, <laughs> Super Ghouls and Ghosts is. Oh. Well, I don't remember what I was saying. Okay. Did, I, <laughs> did I say that I was also playing Etrian Odyssey? Uh, oh, I cut off again. Yes. <laughs> so you're playing Etrian Odyssey. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Thank you, Glover, for the raid. Although we're wrapping up, so you'll be sent along to another stream very shortly. Thank you, Dark Ride, for the happy birthday wish. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, so so Vox, what do you got to plug? Uh, well, this Wednesday, uh, Wednesday I play Toho games, and uh, this Wednesday is Double Dealing Character, is the one that I'm up to. Oh, and cool. I might try to play uh the mega mari rom hack afterwards the mega man rom hack except you play as Monarsa. which uh that seems up my alley absolutely and, um uh, and then you know like video games <laughs> video games sounds like a good plan yeah i'm interested in this my plan. <laughs> okay so i think that about wraps it up so <laughs> You guys can all say goodbye, I suppose. And we will we will call it. Bye, chat. Thank you for hanging hey. out with us. If you can hear me, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye, everyone. Thank you, Deadly Wolfguard, for the follow. Okay, so I will roll the credits of my stream and...
that will be that. Good night, everyone. Thank you so much. This was a wonderful birthday. Good night. Good night.